David. Hi, Dark. Hi, Wally. Hope you had a good day yesterday. Hi, Arboyo. How have you been, David? It's nice to see you again. I'm also gonna go live on TikTok. I don't know why. <laughs> Just because. Because I need to keep my access. Um, I have to go live two times within... Um, two times within two weeks to keep my access. So... Uh, that's what I'm doing. Um... So I'm not live there yet, but if I seem like I'm, you know, talking to someone that you can't see, it's probably TikTok. I'm not like, you know, I, I don't have a bunch of followers on TikTok, so it's unlikely to impact anything, <laughs> but yeah, everything's been fine. I, um, I've been, you know, just, just coping on the daily. Wait, was this? If you don't go live, they close your channel. They don't close your whole channel down. They just take away your ability to go live. Um, and it's probably temporary, but like, usually you have to have a thousand followers to go live. They're just trying something new with gaming, so. Yeah, I haven't pressed the live button over there yet, so. Yeah, and um, I could definitely stream like a more popular game on on TikTok, there are definitely more popular games to play, but, um, you know, I've never really, never really gone for, like, what the popular games are anyway, just in general. It just makes me ner nervous to go live on a new platform, because that's, you know, it's just how it is. It's hard to go new on a platform, a new platform. Yeah, it's just how, just how TikTok does their stuff. Um... I just doing some quick makeup. Go live isn't just hitting that record button. What do you mean? You mean like on TikTok? Like they have a barrier or whatever or warning with the box don't dock yourself when you open it oh yeah yeah okay okay yes oh perfect yeah because i have my yeah i always <laughs> i'm always i'm always i always attempt to be careful um i guess i should bring this out of the box okay all right I think the doxing items are, are gone. Okay, I have this for Zhao. Zhao isn't at home today. He's at work. He's usually, um, he's usually here on Wednesdays, but, uh, he's been hiring. He's been doing hiring. So we're gonna do, um, so I won't, I won't stream this on TikTok. I'll do this on, I'll just do this on Twitch. Um, and I need to put my mirror away. Okay. What's in the box? I'm gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Hold on. Let me post a... Uh... Picture on the internet first. I hope you've been staying warm. Sorry, I'm trying to take a picture. You know how that is. I am. Blurry. No, you won't make. Yeah, you haven't lost access.
No, so it's just the live, like TikTok live. Um, and you ever hate pictures of your face? Me too. Didn't even know they had a live feature. Yeah, so sometimes you're scrolling by and it'll like try to push you to watch their TikTok lives. Also, TikTok is really spotty with like their moderations. I don't know, it's a mess. Okay, I need to choose one of the pictures I've taken of my face. I'm just gonna need to go with this one, the last one I took. Sorry I'm not like on screen yet. I had a um I had a therapist appointment today too. So I had to do that this morning. That's why that's why I just had everything running later today. Um live now. When you go live with Twitch, you not pay attention to it. Yeah, yeah, no, that's what I'm doing today. Um, sorry, I need to turn this down. posted i posted a video yesterday but not the video that i've been needing to work on i was i was working on this video and then i was like i was like i'm never gonna finish this so i did a quick one i'm definitely learning um okay yeah so i'm gonna go live on hi milk i'm gonna go live on hi Ooh, that's large Dota T? What does that mean? Oh, dot, because dot age. Um, yeah, so Raboyo sent a box. What's in the box? We're gonna open the box. That's what she said. Um, <laughs> my hair back for this. Um, I have. Oh man, I'm having a lot of anxiety. Okay. I have my little headphones in. So I kind of have a little bit of a headache. There we go. All right. I have, I'm in on this ear. Okay. Hello. Hi. Hi friends. I haven't been, I haven't streamed since Friday. I skipped Saturday's stream. I have just not been feeling good. I have a Saturday stream scheduled for this weekend. Um, I wrote that I'm going to play Lethal Company with crowd control. I don't know who I'm going to play Lethal Company with, but I'm going to try to find someone to play with. I'm sure someone will play with me. Um, I just got to put out like 
Sailor. So first off, um, Raboyo sent me a box, which is very, very, very kind. It's on Saturday. Um, on Saturday during the day. Um, because I don't think I work, you know what? I don't think I work today either, but I'm just checking. I just feel like I know I can screw it up. If there's a way to screw things up, I will do it. Okay, yeah, no, I don't work on Saturday. Um, okay, so first off, Raboyo sent me a box, a Disneyland box, because he went to Disneyland. Um, yeah, check if it'll run on your computer. It seems like the kind of game that would have a lot of, like, memory leaks and stuff. Um, so first off, we have this beautiful up house. Look at this. It has, like, beads, uh, beads as the balloons. Mr. Joseph, 20 months, thank you so much. Isn't this sweet? Beep, boop, beep, bop, a deep, bop. Hope working and lurking is going well. You're awesome. Mr. Joseph, thank you so much. I hope your work goes well today. Happy Wednesday. Um... So yeah, this is the, the up house. It's a pin from Disney. We also have Goofy's Kitchen. Did you eat at a place called Goofy's Kitchen? Happy holidays to you. It's a Goofy pin. <laughs> now I have a I have a card for Molly the Cat and Jow underscore Quinn. You did? I love that. Hi Rain! How are you? <laughs> Felicity Strummer. That's me. Disney does have amazing pins and they've really leaned into it. Like, really, really leaned into it. Hope. <laughs> this is cute. Hope your holidays are for real ama amazing. <laughs> because no one deserves a perfect Christmas more than you. Merry Jingly, Raboya. Look at this. Hold on. <gasps> Look at the kitty! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god. Amazing. That's beautiful. It even has the, the lyrics on the back. Amazing. Thank you so much. I have Jows and Molly's here. Molly was in here earlier, but I sneezed and I scared her away. <laughs> Transcendent. And now we have a box, which is very nicely wrapped. Very nicely wrapped. I feel like I'm back at Lismas. How are you doing, Rain? Yeah, sorry I didn't stream. I haven't streamed since Friday. I've been, um, I've been, uh, I've been, I've been struggling. I've been struggling. Um, to be honest with you. Lissa, that's me. Oh my God. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, it looks like Molly! But she's a uh, she's got she's got tentacles. <laughs> oh, this is a Fleur kitten. Oh my god.
Thank you, Boyo. He also sent me a nice note. Thank you. <laughs> Molly the Fleur Kitten. <laughs> this is so her. Sorry. Thank you. It, it has been rough, but thank you for being here. Thank you. <laughs> thank you for the... <laughs> the Molly Fleur Kitten. Hi, Gravy. Yeah, it was very... Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, <laughs> this is perfect. This is perfect. I love her. I love her. How are you, Gravy? Good morning. I was just hoping, uh, Raboyo got, Raboyo got, uh, sent me some things from um, Disneyland. And so I was opening it. Hmm. I'm doing all right. We're going to play the dot age demo. I'm going to be honest. I played this yesterday, but I played it and I was like, I need to stream this. Bloodlust. It's that time to remind you how awesome we are. Give the gift of friendship. I don't know. Words are hard. Ba -da -da. You're awesome. Bloodlust, I love you. I hope you're doing well. How's work been going? How's everything been going? And thank you so much for Boyo. That's, it's very, 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 very kind of you and very kind words. Thank you so much. And thank you, Bloodlust, for resubscribing. I miss you. You haven't, you're, no, you work on the weekends. I was gonna try to rope you into lethal company on a Saturday. <laughs> Brother just mentioned me out of blue asking about a new game. Ooh, what's the game? I don't know why this is like being crusty. Pal world, yeah, it's blown up. Um, it's Pokemon with guns. Caligree list is awesome. That's very nice. Very kind. Okay, I'm gonna go live on um I'm gonna go live on TikTok too. Uh Gaming, I play indie games. Go live. Okay. Okay, I'm live on TikTok too. <laughs> We're gonna play this demo. Okay, so this is dot age. I do work on Saturday like 10 to 7, so not gonna be around at all. Yeah, that's fine. I know you've been I know you work a lot. I know you work a lot, but how has everything how has everything been? I hope that it works been better. I do also have, um, I have TikTok Live up. So we're gonna play this dot age demo. I did play it yesterday. Um, oh, and there's an ad break on Twitch too. Oops. Um, yeah, so uh, I'll wait for the ad break to start, but uh, I did play this yesterday, like I said. Um, it's, I think it's a single, like, one developer, like, one person made this. And it's a, like, colony sim survival. And it's really an interesting, like, it has interesting mechanics. Um, so I, I really liked the demo and it was really funny. So I'm going to play it on stream. Things have been good. I'm trying to wear some magic to get in next weekend and get a tattoo on my wrist of a cat. Which cat? Which cat? What does it look like? Um, did the, is the, is the ad break already done? Is the ad break already done? Is it going to be a flurkin? <laughs> look at this cat. Look at this cat Ravoyo sent me. So funny black one that passed the tattoo i want just reminds me for all oh, i love that that's sweet um if anyone checks out the tiktok live let me know if you can hear the game too because sometimes like sometimes i wonder okay so this is dot age but uh, i was telling Zhao about this game and it was up uh it was up yesterday and Joe uh, and I told him it was dot age and he was like oh I was trying to figure out how to pronounce I was wondering if it was dotage 
And I was like, oh yeah, it's dot age because when you open the game, that's what it says. So then I went on to tell him about the game and he was like, oh, it works. It works both ways. And I was like, what do you mean? No, it's dot age. And he was like, no, well, dotage. Dotage is a, a word. And I was like, what? He was like, it means like, in you know, like you're in your dotage. You're in like the end, that end of your age. And I was like, you gotta be fucking kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Anyway, Molly's also here. like uh problem <laughs> send list of physical stuff um i don't have like a see the problem is i don't have a uh box or i don't have a i don't have a box yet i've never found it add over thank you david uh hi jj i am all right um I am okay. I am day by day, but I played this. I played this demo yesterday and I loved it. So I was like, you know what? I need to play this for stream. Uh, we're also playing Witch Hand later. The developer sent me a key. Today I learned a new word. Yeah, I learned a new word as well. <laughs> Dotage. Um, but the game is like introduces itself to dot age a dot civilization might be a game about old people it's a game about an old guy actually so let me see settings um we're just gonna we're gonna keep everything normal we're gonna keep everything normal my pixels are crispy so i feel like the ui scale Maybe I should make it bigger. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay. We made the UI bigger. We'll see. Hi, Sabra. Okay. So let's play. Welcome to dotage. Uh, dot age. So this is a short demo to give you a taste of the game. Enjoy. Can y'all hear the game too? Like is everything hearable? Okay. So I reset my tutorial. So we're going to play the, tu the tutorial. Let me tell you the story of how our very own village was born. I was so young back then. This is the tale of a curse that we were destined to face and how we overcame it through cooperation. Okay, we're going to play this at difficult. My pixels are crispy. Harder events are relentless. Prepare to die. Difficulty multiplier 200%. Perfect. Perfect. Sucks I don't have more of a set schedule to try and plan time to play video games. Yeah, it's okay, though. It's okay, though. Uh, so I guess apparently you unlock other characters. I haven't played anything in so long. So I... Man, I wish I was interested in playing Power World. Dotage is a long and merciless game. By choosing the harder difficulty, you acknowledge you're ready to risk losing multiple times. Are you sure you want to play this difficulty? Yes. Done. Let me tell you a story. It begins before any of you were born. We had been traveling for days in strange lands. This is the story of how our village was born. The story of how we defeated the prophecy. What was the last game you played, Bloodlust? Probably, I'm going to guess Fortnite. That's the thing, I didn't even know that game was. I'm not that interested, but my brother gifted it to me. Yeah, so the problem is, so, um, I would be like, oh, let's hop on whenever you have a, some time off. But, uh, I, I don't really have much interest in it either. And, um, oh, DVD. Oh, yeah. DVD, that was it. Um, that was, I think that was the last game we played together too, Dead by Daylight. Uh, so, um, yeah, you also can't, so it's on Game Pass, but you can't cross-play from Game Pass to Steam. Which stinks. It all began in a lush, secluded valley that we found after several days of traveling. Just a few more steps, you slackers, we're almost there. 
My feet hurt. I've been hooked on Pal World. This game looks like fun. Yeah, this game, this game is fun. I've only played the demo. I don't own the game. Oh, I was so young then. I convinced some pips to follow me into the valley. This was it. This is the place I told you about. We have to stop here. You better not be lying about this new life, Elder. Are you playing on, uh, are you playing Pal World on Steam or on Game Pass Gravy? It looks like fun. It's just not really... Mickey and all of us are on Steam. Yeah, it just doesn't... I don't know. Can you play Dark Urge in this and do all the evil things? I think the Dark Urge is the... Is the world, like, closing in on you. Only scheduled till 4 p.m. Didn't leave work till 5. Ended up working out. Showering, crashing early. No, that's good, though. Survival and Pokemon games. Can I always try it on Game Pass first? Impertinent. Follow my example and all will be well. Now get to work. Can I always try on Game Pass first? It's just one of those things I know... See, I think I'll like it. I think I would like Pal World. Um, I just... I have so many other games already, you know? We started work straight away on the construction of our village. Okay. So, I think this is the first time I'm telling you this story, isn't it? You better pay attention because I'm not going to repeat this twice. So, this old man is telling the story about his village. Like, the he's remembering the story about the villi this village and how they got through disaster. I'm not going to repeat this twice. <laughs> the village was in a secluded, faraway valley. Use WASDA or hold right-click to move your view. Use the scroll wheel to zoom in. Pal World, because he's really into Pokemon, but he doesn't game too much either. Yeah, it's another one of those games that, like, would, takes a lot of time, right? Because it's, like, sur it's survival. I'm... Uh, there's so many other games. Yeah, there are just so many games. So many games to play. I'm I'm curious how long Pal World will... I'm curious how long Pal World will stick around. Raid, what did you what did you send me? Any gifts? Wait, what is this? <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. Super greedy cat supporter bundle. Thank you. Cat gifts. I mean, you need to eat. That's about the survival of it. Oh, really? Thank you, Rain. Super greedy cat supporter bundle. <laughs> cat platformer game? Oh my gosh, we'll have to play that. I was the elder of the new village. Let me tell you what I did to make it thrive. Thank you so much, Rain. I'm feeling that I woke up this morning, my kid left me a rose on my desk just because. Oh, I want to get the Dredge DLC and play that through. Yeah, I've heard, I've seen less, less positive things about the Dredge DLC as the original game, but I still want to play it too. The bivouac was our first structure to find the boundaries of our village where we could safely build, place on any available terrain near berry bushes. Okay. Um, so we want to place it near berry bushes because we need food. So let's put it here. Uh, this gets us the most berry bushes. Ah. Uh, yeah, okay, we're gonna put it here. That's so sweet. We pips used to la live in dwellings like this one. Hover over the dwelling, you'll see that it is already full of pips. Full of pips. We got four out of four. Pips, yes, my fellow villagers. I used to tell them what to do every day. Hmm. I remember the first time I sent a pip to get food. So I activate the, the bush, activate the bush. Pips follow my wise advice without question. The pip is now working. You can activate the tile again to remove pips. Pips work to produce resources daily. Hover over a building to see what it produces in the top right corner. So this produces grapes. I might force myself to play some games on Friday because it's my day off, even though I'll have to clean my house too. Yeah, thank you so much, Rain. We found a few bushes full of berries, enough to last us for the few first few days. Bushes have limited uses. Yeah, you definitely definitely need some relaxing time, but I completely understand. Like when 
when I'm going to play games, I feel like I need an open-ended amount of time. This is an old, old dot civilization game. Yeah, old, old man civilization. So he's like ordering everyone around to survive. We collected the resources we produced each day in a common pool in the village. Each pip ate one piece of food every day. Available food is automatically allocated. Will you have time to like do, do planting and stuff? Uh, like you did, like you have the last couple of years, Bloodlust. Uh, available food is automatically allocated. I made sure that each pip was assigned to their daily task. So three of them are, yeah, yeah, it's hard. I hope that, is there any way for them to start scheduling you five days a week? Like, or, or are you, um, or is it like, is it that there's not enough people or you just need to be there? I also recorded the current day and season. The game progresses in turn, so don't worry about time passing too quickly. Once I was satisfied with the daily task, we got right to work. Pass the turn by clicking on the sun. Okay. Uh. Is there anything else I can do? I don't think there's anything else I can do. No. Not for now. So many times for only five days a week, and then I'm mad because they scheduled me to close and immediately open the next day. <sighs> that doesn't make any sense, right? Because uh, if you burn out, if you burn out, you'll be useless. I'm not saying you in general. Anyone that burns out becomes unuseful right no it's not illegal it's it's the u.s <laughs> it's the u.s hold on there was more i remember it now building menu is divided into sections like the services section we need a thinker's post to help pips come up with new ideas so each structure had a different cost to build this one took a day and a few wood resources you're hiring a lot of people that's good that's good Buildings were used by pips to produce. This one produced one knowledge in one day. They also had special requirements. The post could not be placed immediately next to another building. Thinking pips needed silence. Carefully decided where to place the post. Okay, so we'll put it here. We'll put it here. This is kind of isolated, I think. In Belgium, you have to have eight hours of sleep. Yeah, no, the US, uh... The U.S. is lacking on worker protections. It took only one day to build. Hover over the building to see how many turns are left. You want to know how I made my decisions? I collected my wisdom in my Agepedia. Access it here. Here. Contains information about buildings, resources, and more. When you see a question mark icon on your cursor, you can access the Agepedia page for the hovered item. Take a look, then go back to your village and start building. We have tents, soil. I already, I already discovered all these because I played these in the, I played this demo previously. Bonfire, remedy rug, pharmacy stand, puddle, post, all of these things. Especially almost everywhere here. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So I have someone working on the thinkers post. We have. Let's have someone else work on getting food too. We have three berry bushes right now. And I guess I could build a signpost to extend. This is like a thing. You can expand your expand your area. Um. So this will give us two more berry bushes to survive. Universe Sim might be up your alley. Oh, I saw that. I saw that. I can't believe I forgot to mention the um the Caribbean sale. Okay. All right. Everyone's busy and we are moving on. Yeah, this game looks great. It is a, I think it's a single developer. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's their first game. It's, uh, it's a really, it's a really cool, it's fu a fun game. Something it seems like it would like 
take my hyper focus for like a full week. Some pips focused on harvesting knowledge we could use to discover new buildings. Activate the research button to see what we can do. Each building required the production of a certain amount of knowledge to be discovered. I alone chose where to focus the research efforts. All right, we're going for crude well. We gain access to even more brilliant ideas. I can't remember them now, but we had a lot of different ideas. I'm sure they'll come to me later. <gasps> hi, water dragon. Molly says hi too. <laughs> She's in her little hidey hole. Um, let's see. So now we're working on this. We're studying. We have one free nerd. I don't think we can build anything else. You know, what? I'm going to build a cabin. I'm going to build a cabin. Um, yeah, we're going to build a cabin. There we go. Build a cabin. <laughs> Appropriate. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so we're building a cabin. Okay, we're moving on. Everyone's busy. Okay. Uh, okay, everyone's still busy. You can see up here. Everyone's still busy. Next day, we're getting plenty of food. Certainly need to hydrate after all this farm work. That's for sure. We're learning how to make a crude well too, so we'll be able to hydrate more. So the difficulty comes when you start, um, you start getting uh, like, like chaos and like bad omens and stuff. Uh, it did not take too long to realize that we needed more pips. I was too old, but my fellow pips were healthy and fertile. It's time for the birds and bees talk. It's quite simple. All you need is a happy couple and some food. Any two free pips will do. <laughs> you need at least two free pips for this to work. Free some pips. Okay. Uh, we're gonna free, free the pips. Free you. And then... So now we can right click here and we can make a baby. Two pips would spend the next day making the baby. I hope everything is clear now. I will not explain again. <laughs> uh, okay. Spend the day doing that, buds. Good luck. Yay. Now the baby takes extra food. I wrote a book on 50 inventions that helped propel the economy and one thing hit me really hard how much electrical light helped our recent economy and life i would live and read if you had to work 60 hours for a few weeks to maybe light your house for 20 minutes or two hours max yeah yeah it's wild to think about and we i mean it's just part of our lives now we just take it for granted um Let's see. So now we have a baby growing up and now pregnancy is one day. Heck yeah. <laughs> Heck yeah. Of course. I love reading books that give me such impressions. Yeah, it's really interesting. So we have two pips available for work. I guess we can go back to food. Um, and I think, oh, we can't build a crude well just yet. Is there anything else we could do? I guess we could build a wood pile. Let's build a wood pile here. <laughs> As it should be. Wouldn't that be nice? Um, is there anything else? We have these forager. Uh, let's do. Let's do forager here to give them something to do. Um, here, don't work on that, work on this. Okay, so they're working on a wood pile, they're working on a forager thing. All right, next. Uh, so this will give us, like, it depends on what you forage for. Uh, the bushes are most effective for food. Okay. Now we have a now we have a baby. 
Oh, oh, a child. There's a child, but the child's useless. So it just runs around and eats your food until it grows up. I don't know how many days it takes, but uh, I wonder if you could see ailments <laughs> growing. <laughs> that is an ailment. Pip's recap. Can you? Oh, you can rename them. <gasps> you can rename them. Okay, so we have Brabba. Uh, three more turns afflicted by the growing ailment. <laughs> Mood. Um, okay, so they're growing, they're going for hemp, like, I guess for maybe rope and stuff. Uh, we're getting some food. The max you can have of any resource is 40, so we can, we can go lower on our food because we have 30 right now. 180 siblings born in the same year. Yeah, that, that, uh, that seems like a few too many for me personally. I don't know about y'all. Okay, so now we're done with a crude well, so we can build a well. A well, actually. Yum. Yeah, too many for me, too. Yeah, that's a lot of Christmas presents. Uh, okay, so that means we need to pick new research. Give them numbers of the good names will be gone. <laughs> uh, so this is I'm going to study the meeting point this has to do with like chaos and stuff so that'll that'll present itself shortly I'm sure um, we can build a well let's build a well uh Pull them off of the wood pile, maybe, and go to fix the well. Game looks like so much fun. Yeah, yeah, it is. I, I was close to buying it, but I bought a few games recently. <laughs> I bought a few games recently, so. Uh, wait, did I? Okay, next turn. <laughs> um. Yeah, so I figure I can wait a bit. I think it's only $14, $15, something like that. It's not bad. It's not a bad price. Um, I'm not even sure if it's in early access or what the deal is. Nice. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah, that sounds about right. Okay, so let's see. What is this? Lost pips? Dead pips? Lost? Okay, it's fine. Next day. Next day. It's okay. Okay, now we have a well. It's a roguelite. Um, yeah, I think so you're like uncovering memories it's a, more like a survival colony sim is what it feels like but i guess it has roguelite elements okay i have one pip available for work what are you doing just vibing that's fine um survival colony roguelite oh yeah yeah roguelite would probably be like the third here i wonder if i can make another to make another one don't ask any questions <laughs> it's fine don't worry about it don't worry about it okay all right now we have six colonists well okay once they once they you know grow up oop uh Right. This seems bad. <laughs> the apocalyptic vision, I remember it vividly. Here's where things start to go south. The visions came to me. I saw the future and the world is doomed. The apocalypse is coming. 
You brought us here to die? Well, obviously. <laughs> yes, and? Don't be stupid. We're here for a reason. We can stop this. Let me tell you about my prophecy. <laughs> According to what I saw, we will encounter many events in the near future. I carefully noted all the days of the year. This is the current day. Right here. I foresee an omen. The domain's threat will increase and nothing can be done about that. Master Roshi from Dragon Ball Z. I wrote down all my visions. Each one would come on a certain day. The first one was only a few days away. And a doom event waits us at the end. We must prepare for it. A very powerful event. A doom was destined to come in the near future. That seems bad. Season event, temperature change, unknown event. You said we find a new life here. Disrespectful fool, are you calling me a liar? Work hard and the dooms can be defeated. This is what I saw. Now that you all know about the prophecy, we need to work hard to survive. So this is the like fear domain. Thanks to my visions, I was able to warn everyone of what was about to happen. Visions of future events will appear here. My visions were tied to domains, the forces that threatened the village. This one was sleeping. So right now, fear is asleep, but when it wakes up, we're in a bit of a pickle. We're gonna be in a bit of a pickle there. I feel the old man should be neighbor boy. <laughs> the beard fits. I don't think I can, you know, I don't think I can name my, the, the old man. I think I can only name the um, people. Okay, so I need to build, I guess, uh, Oh, I can't build a meeting place yet. Right. It's not it. Uh, yeah, I'm not there yet. I'm not there yet. All I see is doom. Yeah, but like the good kind of doom. Probably. Okay, let's put someone over here on this wood pile. And then uh, this, this child is just running around. I guess we can like get some more hemp. I don't know. Uh. Here, you know what? Maybe we should change to seeds. I don't know. Confirm. Okay. We change to seeds. This tells you all the all the things that are going to change next turn. Um. Okay, so we're studying the meeting point. That's what it is. Okay, and here's our fear. We're... Uh, we're also playing 200% difficulty, so we're playing on the highest difficulty that's available on the demo. Because we like that. Tekken 8 this weekend. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm not a fighting game person, really. Uh, they had like a, they have like a launch event happening in London, but I didn't, I didn't reach out about it because... It wasn't really like, I don't know, it wasn't up my, uh, it was not my thing. Um, there's also Final Fantasy VII uh, Rebirth thing happening this weekend. If anyone wants to know <laughs> how to fumble the bag. Man, I really fumbled the bag of Square Enix, I'll tell you what. It's okay. It's completely my fault. Uh, it's just, you know, just me getting in my own way. So... I do a lot of that. <laughs> I do a lot of that. Um, let's see. So we have been playing Tekken since I was six. Yeah, there's a lot of really cool events in London. I think they opened it up to public. Like, open up to public. I did some research. Looks like Lethal Company swapped the min and max requirements for the GPU. Try loading up the game this week. Oh, that would be fun. That would be a good time. It is a disastrous, insane game. Uh, Lethal Company. Um, so I guess next, next turn. Yeah, next turn. Meeting point. Yes. Okay. So what else can we research? Um, a pud, a puddle? What else is there? We have cabin. 
I don't know what this is. Uh, cultivation. I guess we'll do community. Let's go with a puddle. Go with a puddle. Still needing to try, but there's hope. Yeah, the game isn't terribly expensive. I actually can't, I forget how much it was. Okay, so a meeting point. Plus one if dwelling building is with, within one square. So our dwelling is right here. So let's put this here. There we go. Okay. $10. Yeah, there you go. Um, okay, so we are gonna... Oh, uh-oh. Berries are gone. Let's stop looking for seeds and we'll fix our meeting point. I wonder when we'll have our fifth and sixth. Oh, we have five fizzy pips. That's nice. Yeah, I haven't played much Lethal Company, so I definitely want to get back into it. And I figure just like just putting it on my schedule, you know, I've been Okay, so we still have five. We have one children pip and then five adult pips. So let's see. So we need someone else on food because we're getting a bit low on food here. Do we have any other? Okay. Lethal Company is a good time if you don't take it too seriously. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Oh, hey, okay. So now we have six adult pips, which is good. That's great. Um, and we still have some... I guess maybe we could expand for no more berry bushes. I don't know. Ooh, I haven't actually looked at the rest of the map. Okay, so it's a relatively small map. I wonder if you can like, uncover any more like knock down some trees and stuff to uncover more land game started with let me tell you tales of my youth so is this a flashback yes yeah but he's like remembering as as the story is going on you know what i mean okay i want to pull in this i'll pull in this berry bush so we'll have a these signposts are what expand our like area i guess Okay, next. So is this flashback? It means you can't die, lose. Oh, you can definitely die. You can definitely die. I think, um, I'm not sure how they frame failure. It might be like, oh, okay. This guy, fear threat increases permanently by one because we saw a crow. Uh, and we're not, we hate crows. We're so not into that. We we had a crow sighting. Life is over as we know it. Taking seriously, I don't understand those two words next to each other. Um, yeah, I'm not sure how they frame like the failures. The event has arrived and the threat to the domain has increased. The bar above each domain measured its threat. When it reached its maximum, we were doomed. The domain, however, slept. When awake, it generated fear every day. The higher the threat, the higher the fear generated. But all was not lost. We could fight fear by creating hope. Not the crows. Not anything but the crows. We had special buildings to fend off events. It wasn't even a murder of crows. We only saw one. Okay. We are, are we already researched the meeting point. I guess we can research the relaxing stand now. Okay. Okay. So now we need to go. Do we have... Hmm... Okay, let's take one of them off of the berry bush or whatever. Now we have two and they can go to the meeting point and they can start generating hope. Uh, okay, cool. So now we're generating hope in the face of fear. Um, so the fear isn't adding, so that's good. So I guess we're generate, trying to generate more hope. Then we're trying to generate more hope than fear. Because when the next event comes up, you roll, basically. And um, 
Uh, and you either get a good event or a bad event. I have one surplus hope. That's good. I wonder how much how much surplus hope I can keep. Attempted murder. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. So we're... Okay, we currently have an 83% chance of obtaining a good event. Okay, right now we have 100%. So I'm hoping we're banking hope. <laughs> I hope for hope. Um, I guess maybe, okay, skip another day. Hi, Bendy, how are you? I like the music in this game. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure who did the music. So I think this is a single developer, like a one developer, but I'm not sure if they, uh, had like brought someone in to do the music you know what i mean it's really it's really fun this is a cool game uh i'll definitely buy it eventually <clears throat> i feel like i've spent i feel like i've spent a lot on games <laughs> in the last like couple weeks and i have a you know i have a lot to do Running around grabbing breakfast, the girlfriend is starting her first session today. I hope it goes well. <clears throat> um, let's see. So we're still okay. We're still moving on. We still have uh, still have some hope. We have seven surplus hope banked. That's good. We're still we're still thriving as it were we uh, although we're a bit low on the berries uh maybe i should take someone off wood production i see i see an unknown event coming upon us the vision is confusing but there's hope we can fight it okay so now i had another vision an unknown event it felt somewhat dangerous fortunately we had several days to prepare the vision had awakened the domain which had begun to generate fear too much hope, not enough berries. <laughs> Mood. Better produce some hope. We are producing hope. Yeah. We're doing pretty good. Okay, we have enough wood, I think. So we're gonna go for some more berries. <laughs> we're gonna go for some more berries. Uh, and we're getting some water as well. <laughs> as well, actually. Um, okay, so right now fear is being produced from threat but we're outdoing it with hope that's good that's good we have so much hope right now which is not this is not how my tutorial went yesterday i am on the 200 percent difficulty right now but again it is like de the demo six crows this is japanese high school volleyball team oh no this feels like a reference I had a bagel for breakfast and coffee. Right now it's cold coffee. Um, okay, we're doing we're doing okay. We're producing more berries than we're eating, at least for now. For now. Not sure how many berries we have left. Uh, we also do have um, ooh, research completed. A relaxing stand. What is this? Unknown event arrives in three days. So we're still producing hope. That's good. Okay, we're out of berries here. That's a problem. Um, we can change this to berries. So you get, um, you only get two berries from here. You get four berries from the bushes, but better than nothing, I guess. Um, bonfire consumed by water events tracks fire events i don't know what a bonfire does oh it turns okay we're gonna we're gonna learn the puddle because this is this cools us off and we probably have a summer coming i imagine okay 
so it's a relaxing stand requires hope maker within one heals three distress pips with infusion okay so i guess i can build this here there okay there you go okay so we're studying the puddle now Bam. Mm, I love this chair, but the the arms on it slide down frequently. So like I have to keep pulling them up. Which is kind of annoying for such an expensive chair, but okay. The Herman Miller Aeron. They've got I'm I imagine I imagine they've updated the, the armrest since then. Since I mean I think I don't know what I don't know. These these aren't the probably aren't the best armrests they could put on, but it's a nice chair still. Okay, we're out of berries, that's a problem. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Do we need, I guess we need another forager? A bit of a, bit of an issue. Okay, I guess we'll put another forager down for food. Uh, okay. Everything's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, this is looking good. Research completed. Okay, now we can put a puddle. Um, this is good for when, good for when there's a, oh, wait, we need to change this to food. And now take you off of here and then go here. What is everyone else doing? Oh, they're working on, I need like one more person, but they're working on, you know what? Take you off of here and go here, there. To the crude well, and this is a puddle. And this is good for, um, oh, they're building this. Right, right, they're building this, okay. They're building the puddle, it's fine. It's going okay, I promise. Swear. Okay, so this is not how my tutorial went last time. <laughs> it went much worse. Uh, I got a bad event. Unknown event incoming tonight. So this is a positive event. That doesn't look positive. Sometimes Fips will ask a question. We must use all our wisdom to decide what is best for the village. Think carefully as our decisions will have consequences. Each choice has several consequences. Each consequence may optionally have a chance of being selected. Okay. Brawla says they have a hidden talent. Should we allow it to blossom? Or should we remind them of their current role? I guess, sure. Doom? Question mark? Uh, I think they should let their talent blossom. Probably. Hopefully. What is your talent? Uh, frowny face. That's not great. Um, hidden talent choice fate of the village is in your hands okay consequences nothing okay cool so you've got a funny little hat now I think that's this this location oh it hasn't even been built yet Oh no, we're we're pretty low on food. We're pretty low on food. Um I guess maybe we could Maybe we could food? Food? Oh, yikes. Okay, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Okay, take them off of this because it's not hot yet. Uh, 
I don't know. Get go get some go get some wood maybe. I don't know. I don't know, fam. Oh wait, no. Uh, go study. There. I gotta go study. Can we eat the rich? I mean, that's always an option. That is always an option. We're studying food right now. Uh. Okay. Cool. They're still vibing. Um. So that surplus hope didn't help us very much. So we're just gonna let them sit one more time, and then we're gonna make them. I don't know. Produce some more food for us or something. I don't know. We need food. <laughs> we need food. Uh, because we're about to be out. <laughs> this is uh, we're 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 in a bit of a pickle here. Um, we witnessed hidden talent. Do we even know what the hidden talent was? I'm not even. I don't even know how to tell. I don't even know how to tell. Uh. Okay, we need another forager, I guess. We're gonna take them off of this and go here. Uh, and then build this. Okay, there we go. We could have that pickle. I was gonna say you're making me hungry, but I don't even like pickles. <laughs> I don't like pickles. Hold on. There. Now you guys can see the corner. Molly's just Molly, you know, Molly's a queen. She needs to be seen. You know what I mean? Okay. Um, so we're at five food. So I guess we're here. All right. We need to forage for more food. At least we're evens on food. So we have one person that's not doing anything. So what are you going to do? Uh, You know? Don't know. Don't know. I think uh, maybe just vibes. Maybe you're just gonna vibe. You have to season them. They taste bland. <laughs> yes, yes, I'm... Yes, I'm sure. He's doing nothing. I wonder if he's annoyed that he's unemployed. Uh, what was the game I was playing recently? Oh, New Cycle. I was playing New Cycle off stream. <laughs> Okay, uh, how's this going? Okay, we still have one person unemployed. Can we go to that other food? If we build a sign, we could get, go to some other food. Yeah, that's a good point. Um, here. Okay, there's no good way to get more than one, more than one there so we're gonna do this there we go hi squeezy okay so we got this one at least how are you doing I'm playing this demo and then we're playing witch hand afterwards which is a deck builder a rogue light deck builder i think uh the developer sent me a key and you can give swords to cats so how are you liking this demo i love this i played it i actually played it off stream yesterday and I was like, I need to play this on stream. Uh, it's good. You're spoiling me today. <laughs> I can feel it in my bones. The next season is coming upon us. Get ready for it. Okay. So now we have to get prepared for the heat. How are you going, Squeezy? What have you been playing lately? Anything in particular? I feel like, um... I think I struggle to I struggle to play any games off stream really. So over the weekend, because I didn't I was supposed to stream on Saturday and I didn't. Um I've been like many addicted to Pal World for the past few days. Yeah, a lot of people have said that. It's supposed to be good. I don't I don't like that there's no crossplay between Game Pass and um 
uh, Game Pass and Steam, you know? Because it's a game that uh, if if it had crossplay, I'd probably try it on Game Pass. But since it doesn't, like I haven't, I haven't put the time into it. Industry, hi. There's a Pokemon mod for Pal World. I saw that. The Elder had a vision of heat. Does that mean I need? Okay, so I'm gonna take one of these guys off of here and put them on this, and I'm gonna take you off of this and I'm gonna put you on the this thing. <laughs> Words. Okay. So we still have someone that's not doing anything. <sighs> Lazy. How are you, industry? Molly says hi, too. She's curled up like a little bug. Um. Yeah, so I really like the this is a this is a good demo. I think it's a single developer, I want to say. Especially because Cat Dad is playing too, so we can play together. Are y'all playing on um, Steam or on Game Pass? Cat World seemed interesting, but now I have no interest. Yeah, yeah. I don't really either. I, you know, I stand the people that want to play it. I never played Pokemon. I originally ignored Pal World on Steam, thinking I wouldn't care, but Cat Dad jumped right on it. Yeah, you're playing on Steam. Yeah, that kind of seems like the place to play. That's where I see a lot of, like, my friends playing. Um. Okay, we have one person that's not doing anything. I guess we could uh, get more food. What are you, why are you cursing? Why are you cursing to people? Oh, he's ordering everyone around. Right, that's funny. Okay. It's time to find your socks. Oh no. Is it work time? Okay. Um, what is this? Unlock new. Okay. So this is unlock. Okay. Oh, mini events. Oh, memory retrieved. Sometimes mini events will appear in the village. These are short events that have small effects, usually good. Okay. Healthy. Unlock with four points. New ailment. Healthy. Okay. And then happiness. Oh, that's a good ailment. It's not yet, but it will be soon. <laughs> Don't be late like Lissa. I like open world survival crafting games. That's what Pal World is. Just with casual, adorable slavery thrown in. <laughs> yeah, see, it sounds like something I would like. It's just, I know that I just don't have, I don't have enough time. I just don't have the time. So like buying the game just hasn't been on my, uh, on my radar. Got the game main screen to come up with no problems and need to test gameplay later. Oh, for Lethal Company. It'll see, still be there when you do have time. Yeah, I'm curious to see how much longevity it has. You know what I mean? I will be interested to see like how long people play it. Uh, I do like theoretically open world survival is my jam. Hey, tilt soil. Tend to hyper fixate and burn out on games. Uh, big same. Big old same. I did that with Rust, like really bad. I probably played, sorry, my ear's ringing. Uh, I probably played like, I don't know. I feel like I played like 80 hours in my first week of playing Rust. Um, but like over a month, I played like so many hours. And then I just, burnout out on gaming in general too. Oh, I do the same thing. Um, I do the same thing. I definitely, uh, yeah, it's ADHD magic. Man, I wish it felt like magic, you know? Do I have thinkers? I ideas hidden behind, behind other ideas. Okay. I guess we'll research this. The tomatoes. My more recent hyperfixation was GTA. Oh yeah, I remember that. You can catch other trainers. Wait, what? Really? Okay, so we're looking for... <laughs> you can catch other trainers? It's funny. So we're working on turning water into cold, I guess, to protect us from the heat that's incoming. You can butcher humans. Can you eat them? Uh, <laughs> Not that I would want to, but just, you know, just curious. Like, you know, if you can. 
Um, I don't think you can eat them, but you can eat the pals. Oh. Don't tempt- yeah, right? The game is adorable and brutal. Sounds- sounds like- yeah, I get why people- I get why people are playing it. Okay, season event arrives in two days. This is good. We're looking good here. Okay, we're all working on stuff. I guess we've done tilled soil. What is this? Gathering. I can put soil. Uh, I'll put soil out here. I don't know. Um, we'll take you off of this water and fix the soil. There we go. <laughs> Regarding the ADHD magic, mine also doesn't feel like magic most of the time. Ever since being diagnosed with ASD, I feel like the autism is magic and the ADHD is the evil stepsister. Yeah, I just had a, um, I had an appointment with my, uh, my mental health doctor today and he was like well you know i was gonna i was gonna up your adhd medicine but i think really your bigger problem right now is your like anxiety and depression and i was like yeah yeah that feels that feels feels a little bit more pressing right now which is wild because you know <laughs> adhd is pretty pressing but it is it is an absolute pain here's two it's so frustrating right like it doesn't feel it doesn't feel fair i had to wade through that in november i did ketamine therapy i've cons i am getting there i'm getting there because he's uh so my doctor's putting me on something i'm already on mirtazapine for um depression but um he is also he's gonna add venlafaxine which i'm a little bit nervous about because i've heard i don't know you know somehow those tiktoks always uh find you right so um i someone had posted a tiktok about venlafaxine and now i'm nervous about it but people said it was really tough but also it helped so much that like uh, the bad things outweigh the good, you know? I've wa I've wanted to do ketamine therapy for a long time. Um, it's so expensive. So expensive. Um, the problem is I feel, and like, you know, I, f I feel, I feel like I'm treatment resistant. You know what I mean? Like, I'll have a treatment that works for like, I have a, I have, I'll have a treatment that will work, will work really well, like, like for a month or two or three, you know, and I'll be like, oh my gosh, this is what I was supposed to feel like. Fantastic. And then it's, then it like drops off. Um, and then I feel worse than before. Cause I'm like, nothing is ever going to help. Nothing is ever going to really help. You know what I mean? Um, I have one person that's not doing anything. I guess maybe I could put them on food too. Okay. All right. Moving on. Sucks to not farther along and understand its effect on depression and make it more common, more affordable treatment. Yeah. Yeah. How, if you don't mind me asking, how long did you, oh God, how long did you do it? Okay. This is our heat. This is our heat. Depression hurts. Oh, it's so bad. And it doesn't just hurt you, you know, like, I feel like it, I feel like it really affects, like, my partner, you know? Like, I'm married. Seasonal threat is set to one plus year. Consequences in five days. Uh, yeah, so I feel like it hurts, like, my partner, too, because it's really hard not to talk about it. Um, okay, so this is plus two every day for five days. Six infusions in three weeks. They recommend starting there. See if you need up to 10. People need boosters after a few months. I haven't needed one. I actually continue to feel better. <sighs> Hearing stuff like that makes me want to just put it on a credit card. You know what I mean? Because it feels so... It feels like it's never ending. 
Like I'll never have, I'll never be better. Ever. <laughs> like I'll never, ever, ever be better. And I'll just, feels like it saved my life. <sighs> Maybe I need to talk to Jao about it. The feeling you're talking about was really weighing me down. Yeah, and knowing like what a disappointment you are and like knowing you can't do anything about it is really tough. You can most definitely empathize with that. Yeah, it just feels like there's, it feels like there's nothing, right? <laughs> Hi, Lily. Yeah, sorry, sorry to be emotional. Sorry to be emotional, Ugh, women. Um, Yeah, but like, it, it's so tough because it'll feel like, you know, you start a treatment and it's, um, <laughs> you start a treatment and feel like it's going well and then it, then it stops working and it feels worse than you did before. Um, because, uh, it just feels like nothing, like, even if something, like, starts to work, it'll stop, you know? But yeah, uh, the, thank you for sharing your experience with it, Squeezy. That, I, I think I might, I might talk to Jao about it and be like, listen, <laughs> listen. I... What is anhedonia? What is that? I don't know what that word means. Okay, so everyone is busy. I wonder if there's... Oh, yeah. Uh, most content not in the demo. That's fine. Okay. Empathize with you, and I'm really sorry you're going through it so hard. Yeah, thank you. I'm happy to tell you more details if you need. DM me anytime. Yeah, I actually might. Where do you... Where do you prefer... I DM you. Um, Discord is best. Okay, cool. All right, thank you. Yeah, it's um, I just I feel like I need like a light, <laughs> a light. Okay, so all of our berries are back. That's good. Um, I'm gonna take you off of this gathering post and put you on these berries. Uh, and then I'll take you off of this. And then I'll put you on the water. Because we also are turning water into cold, which is nice. Okay. Anhedonia is a diverse array of deficits in hedonic function, including reduced motivation or ability to experience pleasure. While earlier definitions emphasize the inability to experience pleasure, anhedonia is currently used by your sisters to refer to reduced motivation, reduced anticipatory pleasure, Reduced consumatory pleasure and deficits in reinforcement learning. Hey, look how happy they are. <gasps> Heard it described as numbness. Yeah, I haven't been doing anything for enjoyment at all. Like nothing. I've been turning down like social engagements. I haven't been reaching out for like, for like, uh, events like gaming events in London. Um, I, yeah, I'm literally just trying to make it to nighttime every day. Memory retrieve sickness domain to health. Sounds like doom. <laughs> Sometimes pips will find new resources in the surrounding village. What they are for may not be clear first, but keep researching new buildings and you'll find a use for all the resources you find. Doesn't phone known diseases threaten the village brought by mysterious forces pips can fall ill without even knowing what has struck them the sickness domain creates events that can render your pips useless or even kill them place buildings that increase health and make sure to cure the various diseases that may appear sickness domain is voracious and will feed on the slightest symptoms uh sorry to hear all that hope things improve thank you raziel yeah sorry to like <laughs> dump that on y'all dump that all on y'all it's just uh it's been extremely bad. Very, very, very bad lately. Um, so. <sighs> yeah. Okay, so let's come off this gathering thing. And I guess, no, not enough carrot. <sighs> it's like you don't care at all. Dumb. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty frustrating. It is. It is. I'll, I'll have to like, I'll have to talk to, 
Um, and if if anyone else uh, has experienced that you didn't dump it, I think a lot of people feel the way you do. And I'm always helped by hearing I'm not alone. So I'm sure I'm not the only one. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, thank you. Yeah, it's hard to feel like I hate to, I also hate to be like, oh, thank goodness someone else feels like this because like I don't no one no one should feel like this you know like <laughs> yeah no it's so like anti so like anti like what are you doing oh oh because part of the whole thing is feeling so bad about yourself and criticizing yourself and judging yourself and knowing someone else feels it gives you the chance to ease up a bit because you can't control it. Yeah, right. And other people that like are doing so or seem to be doing so well, you know, largely the same for what it's worth. I have one thing I'm looking forward to in a month. I kind of struggle through to each of those. Yeah, that's like, uh, like I said, I have my appointment with my therapist today and he's like, what do you have that you're looking forward to? And I usually have a couple things, but the only thing I could name was something that Jiao has in September that like he's bringing me along and I was like I don't have anything of my own to look forward to because I haven't like, you have to plan that stuff you have to like look forward to something to, like want to do it yeah yeah and it feels so bad because like I'm in, I'm in London, like, like I'm in one of the coolest. <laughs> like cities in the world, you know? Yeah. Yeah, so I haven't done like anything for myself. telling myself it can't last forever but like I'm 37 <laughs> and I've felt like this for most of my life and like you know um little events will like stave it off for a while like moving here an ad break oh it is a good time for an ad break moving here um moving here uh like staved off for another like you know month or whatever but then I was back on my back on my you know bad mental health grind <laughs> and then like i had a lot of really really good things sorry i'll wait to talk until the ad is over new resource discovered nature <laughs> memory retrieved cataclysm domain the earth has mind of its own there are natural natural calamities beyond your control beware of the nature domain for as the years pass the ground begins to rumble and unknown forces implode defending against nature events is difficult as these forces are beyond your control, plan accordingly and rebuild to survive the catastrophes that strike the village. Perhaps treating nature with respect will help. Okay. Um, let's see. Whew. Hey, ad breaks over. Yeah, so like a small things like, um, like, so moving here, like staved off for like a month or so, but then I was back on my crap. And then the first six months of 2023 were really good with like events and like um getting invited to really cool stuff and then like the last half of 2023 i pretty much like fumbled every bag that i could which i'm feeling at the beginning of this year uh with a couple events that like if i had responded if i'd done the right things for those events last year then i would be invited to like stuff that's happening now you know um but like the depression the add the all of it has like really yeah has has made it really tough to do things correctly you know so i'm basically just trying like just floating day to day Okay, so we have nature domain. These are new. I didn't see these in my last demo. 
So we have the health domain and the nature domain too. Interesting. Gain some nature by meditating. Oh, as a scientist fresh in their breath with experiments. <laughs> That's funny. I like that. Okay, so what are you up to? You're doing that. Okay, come off of here. Oh, we don't have enough carrot. Right. Uh, everyone's busy. It's fine. Whew. I don't remotely know the right thing to say, but we're here feeling supporting. Yeah, and I hate to put that on people, because, like, and then people are worried about me, and I don't want people to worry about me, because realistically, I will be okay. Um, I don't have chronic depression, but I went through a period of severe situational depression when I was in my 20s, living in London, that honestly nearly killed me. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Ooh, wild find the village gains four berries, so that's nice. Um, yeah, it's horrific. If it helps at all, you're awesome. Thank you. Relatable. Yeah, I'm only actively sub to three people. You're one. Thank you. I was just about to ask what the detailed cave was in the right corner. Then I realized it's Molly. That's my girl. I managed to get help. A huge part of it was exhaustion. Yeah, I kind of feel like I burned out. I kind of feel like I burned out. Um, it kind of happened, I feel like this big, 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 uh, like, this big, ca like, cavernous, like, depression started with me draw, uh, well, me taking a break from school. Um, hi, Meg. Um, yeah, me taking a break from school. Um, yeah. Okay, tomato field. Let's build a tomato field. How are you, Mac? Uh, so I feel like I've kind of been burned out since that. Like, that was the last time I felt like I was doing something. Like, really doing something for myself, you know? Like, had a plan. A big part of it for me was burnout, too. Yeah, yeah, I feel like I burned out and no matter how much time I take off, like no matter how many days I lay in bed, no matter how much like self-care I try to do, it is like it, there's no getting back to square one. And like I, um, I also had like a pretty, like for me, like successful, <laughs> Like, uh, like the COVID era, the COVID time was pretty good for me personally, you know, not even like work-wise, just like, I don't know. It was nice to not be expected to do this, that, and the other, you know, stop working at the end of August. I've taken the last five months off. Yeah. Uh, which, like, is uh, honestly what some of us need. <laughs> Two, three weeks is where I started to feel like I can go back to work in a modified way. <clears throat> yeah, I guess that's been, like, the one nice thing about this. Um, like, working at the pub has been, it's, like, such a low commitment job. <laughs> a low commitment job that like uh oh oh god oh hey low responsibility low commitment yeah like i have no responsibility i'm not even like i didn't even i'm not even supervisor oh 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 more bushes two berry shrubs berries overgrowth that was positive that was a positive a cheap hap happenstance. Yeah, low responsibility, low commitment. It's also hard that I've gotten to 37 and still don't know. I remember when I was 18 and, uh, well, maybe 17. And I was like talking to my mom about college and I was like, I don't know what I want to do in college. And she was like, she was like, no one really does. That's what, you know, that's what like becoming an adult is about. You know, you'll figure it out and you'll get there and it'll be fine. And um yeah 
Crazy burnouts, why I'm so bad with the revenge bedtime procrastination. Gotta do something to make me feel like I don't just live at work. Yeah, oh my gosh, absolutely, absolutely. I think um, Jao and I are kind of both like that too, which just makes your days harder to get through. It can take a long time for the brain to stop reacting the same way it was under severe stress. Hearing about how PTSD changes how the brain functions and it's a major issue to retrain it. Yeah, so I did, okay, so like kind of related. Um, probably why I've been feeling so, so, so bad lately. I had like, um, I was, I've never brought up like, like a trauma event basically that happened. Um, and I finally did to my mental health doctor and he like referred me, whatever. Anyway, so I jumped through all the, I went through all these hoops and I was like going through all these processes and like answering, you know, I was having all these appointments and then I finally got to like where I was supposed to be, right? To like the appointment where I was actually supposed to start talking about these things and I missed it. I missed the appointment and I thought to myself, okay, well, I'll just pay the like missing appointment fee and it's fine, but they closed my case completely. They closed my, they were like, sorry, we can't help. Like we need, we need someone to be ready to, for therapy. So we're closing your case, like good luck. <laughs> and I totally understand. I totally understand, but it's, it was so tough after like, it's already really hard for me to like make appointments and stuff and um and like get to things and like wake up every day and exist you know so i missed an appointment and like i was my case was closed and i was and that was like two weeks ago yeah and like i totally understand you know like it's different here like these things are on the nhs they can't have people like missing appointments I get it, but like that was so bad. I haven't even told Jao about it. Jao's not here. I haven't even told Jao about it. I just have completely not even mentioned it. I've been so, so embarrassed about it. We would get a 30 year career and eventually we got nothing. Yeah, well that that's what they thought it would be, you know? Our generation, I'm your age, about to be 38, was very much raised with the idea of the 30-year career. In reality, when we hit adulthood, that was no longer possible or a thing. And the truth is, those of us with ADHD are unlikely to find something that's the thing. Right, because we have a thing, and then we move on from the thing. Like, we get hyper-focused on a thing, and then we do the thing, and then we feel like we, you know, when we've done the thing enough, we're like, all right, I'm completely done with that, and I will never look at it again. Rise is more likely to be the thing right now and it changes absolutely 30 year career eventually got nothing it was a big setback folks going through some shit with add we also have some issues yeah so my doctor is going to send he's sending the he's sending like the like our consult from today to that particular place and um he was like listen i'm not you know i'm not making any promises but i just i hope like they'll understand like what you're going through to get here because i told him i regret it i and i told like obviously it's not his fault it's not their fault like i regretted ever bringing up like the thing to talk about because i gave myself a chance to fail and i failed i don't know why they do that it sounds mean to someone struggling yeah i i do understand i do understand because they can't have people canceling like there's so many people trying to get help you know get what we want of it and then we lose interest oh it happens so much like the thing is the thing i mean that's that's the thing about being like a gaming like creator too is that i'm like i've never been hyper focused on a game enough to like have made it five years of my career you know some people are really good at hype like focusing on one game and getting really good at it but I'm never, I never uh, play a game enough to get really good at it, I guess. I don't know. What is this? This is temperature. Okay, I don't think I need any more temperature. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Anyway, yeah, so right. Like I haven't told Jao about it, which I need. I probably should tell him about it today. I don't think he'll, he won't be mad at me. He'll, you know, it's the same thing. He'll understand like, Hey, man, I have to take breaks. 
Yeah, it's hard to feel like there's never anything we get super good at. Yeah, that's the thing. Like I'm like the epitome of like jack of all trades, master of none, because I've never gotten good enough at something. I've always been just good enough. You know, good, like passable. And everything, like all aspects of performing too. Like I didn't get jobs because I was the best. I got jobs because I showed up at work every single time. Uh, for it's worth, I heard the rest of the thing. The jack of all trades indicates it's better to be a jack of all trades than a master of one thing. <sighs> yeah, I guess. I guess uh, being a career that's stable, I just kind of loathe it at this stage. Yeah. I wonder if there's anything else I can unlock. No, I'm in the demo still. Sorry, sorry. This is like uh, this is a, just a lot of tough conversations. Um. Okay, we're looking pretty okay. Uh, I need more to me. Okay, we're just gonna we're gonna keep going. Yeah, yeah, sometimes it's, you know. Uh, I don't know. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Beware, a doom event is coming soon. Prepare for it, for it may be the end of the village. Look up to Da Vinci. It must have been uh, ADHD too. Yeah. So, whew, thanks for letting me get that off my chest. It's hard, uh, cause, uh, well, cause, you know, like I said, I had my mental health appointment earlier, but it's, it's hard to even, like, it's hard to fit all of that into, oh my god, plus six? It's hard to fit all that into one appointment, too. You know? Okay, come off of here and go, uh... What are you doing? Getting seeds? Maybe go for food. Maybe we should go for food. Confirm. Wait, actually, you know what? Come off of here and go here. Okay, so now we're getting more food. Um, We need... Maybe y'all go to the meeting spot. <laughs> He's yelling at everyone. This is millennials of Delta really she hand. Yeah, and, and like, oh my gosh. And I can't imagine being like Gen Z or Gen Alpha. Like growing up with like all of that, plus the pressure of, plus the pressure of like social media. I can't imagine. I can't imagine. Like we had social media pressure, but at least it didn't start until I was, oh my gosh, how do I combat this? Uh, uh, difference between our childhoods and adulthoods has really screwed us up for millennials specifically. <sighs> yeah, yeah, honestly. Um, okay, you do this. Supposed to graduate in 2008 when the crisis hit the first time. Oh, yeah really really pretty horrific what we've all been through you know Oof. oh sorry that was all it was just all really that's a lot sorry it's all a lot of a lot of stuff um how many people are free so i have two people free Okay, let's try to combat this. Oh my gosh, this is this is a big issue. <laughs> this is bad. This is big bad. Uh, come off of here and work on these tomats. It all keeps getting worse. Right? Like how? <laughs> like how? 
how and you know i mean the like income disparity in this i mean in the states but you know in a lot of places is just so has been so bad i feel like we can't really dig us ourselves out of this uh this ish this problem here um it just feels like something that should have been should have been addressed you know like the fact that ceos are out here making 300 percent of what their lowest paid workers are made but they're not working 300 percent harder you can't convince me of that so like why are why are ceos and shareholders getting paid so much and why are the people at the bottom losing their jobs positive economist predicted the situation the problem is the people in charge didn't care yeah and like there's nothing that we can do about it we just got an awesome deal and screwed up for the rest of us 300 percent seems low ball that was like 10 years ago so it's probably changed since then oh maybe 15 now that i think about it that was about 15 years ago cnn had a piece tracking the massive increases in co pay versus the minimal increase in average worker pay yeah and like and, and the fact that they have a lot of like minimum wage workers in on it like defending them is like i don't know how they managed i don't know how they managed but bezos is not an anomaly it shouldn't be able to happen yeah no i know i agree i agree no one should have that much money we shouldn't rely on those people. And we shouldn't rely on those people. That's why I have such... That's why I'm one of those people that has a problem with <laughs> Mr. Beast, you know? It's because no one should have that concentrate that much of concentrated wealth. And we shouldn't have to rely on someone's good nature to redistribute that wealth. We're lucky we do have some wealthy people like that. Like the, you know, the Gates Foundation, um uh mr beast for example um uh there's a few other like full philanthropic billionaires but we shouldn't have to trust those people because most of them aren't doing that jeff Bezos' ex-wife took half money and started funding causes yeah well the, the crazy i was just reading about this too jeff bezos his wife so she was the breadwinner when he was starting amazon and she like helped him start it um so like the the narrative we're kind of fed to from like you know jeff bezos's like ex-wife like oh she got half his money like that was that was her money too you know it's just one of those just another one like one of those things that like we're we're fed you know I read a great quote on Twitter. Quote on Twitter. It feels great. If one monkey hoard bananas gave nothing to other monkeys, we'd be studying them intensely. Why that happens with billionaires, we just let them be. Yeah, we don't have a choice, you know. Like, what can we? What can we do? Okay, so we're trying our best to outdo this. Okay, we have zero percent chance of obtaining a good event. I like to regardless getting fed up with that man. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. I'm sure. I'm sure he's just tiresome. Um yeah so like i just read about that recently this kind of feels like a waste of time if we're just gonna fail anyway <laughs> mood okay let's just put him on this instead all right <laughs> we have very low hope <laughs> mood don't even start on musk he's from my home country and i hate that hate it oh yeah 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 it's it's just shocking like it's shocking doob is coming tired had to work Vira Boyo, have a good day at work let me know how lethal company runs if it if it runs decent on your computer um so we have a doom event <laughs> this is bad zero percent chance of obtaining a good event there are no good billionaires. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause you have to, I mean, you have to exploit so many people to have that amount of wealth. 
whether you're a philanthropic billionaire or not, like, to have that amount of money, you have exploited people. One of the problems is rich people are able to isolate themselves and keep themselves from being exposed to what we're experiencing. Yeah, completely. Like, and people, I don't know, people will always rush to their defense. Like, oh, they don't actually have that much liquid wealth. Like, listen, those people will never, ever, ever, ever be poor. Ever, 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 ever in their life. They will never know what it's like. They, they are never in, they are never in danger of knowing what that's like. I don't care how much liquid wealth, li I don't care how much liquidity they have, like, they're never going to be poor. Careful, Swifties will come for you. I mean, yeah. I mean, she, she's the same thing. Like, you know, her and her uh, jet setting everywhere, like with her private jet. Like it's, you know, um, good for her. Good for her, I guess. Global warming is coming for us all. Just come for them last. Oh yeah, they'll be fine intellectually know what's happening but without seeing and understanding for themselves finding some way to empathize or sympathize they're unlikely to care or do anything about it yeah because they're never in danger of that they're never in danger of that ever i think this when this happens that's the end of our demo so i've been putting it off hey uh, what is that is that a s <laughs> strawberry we have strawberries. New resource. We've discovered strawberries. That's nice. Okay, we have one day. <sighs> Ads over, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right. We witnessed a wild find. Look at us all. Eat the rich. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we are... Something bad is going to happen tonight. It's fine. Honestly, it gives me hope. Rain, thank you. Okay. Uh, Something bad is happening. Okay, we've got a frowny face. New ailment. Rebellious. We have some rebellion. Thank you, Rain. Thank you so much. Thank you for the gifts up to David. And getting out the party manatee. Seriously rad. Okay, we're rebellious. That's... I burned my pun. <laughs> okay, we've got some rebellion. Oh, uh, mm. Oh no. Everyone is rebellious. What, are you gonna leave? Six pips are rebellious for 10 days. Traits hate. Mass riot. Oh, dear. Oh boy, yep, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Pips may be affected by ailments. After an event, a pip may be affected by an ailment. You will notice they're behaving strangely. An icon over their head will help you identify the ailment. There are dozens of different ailments. Some are good, some are pretty bad. Check the agepedia for more information on each ailment when you encounter a new one. Is this our fault? Were they listening to our conversation? I think so. I think... I ought to sleep now. Hope to catch another stream this week, but either way, all the love. Thank you, Reziel. Thank you for being here. Pips can be disabled by various effects, such as being stunned or refusing to work. While disabled, a pip won't be able to work for a few turns. You can check information about a specific pip by holding down the shift key and right-clicking on them. Mostly informative, but there's some actions available in the panel. Okay. So they're not gonna... Oh my gosh, they're holding signs! They're holding signs... <laughs> I see. I see an unknown event coming upon us. The vision is confusing. There is hope. We can fight it. Burn it down! Oh my gosh, that was your first doom. What, you want to know more? It's getting late. Come back and I'll tell you the rest of the story. 
Oh no! <laughs> Fight the game where the people protest, Lissa. Grandpa. <laughs> oh no! Well, <sighs> there's the demo. Demo complete. Down with the list establishment. <laughs> Dot age. Okay. Um, welp. Yeah, I will, I will own this game someday. I will own this game someday. Uh, that was fun. That was fun. All right. Uh, yeah. That's why I like Help, we're being oppressed. I'm never playing this game again. That was, that's good. That's good stuff. If you want to play the demo, you can too. And um, even from playing two different demos, I unlocked different things. So that was pretty cool. Um, Are you sure you want to quit? No, no, I want this game. It's fine. I'll have, oh, it's fine. It's fine. This is fine. I should use the restroom and then we're going to play Witch Hand. We're going to play Witch Hand, which I was sent the key from the developer. Uh, the developer is like a oh, ridiculously talented illustrator. Um, let's see. I'm looking at my Witch Hand. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So let me see. Let me read this email. Hold on. Because it. I was like, I'm sold. So... Card based city builder. Uh, they said uh, it's similar energy to stack lands, which I loved. Uh, witch hand is a lot of the same energy I think you'll enjoy. Some witch hand details. Card based city builder about managing villages of witches and defeating the void. Befriend rival factions or raid them for resources. Give swords to cats. <laughs> Use the bones of your enemies to fuel your spells. This is releasing February 7th, 2024. There is a demo available as well. Um, so yeah, the, um, he's an artist and, um, yeah, I think this is his first game. So, uh, I'm going to use the, hold on. Let me, let me load up which hand first. And then I'm going to use the restroom really quick. Which hand? This one. Let me see. Live info. Okay, I don't think I can modify my live info. Um, while I'm live. So I'm gonna stop my live and then just start it over again. And pause the live? Okay, pause. Okay, I'm pausing my live. Oh, I can't modify my live. Okay. Okay, and live. Yeah. End. Okay. Okay, so... Help, we're being oppressed! <laughs> okay, so... We can go live again. Oh no. Let me... Uh... Hand.exe. Topic gaming. Other games. Um. indie game which hand save okay um so i'm gonna go to i'm gonna go to the restroom real quick um so watch these clips and i'll be right back i might get i'm gonna get some coffee too i'll be right back have fun in the bathroom Too many video games, so my left wrist hurts. Uh, yeah, that's what you've been doing. Mm -hmm. 
it's my left wrist. Could you guys hear that I was I was doing a wanking motion, but I wasn't sure if you guys could see it, so I made a sound. I hope you could I hope you got from the sound that I was making that motion. Uh, I wasn't sure what sound to select. So does does that does that work for everyone? Basically, I was implying that uh, that self-pleasuring is the reason that her wrist was tired. Yes. No foreplay? Get your shit together, Owen! Jesus! So, we're doing salsa! <laughs> yeah, survival. No winners in. You're invisible. And hide. Go pickpocket her. Okay, take it. Steal. 23. Roll target 23. Crying out loud. <gasps> okay, let's go away. Let's get out of here. added to their moments badge you have five moments to capture this month moments refresh on august 1st oh my god we could do we could do one every fucking day <laughs> edit your moments after your stream uh hold on okay we can create moment okay a moment like this some people wear a lifetime okay i'm gonna click the button all right everyone thank you so much stream raiders wait scrumpy diddles do you play stream raiders or oxygen not included oh yeah i stream full time anyway i hope everyone nuts tonight <laughs> okay so this game it's community versus community so all the units being put down are put down by a community member of either one of the captains Oh my god, we're against Maku again. Sorry, boy. Sandra! Oh, oh my god. Someone played us. Um, someone played a sound alert. I forgot that I had it! I... God, I'm such an asshole. 
Sim career looking out creators to try out universe sim if you're interested oh did they put something on like twitter you, like tag me in it if it's on twitter hi david i think uh they have keys like on key mailer um post on discord we'll see on twitter okay um capture specific window let's, let's capture which hand shall we oh huh. My, uh, my camera moved. There we go. Kitty cat's back. And I'm back! And we're playing Witch Hand. Um, let's see, I'm gonna go live on TikTok again. Bam. Gaming. Topic is gaming. Go live. Bam. Okay. Uh, I'm also live on... TikTok. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Oh, yeah. I would like Universe Sim. I saw a video from them. Thank you. That's perfect. Okay, so this is Witch Hand. Yeah, sorry, like I was saying earlier, sorry about the dark conversation. I just, um, well, things have been tough, and also there's an event happening this weekend, like today, actually like i would have been involved in if it was like a year ago if i hadn't like you know fumbled the bag as a content creator so um yeah so that's been tough too that's like tough to face it's tough to face as uh you know someone who's someone who messed up a bit So this, I was sent this by the developer. If you accept this, I get a key, but you can give mine away to the community. Do you have a key? If you accept, um, witch. Yeah, so this is called Witch Hand. So I was sent a key by the developer. Oh, you already have the game. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Um, all right, so they have options. I turned down the music a bit and the sound. Um. I turn screen shake off and they have a few other accessibility options it looks like so let's try it oh thank you thank you thanks i i did forget which hand there we go early access indie deck builder Yeah, thank you. Oh, I absolutely uh, forgot. <laughs> yeah, thank you for tagging me, Rain. The music is already atmospheric. Yeah, yeah. So I think, I think this is also a single developer. Uh, sorry, not single like you know relationship status. I think it's just one one person made this, as far as I know. All right, new game. Celestial Witch. Witches of the first draw strength from the stars to empower the villages and increase production. Culinary Witch. Witches of the fourth cook well-balanced meals to boost the abilities of the familiars and villages. And Chaos Witch. Witches of the sixth use the skulls of their enemies to empower their already formidable strength. Familiars of the Chaos Witch cannot attack. Oh, interesting. Oh, there's also a peaceful mode. No enemies in peaceful mode. Enemy related achievements not attainable. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go with the Celestial Witch. I feel like this is like base game. Okay, let's start game. This is, I don't believe this is the demo. This is like the full game and it's releasing on February 7th. 
Stars above the ninth realm have ever been a mystery. With the lifting of the ninth's deadly haze came a revelation from those very stars, a portent of extinction. This is a fate that the celestial witches of the first do not agree with. Establish a foothold in the ninth. Use your mastery of the stars above to empower your villages. Defend against the evil of the ninth. Discover its source and correct the course of fate. Hi, Stabbins. Only one person listed on the Steam page. Seems like a one person game. Yeah, so, uh, so they, um, they sent me a key directly. And I, I emailed it back and said, you had me at give cats swords. <laughs> Sorry, I have something in my eye. You have me, you had me at give cats swords. Begin. Card pack click to open. A gift from your home realm. So we have a uh, witch. Wicked. Uh, much rides on your success here in the ninth realm. Okay, we have a star drop coin. The currency of the realms makes your wishes come true as long as those wishes involve buying something. We have explore, venture further into the ninth. Drag your witch to the explore card to find more cards. Okay, cool. Can do. Wait, what is the beacon? Combine with a land card and a witch to create a village. I gotta run an errand. I'll be back later. Yeah, thank you so much, Squeezy. Pack opening. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna explore. So this is like, um, uh, so the developer said it's, um, it has the same energy as like Stacklands. So if you've played Stacklands or seen it, um, this has a similar vibe. Sorry. Oh, it paused. Right. Okay. So we found a crystal, a common resource. Everyone needs a sword. Yeah. Agree. Just makes me think of, okay. We got reagents, vital component for witch spells. So we have her exploring. I have it wish list as stack. Oh, stack lands is good. Purchase new explore cards with star drop coins. Okay. Uh, combine with a witch to mine what's inside. Okay. So can I combine with a star drop coin? And then, oh wait. So bring star drop coin cards here to purchase an explore card. Okay. Um. Oh, whoops. Oh, gosh. Okay. Sorry. Hold on. I'm going to do this uh, full screen. Okay. Back. Continue. Okay. So, it says bring star drop coins here to purchase an explore card. Shift click. Auto purchase. Okay. Oh, whoops. Oh, gosh. Okay. Um. Oh, well, I'm mining a crystal deposit. Molly's being cute again. She's such a doll. Okay, I'm mining crystal deposit, so there's that. Okay, so we're gonna take her off. We have two crystals. Explore. Bring star drop coin, okay, without a witch. Okay, star drop coin to explore. Oh, I need two more, oh no. I need two more, um, I need two more star drop. Okay, I'm gonna mine a crystal deposit. I need two more star drop cards, I think. Oh, I need to move my, I think I need to move my, um. Uh, I need to move my camera. So we're gonna, sorry, it's, um, it's gonna, it's gonna struggle a little bit. There we go. Okay. So we'll move this up here and this up here because there's some info in the bottom left that like you'll probably want to see. Uh, Molly's being cute. If she's in the way of anything, let me know. She's, you know, she's just over here being adorable. There's a creepy Furby in the corner too, which is nice. Okay. So we've got, we've got our cute little cat. She does not have a sword. This kitty cat does not have a sword, as, as much as she would probably like to have one. All right, we're back to Witch Hand. Continue. Okay, we're mining this crystal deposit. Crystal deposit is gone. How do I... Um, We're still on day... Oh, the witching hour is upon us. Oh, what does that mean? The darkness is silent this night. That's good, I think. Day two begins. Okay, so time goes by. So I guess let's go on the beacon. Wait, how do I? 
Okay, so this says combined with a land card. Oh, I don't have a land card, right. So can I sell? Okay, so I'm gonna sell crystals to get star drop coins. And then I'm gonna go for another explore card. Perfect, now I'm gonna explore some more. There we go. Oh, that was easy to understand. <sighs> okay, all right, just breathe, Alyssa. Breathe, you're fine, everything's fine. Okay, now we're exploring. Okay, we got another crystal deposit. We're looking for a land card, I think, to build a village. Oh, Silver Sage, a critical ingredient in restorative spells. Unlike similar herbs from your homeland, these have a far more palatable taste. Yeah, that makes sense. That's fine. The art is beautiful. Yeah, this, um, so if you see, uh, if you follow them on Twitter, they, they do art for a number of games. As, as far as as far as I've seen. Uh, they've done art for a number of games. This is just their, their game developer endeavor. Um, the full game is out on the 7th, but there is a demo available. So you can go download the demo on Steam now, I think. Okay, we're getting some crystals. We'll be able to sell some more crystals for star drop coins and then be able to get another explore card so we can explore for some more all right now we have these crystals we have the silver sage we have reagents all right we're exploring some more yeah the art is beautiful i so cute and y'all hear the game too so we have some reagents um no, you, Zund! How are you? Okay, we have some Silver Sage. Music is cute. Yeah, this is really cute. Um, okay. Oh, we've got a forest, a potential home for a coven of witches. The forest here twists and breathes. In unfamiliar ways, alchemy ingredients are plentiful. Okay, I feel like a forest is a good place to make a village. We're making a village! How, how y'all? Doing okay. The witching hour is upon us. Okay, it's nighttime again. Uh, the darkness is silent this night. How cute is she? She's so cute. Hashtag village core. So let's see. So we have, this is our like money. The star drops are money. Um, this is crystals. I'm not sure what these are. These are cats. I want, I want cats. She looks like if Lissa was a witch. Thanks fam. Spells can create buildings to be slotted into villages. Open your spellbook by clicking the spellbook button or by pressing tab. Okay, tab. Click a spell in the spellbook to turn it into a card. Uh, sell excess spell cards with backspace. Uh, learn new spells by dragging potion cards to the spells button at the bottom of your screen. Okay, so... Summon familiar. Combine with the following cards to create a summon familiar. So we have an alchemist spell, two crystals, and one witch. Okay, so here's two crystals and a witch. We can make a spell. Right? Okay, we're making a spell. Summon familiar. We can summon cats. Yeah, we just need mana. Okay, so we have a forced village. A lot of buildings receive plus 10% potion production speed. Okay. Oh, shift click to give this a name. What's our village name? We don't have a good idea. Mollyville. <laughs> I was thinking that. I was thinking that, of course. <laughs> I usually, uh, I usually name villages like community. I like that. All right, Mollyville. All right, this is our village name. Okay, so we're working on a spell. The Molly shall be recognized. We, we recognize Molly. Um, hold on. For, for some reason, my game capture is a little too large. That's what she said. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, it's like cutting off the cute little witch in the corner. So we don't want that. Uh, let's move this up a little bit. Okay. 
Um, and we also, let's see. Um, uh, I'm also live on TikTok, which obviously you don't have to go over there, but, but I figured I may as well, um, go live with a new game. Uh, indie games don't really have much of a like a live presence on TikTok, but figured I may as well do it anyway. Naturally, she is queen. That's true. Uh, let's see. So we have Mollyville. We don't have any other building. Oh, Alchemist. Slow constant source of potions must be slotted into a village. Okay, so put the Alchemist in at the village okay so yeah this is this is uh this is giving stack lands energy and i love stack lands so okay we have a malchemist the actress who plays peter from yellowstone i've never seen yellowstone so that's quite a that's quite a username he got there that's that's a or Vanessa shot. Read a weird fact on Twitter. Northern Scandinavia is common to add cheese to your coffee. Really? Wait, wait, really? The darkness is silent this night. A letter arrives from your home realm. Uh, we have a letter. Click to open. Letter from the first. Dear sibling, the fate dictated by the stars must not come to pass. Uh, if your expedition in the ninth realm is not successful, I fear there's not a home for you to return to. Uh, we will do what we can, but the council and their wisdom is restricting our ability to aid you. They will require convincing. Until then, you must build your strength. It will surely not be long before your presence is noticed. Okay. Um, is there anything I can do with this? No, I think I'd probably just sell it, right? I'm going to sell it. <laughs> Recycling. Sell a letter from home. I got an achievement for selling my letter. <laughs> okay, so I feel like maybe... Um, can I sell this spell maybe? Did I get anything for that? I don't think I did. That's fine. Um, let's sell some, we're going to sell some crystal and some silver sage maybe. And we're going to get another explorer card. Cheese and coffee. I mean, some people put butter in their coffee. Yeah, I haven't seen Yellowstone. I actually don't know what kind of what kind of uh, show that is. Okay, we've got some reagents. We've got Mollyville, named after my adorable kitty cat. We're playing as a celestial witch. We have a crystal deposit, cheese and coffee. I'm ner I'm I'm nervous to click on that. <laughs> okay, we've got crystals. We'll go with the crystal deposit. I am not clicking that. Ooh, we have some potions. Okay, so we got some potion used to learn new spells. So we can look at our spell book. Beacon spell, moon drop times three, and a witch. Summoning beacon, uh, mana, reagents, and a witch. I wonder where we get mana. Okay, we, we've got some crystals. Bulletproof coffee, cheese sounds weird, but I'd try it. There's things I don't want to know in this world. Yeah, that, that uh, I'm not convinced. Okay, we're gonna do another explore. Maybe I can, oh, I can buy a spell like this. Mana extractor spell. Oh, yeah, learn that. Yeah, of course. Academic, learn a spell, the witching hour is upon us. The darkness is silent this night. Doesn't sound as bad as it sounds. I mean, I like cheese. Here's the thing. A quest arrives. Each night during the witching hour, the Council of Fates uh, bestows upon you a new quest. Completing them earns you the means to expand your influence. Ooh, which is something I need to do. So where's my quest? Okay, so mana extractor spell. So I need two crystal. Uh-oh. I sold my crystals <laughs> for an explore card. What is faded quest? Summon a familiar. <gasps> Uh-oh. Okay. We got this. We've got this. Uh-oh. A 
finished thing. Sweet cheese made of reindeer milk. Like, I like cheese in almost everything. Okay, we do have a crystal deposit. We need another crystal. Okay, I'm worried about not finishing this. Summon a familiar and be rewarded. Listen, I want a cat as bad as anyone. A voidling? Small and unfriendly. Any surviving enemies will deal damage to your witch at the end of the day. You can pause with the time tracker. Uh-oh. Uh, I have one damage and four health. Okay. Uh-oh. So the Voidling is a bad guy. Can I fight here? Hold on. Can I fight you? I think I can. And then also... Oh, gosh. Oh, Void Salt and Healing Touch. Ooh. Okay. So I need two crystals and a witch for the mana extractor spell. Okay. I'm learning. I'm learning. Now I want to try it. I'm curious. I'm definitely curious. Silver Sage times two, Reagents times one, and Witch. Okay, so I'm minus one health, but that's okay. Okay, we're trying to get mana. We're trying to get some mana so that we can summon a familiar for this quest. Mana, Reagents, and Witch. So we have Reagents. We just need mana. Okay, Mana Extractor. Crystals to create one mana. Uh-oh. Must be slotted into a village. Okay. We need some crystals. Uh-oh. I think we might not get there. We might not get the quest. This is what I get for selling my uh, crystals. So readily. Okay. Okay, so... I'm selling this and I guess I can sell it. Oh, uh oh, oh gosh. Okay, I have one more day to do my quest, I think. A quest arrives from the Council of Faith. Okay, I have a second quest. Defeat an enemy and be rewarded. Oh heck. Okay, so I'm gonna sell this and I guess I'll sell whatever. I'll sell another, mm, I'll sell another reagent. I'm sorry, okay. I have these for explore card. I'm going to try for another. Oh, I was going to sell a potion. That's what I was going to sell. Darn. Um, I have 122, 120 sec. Oh, a voidling. Oh, God. Okay. Okay, so I have a voidling, which is a bad guy. I just need a crystal. Oh, no. I need Chris. I need one more crystal for the mana extractor. Please, please. Oh, shoot. No. Uh, okay. Well, um, this will be one of my quests. Defeat an enemy. It's going to take away one of my health. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. Um, hey, I got a pack of cards. Moon drops are used to summon beacons. Use beacons to create new villages. I got a star drop coin. Okay, I have two star drop coins. That's good. I can sell like another reagent maybe. And then another explorer. Okay, and now we'll explore for some more crystals. Okay, moon drop used to increase your influence in the ninth. We only have 60 seconds to finish this quest, so we might not finish it. Because we need mana for it. Oh, celestial dew? Oh, that seems nice, I think. Crystal deposit. Okay, this is what we need. Here, take the explore card off. Get another crystal for mana. Okay, we have 30 seconds. I don't think we're gonna make it, but I did try my best. Crystal, okay, there we go. Um, I do need to like somehow heal myself too. Uh. Healing touch. I need silver sage. I, I sold one of my <laughs> sold one of my silver sage. Not ideal, I don't think. We're making some. Oh, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. I don't drink coffee normally, but it's a weird one. I need to try it. Um. So someone at my pub puts. Um. Okay. We failed this quest, but it's fine. Probably. Quest arrives from the Council of Fates. This one casts a spell that creates a building. Oh, barons, the perfect place to train, combined with a beacon, mana, an invaluable resource. 
So we can still summon a familiar though. Mana, reagent, and a witch. Okay, so that is mana, reagent, and a witch. And then we summon a familiar. There we go. We didn't do it on time, but we are going to summon a familiar because I really want a cat. Um, okay. We are creating a familiar. Um, so these are all of my, so I guess I can sell these cards and just pop them back up. Okay, sell this. Okay, we got another random potion. Uh, mana extractor spell, summon familiar. So we're summoning a familiar. We have a familiar! <gasps> Imbued with a fragment of its witch's power cannot cast spells. Oh my gosh, I love you! Shift click to give this familiar a name. Smolly? <laughs> Smolly? Yes, Molly. There we go. This is Molly, sweet baby. Let's, let's be, let's be besties. Oh, I love her. <laughs> Dutiful, reliable, cute. Hold on, I want to pause. Wait, okay, I'm paused. Okay, we're paused. Okay, let's take a look here. Okay, so we have potions. I think I can purchase a new spell. Shift click to auto purchase with existing potions. We have a Molly, look at the baby. Look at the sweet baby. Those are the cheese thing in game. <laughs> okay, I'll read about it when I or in Discord. Yeah, sorry, I figured that's what you meant. Um, okay, so we're paused. Um, hi, sushi. Sushi's here. We've been. We were talking about cheese and coffee, which is apparently a finished thing, which we have learned about. Uh, so this is um early access for. This deck builder called Witch Hand. I, uh, an artist. I think this is his first game, but, um, emailed me directly to try this game. And the art is beautiful. Um, and the way he introduced it, he said it, was, it has the same energy as Stacklands. Um, in the list of like things you can do in the game, uh, he said you can give swords to cats. So I was like, sold um yeah so there is a demo available on steam and this game is releasing on february 7th so we are playing some of it we are playing some of it so thank you thank you to the developer for um for giving us this uh this opportunity to try a new game i love deck builders um i love roguelites i love Stacklands. uh i haven't played Stacklands in a while but it's a great game. I was going to do a video on it, but yeah, y'all know me. Okay, so we have Molly the Familiar. Yeah, how are you, Sushi? It's nice to see you. Cheese and coffee. I don't know if I could finish it. Uh, so, yeah. So the, the art is gorgeous, of course, as you can see. Um, and so far, so far it's been... I mean, it's one of those that's like, it's introducing itself really well. Um, so do I want another village? Do I want another village? Moon drop. What do I do with a moon drop? Do I like... A beacon spell. Three moon drops and a witch. Okay, so I keep the moon drop close at hand. I can maybe buy another spell. Oh! Um, and also I'm getting quests. So my quests are to, um, my quest is to, uh, learn a spell that, um, can make a building. Changing the little Nigiri's celestial do. <laughs> um, probably a market. Market feels, yeah, market feels like a good spell to learn. And then, um, three crystals so we'll need some more star drops which is money um 
celestial dew. <laughs> we need to keep the silver sage, I think. Maybe we can sell reagent. We'll sell summon familiar. Doesn't give us anything, but just gets it off of the map. Void salts. I hate to get rid of it. You know what? Let's sell one potion. That'll give us the star drop coins we need for another explore card. So now we can explore and unpause. There we go. Cheers. So we're going to try to cast a spell that creates a building. Okay, so we have a meadow, a potential home for a coven of witches. Silver Sage grows well here. This game looks cute, so I downloaded the demo. I think it'll give it a try after work on Friday when I have off. Yes, absolutely. Ooh, Silver Sage. So we have a meadow and barrens as potential villages. Oops. Okay, we have a crystal deposit. This is what we need. Uh, we need three crystals and a star drop coin. We have a familiar, sweet baby familiar. And I, um, two of my Healy Bops are gone. Yeah, this game is, this is cute. I don't know how much it is or will be, but it is releasing on February the 7th. So we need crystals and we need a, uh-oh, witching hour. I put it on my wish list. Yeah, like if, um, if you're not gonna buy it, it's putting it on your wish list. Did you name it Molly? Yeah, I did name her Molly. You can name your um, you can name your villages, and you can name your familiars. Building production can be paused and unpaused by clicking the toggle. Okay, hold on. Pause. Oh no, pause this. Sorry. Um. Yeah. So. Oh, we did have two crystals. We have two crystals here. Oh my god, I feel like a dummy. Yeah, definitely put it on your uh, put it on your wish list. It helps like it helps um, increase its ranking on Steam too. Lisa only needs a witch hat, and she looks exactly like the witch in the game. Hold on, where are we at? Uh. <laughs> I used to have hair that color. I did have hair that color. Right now, it's more like a salmon. I need to re. I need to tone it, but. My hair has been in quite a state. <laughs> okay, so we need the market spell. So we need one. Okay, I'm going to sell this potion. I hate to get rid of the potion, but uh, we're paused. Okay, so three crystals and a star drop coin and a witch. And now we'll get a market. And that'll finish this quest and we'll get some cards. Shiny special edition version of that card. Oh my God. Can you imagine like a... Physical edition. Um, I would love another crystal so he gets more mana. So we have this spell book and these are all my spells that I know. Oh, sorry, they're right behind me. They're behind my face, of course. Which hand listen to community edition? <laughs> Yeah, it's really cute. Okay, so we finished this quest. So we got another moon drop. That's good. And we got a star drop coin. More money. And we got another star drop coin. More money. Okay, hold on. Pause this. Okay, we're paused. I'm pausing more. Uh, Bring crystal as a tribute to the Council of Fates. Okay, so we do have two crystals. Uh, So we'll bring them two crystals for tribute. Buy with a familiar and a mana to create a merchant. Merchants may trade with foreign cities. Must be slotted into a village. So I just need another moon drop. So the market, I, I want another familiar. So we'll need some more crystals. I also need to heal. So this says silver sage grows well here. So we're gonna try to make a village oh right wait hold on uh sorry healing touch silver sage reagents and a witch so i need healing like my witch needs healing i usually have four hearts and right now i have two which is a problem so there we go so we're making okay we gave them two crystals okay i can press pause to uh space to pause we got another moon drop. Perfect. We got a star drop coin and a star drop coin. So we have three moon drops. So we can make a 
we can make a beacon and then we can make a new village in a meadow i think this says it's the perfect place to train but i think we should probably do healing first so we can get rid of this those are just like um a market would go well in the meadow maybe possibly celestial dew is that an elvis presley song pretty bad with elvis presley songs all right so we've got healing i healed i healed okay it's perfect now we get rid of that card it reminds me of one okay so now we have the beacon spell we just need moon drops and the witch so now we're gonna make a beacon and then we can settle in the meadow i guess Seems, seems good. We have Mollyville. What are we going to name our next village? Okay. Summoning beacon. So now they're summoning a beacon. Oh, wait. Summoning a beacon. Okay. So we'll get rid of the beacon spell. Uh, maybe another familiar. Do we have more mana? No. We need... Bloodlust village. <laughs> Bloodlust. Is there anything I haven't made? alchemist no we have an alchemist um i guess we could uh, <laughs> okay we're gonna learn another spell um population growth do we need food for them trading training camp let's do a training camp let's make a training camp yeah let's learn the training camp spell let's do that Lustia. Hmm. Okay. So, all right, we're letting the summoning beacon run. We've done all our quests. Molly's vibin'. Um, I'm gonna want to summon another familiar because I'm gonna have to put this familiar with the market. Combined with familiar and mana to create a merchant. Although I need to get mana too. So maybe... Um, I'll do this. I get a new explorer card. I'll explore as well. Hopefully I won't get any voidlings. Cause, oh well, oh wait. I do have health. So we're good. We're A-OK. -okay. okay, so I have more Celestial Dew. And another Baron's card. Which is another place that I can settle. We have another Baron's card. I don't think I need all of those. I can probably sell them, right? I was kind of hoping for a crystal deposit. Contains forgotten treasures. Oh, the witching hour is upon us. The darkness is silent this night. The moon is full. The council offers a boon for a price. Okay. Star drop coin times 20? Right mouse button to lock a card in place. Okay, so we're going to create a village in the meadow. Hi, Kate. We're going to create a village in the meadow. Maybe that will give us more money. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how. Uh, okay, so right mouse button will lock a card. So let's lock this here. We have a potion. Um... How'd you do? <gasps> With which? With my demo? Meadow Village. Aww. So we're gonna combine with... Oh, gosh. Okay, so I need... I'm gonna sell this so that I have three star drop coins. We're gonna do another explorer because I need crystals. Um, can I explore with my cat? Does that make it happen faster? I'm actually not sure. <clears throat> I don't know if I can get... Oh, Silver Sage. That'll help heal us if we need help. Um. Oh, we got a Voidling. Okay, so we've got to fight the Voidling. Okay, there is a Crystal Deposit. We're going to fight the Voidling together. Let's see who loses a health. <laughs> Hopefully not the Familiar. Okay, void salts, and now to the crystal deposit. 
I wonder if putting the familiar with the witch helps it go faster. So we do have a market here. We have a crystal. Um, I'm trying to get enough crystals to make a mana. <clears throat> How are you doing, Kate? Okay, crystal deposit is done. Mana. Okay, me and Molly just vibing. We have one star drop coin. Um, I, I don't know. I don't know if I'll get... Is training camp spell three crystals? The witching hour is upon us. All right, nighttime. Okay. A quest arrives. I'm doing better. Had a rough patch with my mental health. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I feel it. Shift click on the explorer and spells buttons to complete the transaction automatically. Okay. Shift click on explorer and spells. That's nice. Shift click. Okay. We have a potion and a mana. So we're going to combine this. I'm so sorry, Molly. I guess you're becoming a merchant. Um, maybe I could uh, population growth crystal quarry. Oh, yes. A crystal quarry spell. Yeah. Let's let's get a. OK, so we need more. OK, <gasps> Molly, the merchant, a familiar with a love of money may trade with foreign cities. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look at Molly with the money around her. Five days in an inpatient facility. Oh gosh, I'm so sorry. I'm I'm glad that uh, you were able to get the help. Okay, are you doing... Um, I hope you're doing better now. Um, so Molly, I guess... Uh, And go to the ruins? Sh sure. Go to the ruins. Yeah, I hope you're doing much better. I can't imagine. Okay. Um. Do we have any... We probably need to, like, explore more. To get more crystals. Put me on the god children's, like, gabapentin and hydroxyzine for my panic attacks and ADHD. Hi, John Yu. Um, yes, yeah, so this is, this is, um, this is Witch Hand, a uh, new rogue-like deck builder. It's, this is, this is really cute. It's a really good, like, user experience so far. <laughs> it's been fun. And the art is beautiful. Okay, so... Oh, so now to learn new spells, I need two potions instead of just one. Molly's exploring the ruins. She's a merchant. She's doing so good. And I need two more star drop coins. I'm going to sell a Baron's card. I'm going to sell my two Baron's cards. Um, and I'm going to get another Explorer card. And we're going to explore. Sorry, I was pausing. Um, yeah, I, I, hope, uh, I, hope, I hope you're doing all right. I don't have two reagents. The mental health hospital I did a week internship in gave everyone all you could eat soft ice cream. That's all I did there. <laughs> Okay, so we have the planes. Oh, we have a star drop coin at the ruins. <gasps> Molly's making star drop coins. My God, what a queen. Okay, we've got a crystal deposit. That's good. That can give us a crystal quarry. Or crystals for the crystal quarry. Okay, so now we can go to the crystal deposit. Oops. Uh, that, that doesn't do it. Okay. Um, I wonder if it does different things in different places. Oh, we have a mana as well. I forget what. Okay, so we have a mana. Okay. We were trying to make enough star drop coins for the golden quest, but I don't know. Oh, what am I doing? Am I at the... There we go. Okay, my bad. Oh, I wonder why... Hmm. I wonder why the planes aren't doing much for me. 
like as Molly. Okay, we've got some crystals. I got a potion. Okay. Oh, that like exhausts the. Okay. I wonder if the Baron's does anything. Can I discover the Baron's? Um. Okay. So I have three crystals. I just need a fourth crystal to make a crystal quarry. Okay, four crystals and the witch. We have Mollyville and Meadow Village. Oh, wait, I never named this. Uh, we're making a crystal quarry. I don't know. Where else can Molly go? What else does Molly do? They trade with foreign cities. Hmm. Wonder what else to So it exhausted one of my cards. But I am not sure. Hmm. Not sure what else to do with my merchant. Okay, I have a crystal quarry. Slow constant source of crystals must be slotted into a village. Okay. Now we have a crystal quarry. Um, Baron says the perfect place to train. And mana flows easily here in the plains. So we need to make a beacon again. A beacon spell which takes moon drops. We don't have any moon drops. Um, this says reagents. I guess we just need to explore more. Okay, so let's move these. We're, we're moving stuff around now. So we have our two villages right now. Let's lock these up top. I don't know what's uh, I haven't done anything with celestial do yet. Uh, training camp, crystal, void salts, and a witch. I definitely have void salts. Um, so I need to, I feel like I need to save the mana because that's like, Hard to get. Um, star drop coin is money, potion, silver sage. Now I want soft ice cream. <laughs> I actually do have ice cream. I feel like I don't want to. Mm, I feel like I'm trying to figure out what my familiar can do. The witching hour is upon us. Okay, it's evening. The darkness is silent this night. Okay, we've got another quest from the Council of Fates. Hopefully we can do this one. Uh, defeat an enemy and be rewarded. Click on your witch's portrait in the bottom right to focus the camera on their card. Okay, there we are. Perfect. Chocolate vanilla mix of soft ice. So long since I had it. Uh, okay, oh, so it's telling me I only have three out of four hearts. Distribute the soft ice cream to the patients while the wards get first-hand exposure to all the inpatients' families. It was a good experience. Yeah, I feel like I feel like it's it's necessary to like put a human element on it. I worked in a hospital, um, and I was a medical scribe, so I just paired up like for 12, 12 hours a shift. I would pair up with my doctor, um, and I feel like they. <sighs> They were, most of them were pretty, pretty nice people, but I feel like they really just did not have any concept of, just didn't have like any compassion for the people with mental health struggles. You know what I mean? Um, I remember one person, uh, and they were young, not young, young, like probably my age now, but uh, they said, like they were upfront with their mental health struggles. They weren't there for their mental health issues, you know? But I remember them sharing their mental health issues and we left and the doctor was like, oh great, another crazy one. And I was like, what? 
And it was a doctor I really respected too, because some of them are kind of jerks. Um, so, and like I was, I was older than the people I, most of the people I like, the medical scribes I worked with. So I said something. I was like, I don't know. I think it's a lot better for someone to know and be open about their mental health struggles rather than like they're having a hard time. And, and like, just haven't, haven't tried, you know? I don't remember how I communicated that, but I was like, don't you think it's better for someone to say what's, like, isn't it good for them to know? Volunteer, self and volunteer myself to the facility. When you have no rhyme or reason is why panic attacks happen, it's scary. Oh, absolutely. Got another official diagnosis, MDD. I don't know what that is. But yeah, I was really surprised because it's one of the doctors that I had seen have a lot of empathy for people with major depression disorder. Oh, thank you. Um, I had seen have a lot of empathy for people with family members who were dying or had died, you know. Um, and I was like, why doesn't it, why didn't that extend to people were open about their mental health struggles that just it shocked me and um yeah we, we have a long we have a long way to go we have a long way to go um i feel like maybe i can sell these potions maybe i'll sell these potions make some money let's make some money there we go okay all right yeah so that was surprising that was surprising um Defeat an enemy. So, hold on. So I kind of feel like I need another explore card. I wonder if I can send a merchant there. Okay, I sent a merchant to the explore card. Maybe we can work on it together. Gave you experience, not the one you wanted, but it gave you experience. Oh yeah, absolutely. Definitely gives you some, uh, has an eternal stench. <laughs> Reagents are easily found here. Are easily found here. Okay, so we have a bog. Cheers. I'm hydrating with coffee. Hopefully that's okay. We have a meadow. Hey, thank you for the follow. And a crystal deposit. Perfect. Okay. So we're in the crystal, okay, we've got a crystal from the crystal quarry. That's good. These are pretty slow, the crystal quarry, but it's doing, it's doing it. It's doing it. Um, getting crystals, reagents. Okay. So I don't think we'll finish this. We have this golden quest too. This is tough. Um, okay. So pause. Let's split these up. I don't know. Um, I don't know how they like trade with. I don't know how they trade. Merchants may trade with foreign cities. I don't know. How, I don't. I don't really know how to do that. I did it accidentally. I did it accidentally. Um, defeat an enemy and be rewarded. So, hmm. I want to keep this for training. I, think I can sell my meadow and maybe get some more explore. Um, mana is three crystals. Let's do that. And then, hi Scourge, how are you? Nice to see you. Um. Sorry, I... There it is, okay. Let's see, I my spell book. Hmm. 
trying to figure out wally thank you for the roses on tiktok i don't even know what that i don't know what that means but i'll take it thank you i am streaming this on tiktok as well um indie games don't have nearly as much of a reach on tiktok as i think they should but doing it anyway doing it anyway just in case just in case someone pops by and's like hey that looks like a good game how have you been scourge how's everything going um, we're making another mana. Hold on. I want to... I want another star drop coin. So... Uh... Council doubts your expedition. Prove them wrong. I don't think I'm going to prove them wrong today. We're going to sell a void salts. And we're going to do another explore. Wait, hold on. Was it shift click? Shift click to auto purchase. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So we're gonna explore with her. Working too much? I hope uh I hope that's kept you busy in a good way. I wonder if it's better if I Oh, I have a reagent. Oh, heck. Heck. Maybe I'll get another one and then I can you know. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what I get. We have a crystal deposit. That's good. Okay, Molly, you work on the crystal deposit, I guess. There we go. Okay, we got more mana. Okay, we've got a crystal. And fairy city. Friendly fairy cities may be traded with if you have merchant familiar. They also buy specific resources from you at higher prices. I got a fairy city. Let's go. Merchants pr produce rock glems. Silver sage cards may be sold here. Let's go. Oh, I'm so excited. I found a fairy city. Okay, as soon as Molly's done with the crystal deposit. Okay, Molly, you go to the merchant. There we go. You go to the crystal deposit. So this game is called Witch Hand. Uh, friendly fairy city may be traded if you have merchant familiar. Buy specific resources at higher prices. Okay, so they buy Silver Sage for two... And somehow I get rock glems. I don't know what that does, but uh, we're about to find out. Um, I only got one reagent, so I'm not going to finish this quest. The council is going to continue to doubt my expedition. That's fine. Which hand? Exactly. See, you're, you're asking the right questions, Skirt. But there is a demo available, a free demo on, on Steam. Ooh, we've got a potion. Um... I guess we could sell it for some. Okay, we're gonna sell this for more coin, star drop. Um, and then oh, we have some crystals. Hmm. Maybe I should sell a. I'm gonna sell this meadow. Okay, and now I can have another explore card. Molly is trading. She's doing so good. She's doing so good. We have two mana here. Maybe I should make some more mana. Yeah, we'll make another mana out of crystals. We might actually be able to finish this quest if we get enough. Okay, we're going to explore here. It looks good on TikTok. I'm just commenting for the algorithm. Thank you. Thanks, Wally. The witching hour is upon us darkness is silent this night yeah it's just so cute thank you for commenting for the algorithm i appreciate you i am live on tiktok as well um and thank you for the roses i don't know what they do but but uh but i like it <laughs> thank you um there will be a new moon tonight expect an enemy attack uh what's the opposite of poggers <laughs> Um. Okay, so. Um. Oh, I didn't make a training camp yet. Oh no. Uh oh. They're like bits. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you, Wally. Okay, there's a mountain, a potential home. You can sense the plentiful crystal deposits lurking within. Ooh. 
Okay. So I wonder, I'm gonna put all these locations in one pile. We're gonna, lo uh, put all these locations are gonna be bopped over here. Um, cast a spell that creates building and be rewarded. Okay. Roses are just like bits. Okay, thank you. Okay, we got more barons. I'm gonna sell that. Gotta go, it's good hanging, catching up. Hope you get to, thank you, David. It's really nice to talk to you. Nice to chat. Okay, so we are looking for, I would like a training. Uh-oh, we have a Voidling. Um, we're gonna go fight them, but I'm gonna need to heal up again. Uh, okay. Uh, we're about to get another crystal. So crystal, void salts, and a witch. Okay. So we're gonna get this crystal. Void salts and a witch. And then we can fight the voidling. Rochak! I support mom like Wally. Oh. Yeah, Wally's great. A rock glem. A popular trade good in the ninth. Valued by certain cities. So... Um, a two checks, three checks, four checks. Let's go. So we have a voidling. Uh, it's small and unfriendly. It is difficult to hold its image in your mind. So we'll finish this training camp and then we'll go fight the voidling. Uh, Molly the merchant. Um, so we're making this training camp. So we'll need a place to put it. So we'll need another beacon, but we don't have any moon drops. Where do we go for moon drops? I guess we need to do these quests. Defeat an enemy. Oh, that'll give us some items. Okay, so this'll this will fix this, and this'll fix this one. Okay. Alright, I know where we're going. I know where I know where we're heading. I'm a little nervous because um I'm about to be attacked. Four bros checked. Oh no. Okay, so this finishes this quest. Okay, now we're paused. We have a training camp combined with a familiar and a mana to create a warrior. Warriors may attack foreign cities, must be slotted into a village. Okay, so let's get rid of this training camp extra card. Let's open, ooh, moon drop. Star drop. And a star drop. Okay. And now this one. Let's go fight. Uh, let's go fight this Voidling. And then we'll finish this quest. Okay. Let's pause here. We got some Void Salts. We got another Moon Drop. And a star drop. And a star drop. Okay. Um, gosh, we really needed another Moon Drop. Uh, but we have, we can summon a familiar. Let's make another familiar. We need mana, reagents, and a witch. So we'll have another familiar. Thankfully, we don't have to feed them. So far. As far as I know, we don't have to feed them yet. Um. Okay, we're summoning a familiar. And we can sell this. We're going to have another familiar and we're going to send him to a training camp. We're probably going to trade the, it out for the mana extractor, I think. Hi, choosing. Oh, Wally. <laughs> um, so we're summoning a familiar. I guess we could do another explore card while we wait. Um, we only have two hearts left, which is a little concerning. Hmm. How are you? Okay, we've got a planes. We've got a rock glem. Look, Molly's doing so good over here. We got reagents. A little late for that, but. Okay, we've got another familiar. We are going to move the mana extractor and we're going to put the training camp in. And what is this? Familiar and a mana to create a warrior. So we do have another mana. Okay, perfect. Doing well, sleepy though. I hope you get plenty of sleep this evening. Okay, we got a reagent. 
right, we've got some reagents. Um, I'm still trying to make enough coins. Uh, I'm, I think I might be able to make enough coins. Wow, this alchemist, I feel like the alchemist takes a, a long time for this, these potions. A roofer coming in 15 to give you bad news? Oh no. Someone I work with has to, um, has to replace their roof. Okay, so we have a potion. Um, market, crystal quarry. I feel like, so I can't make another, uh, can't make another, um, place just yet because we don't have enough moon drops hope you only need a patch yeah i hope so too okay we've got another okay we've got a warrior oh okay because tonight tonight we have evil afoot so that's why i wanted to make a warrior may attack foreign cities uh do we want to attack like do we want no we don't need to attack foreign cities right not yet. <laughs> Not yet. The last one suggests a replacement, which was going to be about 30k. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh, someone I work with, their, their family is like having to go through that right now. Like the, the ceiling like fell in on them because of some like water damage or something. So now they're... Like they have to be, they have to get it done like soon. Because it's an emergency. Ugh, I'm so sorry choosing. That's tough. Concrete tile and HOA said it has to be the same. I'm so sorry. That happened to us with burst pipes after one hard freeze. Oh no. Roofs or bathroom ceiling came down. Oh my God. That's horrifying. And I don't know, I mean, I don't know. I was like, I asked, I asked her here, I was like, do, do you guys have like home insurance? Like, is that a thing? I don't even know what home insurance covers. Like if home insurance would cover that. And it probably depends on where you live and what kind of home insurance you have. I just remember playing the game of life when I was young and like home insurance wasn't required as far as I remember. Um, but after a few plays where you end up with like your roof caving in or whatever and then having to fix your house you you buy it like oh, obviously it's much different for a board game <laughs> but that's just how it, that's like what my brain thinks of when i think of home insurance is like um is is <laughs> the game of life board game um but I know in certain places it's not that easy. Like in Florida, home insurance uh, companies are like leaving the state because <laughs> it just doesn't make sense. Okay. Um. All right. Hold on. Pause. What am I doing? I need more crystals. So I guess I'm going to try to... Maybe I'll sell one of these and then... I'm going to do another explore, and I'm going to explore with the witch. It is almost nighttime, so we are hopefully going to be okay. Home insurance doesn't cover wear and tear on houses. Oof, God. Okay, I just need a third crystal for this mana extractor for another mana. I don't remember why I need mana, but I do have a warrior, so that's good. Okay, crystal for the mana extractor. Okay, it's nighttime. We do have an attack imminent. Where, wear and tear. The witching hour is upon us. Okay, so... The darkness is silent this night, but we do... The moon is new. The void moves against you. Uh, what? Void rift? Hold on. Like what? 
Attack it! Attack the Void Rift! I can't attack the Void Rift. Uh... Hi, Dot! How are you? How are you going? Um, let's see. So we have a potion. We have some moon drops. We have some crystals. Hmm. Guess I'll lock this up here. Still have this alchemist. Hmm. I guess I can take the training camp out because I'm not going to make another. There we go. And I'll put the alchemist back at Mollyville. How are you doing, Dot? Okay, I have a merchant familiar and a warrior familiar. Uh, so the void rift, I guess, is gonna do a thing. I'm waiting for some more moon. Hopefully, hoping for some more moon drops. Here's a crystal deposit. We're playing witch hand, which is a new deck builder. There's a free demo on Steam. Doing okay, slightly tired. Halfway through the workday. You're halfway there. Gonna make it. Okay, we're waiting for the Void Rift to do something. I don't know what's gonna do. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> These are some buildings. I already have a... Okay, we just need another city. So we're working at the... I'm not sure what this means. Okay, we have three crystals, so we can make another mana. Although, do we need... Hmm. Okay, no, I just need a moon drop. Council of Dudes, Magic Way documents over 100 pages long. There are a lot of do and don'ts. Oh god, that's so... horrendous. And, like, there are so many places you just really don't have the option to do... Oh my gosh. Okay, there are three Voidlings. I only have two... I only have two health on my Witch. I, you know what I need to do is heal. Silver Sage... I don't have enough Silver Sage, though. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, it's fine. Let's send our Warrior after the Voidling. Let's do this. I didn't know about the HOA was before I bought the place. First home, so naive buyer. Yeah, and like, realistically, there's so many places where there's nothing you can do about it anyway. Okay, so I think I need another... I think I need another... Um... Hmm... I'm gonna sell this rock, Glem. We need another explorer. Oh, let's explore, because I'm trying to get another... HOA is the worst. My mature requirement was not be part of an HOA. Yeah, so it depends on where you live. There's some places where you literally can't do anything about it. Oh, my poor little... My poor little warrior baby. Um... Shift click to give this. Okay, this one's gonna be rosy. This is my little warrior cat. Um, <clears throat> I have a feeling if my witch dies, I die. Like, I die forever. Um, okay. Rosie, you're only gonna have one health left, but like, I believe in you. I have own property, no one's gonna say what I do. So, the thing is, it's not always an option in like specific places in the states okay rosie has one health we need to heal her we also need to heal my witch hmm. okay healing touch so silver sage reagents and so can i heal my familiar I wonder if there's a way to heal my familiar. Can I put them like hanging out somewhere? Okay. 
Well, we got this and a reagent. So we'll wait for her to explore here. I'll lean against my home if I don't pay the fines. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and there are some places you really just like don't have any options for um like yeah live down the street from two town council people there's stickers sticklers on calling cops to enforce town ordinances to the oh god that's so cringe told the realtor i didn't want to be in an hoa double check the recommendations they sent me yeah there are just some locations in the states that that's not possible like that every every location like in florida if you buy property, you're going to be part of an HOA. You know what I mean? Okay, so we have mana. We have a lot of mana. Reagents. I need the switch to heal up. I wonder if I can heal you. No, I can't heal them. Okay. Rosie can't die. Like, it's not allowed. Okay, so we have a crystal deposit. We're going to heal you. Oh, wait. Hold on. I need my healing touch spell. And then, here we go. There we go. I wonder if you can heal familiars. Florida place requires heart updates every eight years. Yeah, it's just like, can you, can you work a crystal deposit? Okay, so now she's healed. Rosie's struggling. Poor baby. doing so good you're doing you're doing your best sweet baby um let's get another mana and then we'll have enough star drop coins for this golden quest makes them feel empowered yeah they just have like nothing better to do it sucks it sucks as those are the people that are like you know involved in making decisions for your life but just how they just have nothing else all right, there we go. Okay, Rosie. Ego trippers and power hungry. Yeah, sounds about right. <laughs> this looks better on TikTok than it does on Twitch. Oh, wow, really? I wonder if that's, uh, I wonder why that is. Might be just uh, how nice, like, um, Oh, thank you for the rose too, Wally. Wally. <gasps> thank you. I love you. Okay, um, so I'm gonna sell all these mana for star drop coins so I can finish my golden quest, which is bring 20 star drop coins. Okay, so we're getting a mana. This is this seems like the best way to make money on the phone every day. That, that's what they live for. Hi. <laughs> Thank you. GG PhD. <laughs> I hope you all had a good day yesterday. I didn't get any pictures of food. Okay, I'm going to sell these as much as I think I'm going to regret it. Um, Let's finish the golden quest. There we go. All right. We're finishing this quest. Uh, complete a golden quest from the Council of Fates. I got a Achievo and they're giving me a familiar. So now I'll have a third familiar. I think they start charging whenever they have to call. Yeah, like they do charge. And the thing is like they can, like someone was saying, if they can put a lien against your house. So like they can charge you and they will. I wonder if there's a limit for um, amount of cards you can have on like the table. The witching hour is upon us. The darkness is silent this night. I am fully healed, that's nice. A quest has arrived from the Council of Fates. Okay, summon a familiar. Oh, oh my gosh, perfect timing. I'm summoning a familiar. Parents have been living in a place with HOA for over 20 years. They had to get rid of fishing boats and store their trailer they used for hauling equipment off site due to the HOA. Their neighbor left the HOA board because I kept trying to get him to tell my parents they had to do all that. Yeah, and and the thing is, there's always... Oh, a fated familiar. Handpicked by the council itself, this elite familiar is one of the council's many tools used to correct the direction of fate. We had lots of food. Oh, that sounds nice. 
Uh, okay, I have a fated familiar. My property more rules. They can literally take your property, Rain. We don't, we don't... <laughs> Americans don't have rights. Uh, we do until we don't, you know what I mean? Thank you, JGD PhD. Ooh, I got a moon drop and a star drop coin and a star drop coin. Yeah, it's it's uh like I wish it was that easy. You know what I mean? I wish it was that easy. But it just ain't. You folks have guns? Yeah, okay, but uh you've seen what happens, right? When you use them is you get shot. That's the <laughs> That's the thing about um That's the thing about uh people that are people that are um you know two way whatever is like you could never do that you could never do it yeah what stabbin said yeah you just could never um reagents easily found perfect place to train Mana flows easily here. Maybe I'll do this to make some more mana. Oh, maybe. No, maybe I'll do a mountain. I'll do a mountain. Yeah, let's do a mountain. Um, I need to make a beacon. Beacon spell. Beacon spell. It sounds like speak and spell. Um, moon drop and a witch. There we go. Okay. Yeah, I know it sounds not. I know it sounds nuts, but it's, but that's avoid HOA at all costs. Yeah, and in some states you just can't, which again sounds sounds crazy, but it's just real. It's just how it is. <laughs> it never worked in Belgium. Yeah, there's just okay. So we're summoning a beacon. All right. So here's this. We have a faded familiar. I don't know. If they do the same stuff, a familiar with a glorious purpose. Does anyone want me to name the familiar? I will, it might die. So does anyone want me to name their familiar after a cat? <laughs> I already have Rosie who's struggling and Molly who's thriving over here. Jow. <laughs> Jow's not a cat. I'm pretty sure I even have a, I think I even have a quote about Jow not being a cat. <laughs> Shadow. Shadow the faded familiar. <laughs> Shadow Jow. I don't think we have a say Jow. Um, we do have something about Jow being a cat. Oh, there is that one too. <laughs> That's from 2020. Um, okay, we're we're summoning a beacon. We have lots of crystals. Uh, we probably need to unlock another spell. Let's do that. Familiar home. <gasps> I can make a house for my familiars. <gasps> Population growth. Ugh. Increase the village's maximum building slots by one. Oh, familiar increases your familiar cap. Uh, 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 Mm. Um. Okay, I feel like maybe. What can I actually do? Familiar home spell. This is silver sage for healing. Oh, these are all tough. They all okay. You know what? Population growth. Yeah, yeah. Let's learn that one. Okay, population growth spell. We just need another moon drop. Just one more moon drop. It's fine. Just one more. Uh, okay, so we're summon or summoning a beacon, and now we'll have a beacon, and we can make a a land card and a witch. I was gonna put this in the mountain. Bam. Didn't do nothing. <sighs> Had to nail that clip that wouldn't come off so I went and got pliers. Oh gosh. Oh no. 
Okay, so we have a population growth spell. We just need a moon drop. Probably from a quest. We don't have any quests. Poor Rosie struggling over here. Um Molly's making making money moves over here. Okay, we've got a potion. Mountain village. Slotted buildings receive plus 10 crystal production. Okay, that's good stuff. So let's um We'll lock this here, and we're going to move after this crystal quarry is done. I'll move table with duct tape ring to shut it off. What kind of working are you? Yeah, I get it. I get I see where you're, I see. I see what you mean. We have a bog reagent, sir. OK, we need another potion. OK, so we're going to move the crystal quarry to the mountain village. So now we need an herbalist. The witching hour is upon us. I broke a toenail, something fierce to have duct tape holding it together. Are you serious? <sighs> the bullet would turn the tape before reveal. Oh, the traitor arrives. <gasps> oh, 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 so many. Oh, oh gosh. Okay. Um, pause. Um, <clears throat> uh, I don't need. I don't need any of this stuff right now, I don't think. I guess I could buy bones, but how long does the leaves at the end of the day? Hmm. I don't need any of this stuff right now, as far as I know. So I can move the trader over here. Okay, trader, go away. <laughs> go away, I'm busy. Oh, jammed. <laughs> uh. Okay, so I'm waiting for another potion. Poor Rosie. I don't know what to do. Uh, population growth spell. We need another moon drop. I don't know where to get a moon. I don't know where to get a moon drop. If they were selling moon drops, I'd be so down. Um, we sell three rock glims. We got some more star drop coins. Only feats. <laughs> Oh no, low battery in my headphone. Actually, it's a good time to go to the restroom. I'm gonna go to the restroom. Hold on, I'll be right back. Have fun in the bathroom. Oh. This is a problem, this is a problem. Ay, Dios mio. Oh. Dr. Eggman? Oh. You can gamble. Oh no. Oh no. Ah, ah. Oh no. Oh, of course Molly came to find me now. She's like, wait, hold on. I didn't wanna, I didn't want that to stop. Hold on a second. Yeah. Wait, please. <laughs> I have a um uh here, maybe Justin will wanna do it because Nearly is really bad with the harpoon. Um <laughs> I have a I have a box of spices here. Oh, I guess we're done, I'll just get on the boat. Guarding con being indoor with AC yeah, probably helped a ton. That is yeah, that's true. Hard. And everyone like stayed in the hotel, so people weren't like. Oh, that's not very good. There you go. Oh, good God! I bet. What about Jim Girl? <laughs> she smell okay? <laughs> Keep 
that. I want to keep that. I'm Nut Buster. White Trose. How do you say it in like Queen's English? Wait, hold on. What is what is the fancy English? What is the fancy British accent called? Re re modified uh repatriated re <laughs> what? Reconstituted. Restricted English. What is that word? What's the word? <laughs> Hello. Therapist told me not to use duct tape as a band-aid. That's um that's good. Refried English. Yes. Yes. Sorry, I made it gotta cook. Thank you for the roses, Wally. I'm glad uh I'm glad the game looks good. I accidentally cut off blood flow. I don't know why I know this. <laughs> I'm glad it looks good. Yeah, it's um, it's great tape. They sell tape for bandages. Uh, I think it it doesn't stick as hard, so it uh, right. I think it doesn't stick as hard, so it won't like cut off the your blood flow. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess we can. I forget what I'm doing. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh, good. I thought I was um, still muted for a second. I wonder if, um, should I make a warrior with my faded familiar? No, no, that's not what they're there for. Okay. Okay, so I have a lot of coins. Maybe I should buy another explore card. I have a lot of stuff. Population growth spell, I need a moon drop. I'm really liking this. Uh, it definitely does uh, does have stack lands energy. I really like, ooh, Silver Sage. I really like stack lands. Ooh, we got a mana. Um, it's really cute. And I have three cats right now. So, I mean, couldn't get much better, I think, personally. Um, and it's been really good at like, uh, like slowly introducing concepts. We're just vibing. We're just vibing. The number of sectomies performed in the US rose 29% of the months after Roe v. Wade was overturned. Oh yeah, absolutely. Ma makes sense. It makes sense. Okay, we're on a crystal deposit. Yeah, it's been like, um, I guess I could sell some stuff. It's been, been covering like things in a good way. Okay, so I need to, I'm waiting for another potion and then I'm gonna uncover another spell. <clears throat> yeah, are the void cells like bad cells from another dimension? I mean, I got them from void uh, from attacking voidlings. Uh, I don't know how to heal familiars, so that's a thing. Um, okay, these potions. We're gonna learn another spell. We're gonna learn an herbalist spell. Yes. Um. Okay, we have mana. Government website provides educational materials on how to be a father. Does it really include a collection of dad jokes? That's funny. Yeah, there is a there is a demo for this too, with healing, of course. Oh, of course, of course. Oh, I need another crystal. So what's? I guess I can do another explore. I'm just worried. I'm always worried with these because um. Okay, I just need a third crystal. If you don't follow, quite interesting on Twitter. I feel like I blocked quite interesting. There's a few of those like engagement farming. A few of those engagement farming like accounts that don't sit right with me not for any particular reason okay they want crystals as a oh wait i'm gonna sell this um they want crystals hold on um crystals are gonna go to the herbalist there we go and then what is this Okay, and then when the witch is Twitter for Twitch, yeah. 
Yeah, Twitter is just, I, you know, y'all know how I feel about, y'all know how I feel about Twitter. Word of the day, the current period in human history. I don't think that's, I don't, what? Where does that come from? I, I don't believe that. I. <laughs> That's why it doesn't sit right with me. Because some of it I'm like, are you sure? Okay, I just need a reagent for the population and then a witch and a moon drop. Just a moon drop. Just, just casual moon drop. Okay, I need two crystals for this. And, um, I'm making an herbalist and I can put them in the meadow village to get silver sage. Use to turn, turn silver sage into more silver sage. Okay. So we put silver sage here and then we make more. Don't Google that word at work. <laughs> That's a good tip. That is a good tip. Okay. So now crystal deposits. So we'll have more crystals. Uh, there's a crystal right there. We're making them to mana because it actually is a lot of money. Um, okay, here's another crystal. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, we got another crystal. I guess we can do another explore too. Here we go. Uh, let's have this faded familiar explore. I wonder if anything interesting happens when they... Is this like a resword sim in card format? Yeah, have you ever seen stack lands? Because this is... Um... Okay, so we have a meadow. Uh, so we're just saving. We have two bogs, so I'll sell that. Um, okay, plains, mountain, bog, barrens, meadow. Okay, one of each. Yeah, it's like a village. It's like a colony sim. I don't remember anything about it. Yeah, so this has like the same energy. That's how this was. Um, that's how this was like uh, described. Oh, I wanted two crystals for this. Okay, we've got another potion. I have no idea what's happening on screen. This is my witch. These are familiars. They're doing stuff for me. Rosie's just vibing, but... This one's exploring. Molly is making money for me. So this is all our money over here. You can see all of our resources down here at the bottom. So start, I have $11 basically. Four crystals, three mana, one potion to unlock spells. Uh, three familiars, so I have three cats. And there are zero bad guys on the screen. This is my, this is my little cute nugget. Um, this is a quest, bring two crystals. And that's what I'm working on right now. Which hand? <laughs> okay, so here's another meadow, which I'm going to sell. These are locate. Okay, so these are my villages. I have a mountain village, meadow village, Mollyville, and Fairy City, which isn't my village, but it's where Molly is doing her merchant thing. Well, how does one violently flip the table? There's, um, in Cardboard Town, which is another, like, a, a cozy, like, chill um okay uh at first it feels like a chill colony like city builder but it's actually stressful control alt f <laughs> that feels like a reference i'm gonna take a nap have a good nap stabbins it's really nice to see you okay, hopefully so so each of these locations is doing different things this is spitting out crystals this is if i want to train one of my cats to be a warrior this is a market this is why Molly is trading in the fairy city. <clears throat> um, this is an herbalist, which is giving us silver sage to heal. Mana extractor makes mana. Um, alchemist makes potions for us to learn quests. And rock glems are basically like Molly is getting these and we're making money. <laughs> and I don't know what Celestial Dew does. I imagine it's... Ooh, there we go. All right, I guess... Uh, Okay, here's a crystal deposit. So this will give us more crystal. We need two crystal for this for this quest. Maybe we'll get a moon drop from that. Thank you. Thanks, Stabbins. Ooh, we got a moon drop. Okay, we got a moon drop and a star drop and a star drop. So we got two coins and a moon drop. 
Um, population growth spell, though. Um, population growth cards increase the village's maximum building slots by one. So that'll increase the slots in our village, which is nice. Uh, then maybe we'll be able to put another alchemist in there. Moondrop, reagents, and a witch. Okay, here we are. All right. Now we're increasing the slots in our villages. Which is nice. Okay, we've got crystals. So much, so many crystals. Lots of crystals. I think we're gonna keep them though. Put the table back. <laughs> uh, it's all right if you don't. If you don't want to, it's all right if you don't want to. I can't be bothered. Uh, so here's another crystal. This is our faded familiar. Okay, population growth. Increase the village's maximum building slots. Must be consumed on use. Must be slotted into a village. Okay, <clears throat> so maybe let's do this for potions. Let's do population growth. Um, we'll undo this and we'll... Oh, the witching hour is upon us. It's staying flipped. The darkness is silent this night. Thankfully, the darkness is pretty quiet. The mood is full. The council offers a boon for a price. Okay, we got another golden quest. Oh, okay, we we might actually have enough. We have 14 star drops. We're doing better. The roofer did indeed bring the bad news. Oh no. I hope it's cheaper than 30K. God, that is not fun. Okay, we have a population growth spell. We are, yeah, oh God. I was born in the darkness, raised by it, molded by it. Poor Rosie. She needs a healing. Um, <clears throat> we're gonna make another alchemist too. Alchemist, crystal times two and a witch. Hold on, alchemist spell. Okay, two crystals and a witch. Okay. And then, um, it wasn't worth fixing. Oh no, I'm so sorry. God, that's awful. Okay, there we go. Now I have enough coins to do this quest. Bam. I was saving up just in case and, oh, uh, okay. I can't summon a familiar because I need a familiar home. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, I only have 30 sec. Oh, no. Uh, hold on. What is... Oh, no. Shoot. <sighs> what if I sold Rosie? Oh, no. <sighs> um... I only have 30 seconds. Wait, oh no. In the new Kitty Rosie. Yeah, I don't think I can sell her though. I I tried to. Okay, so I don't think I don't think this gives me 30 seconds. I think it means that it'll take 30 seconds once once it's unlocked. Yeah, I'm so sorry choosing. That's awful. Uh yeah, so we just have to wait. Okay. So yeah. We're we're not we're not done. Okay. Making more silver sage. Um I probably will name the new cat Rosie though. Oh, oh gosh. Okay. Uh We're going to move this over, move this over. There we go. Okay. So we're making another alchemist. We can also make a mana extractor. There we go. Okay. This will give us more potions so we can learn more spells. And then sell this. Um, if you're gonna handiwork, slow up your roof. Replacing your roof is pretty easy, time consuming. Yeah, but it depends on like, I don't know. Also like, Replacing a roof is really scary because I mean it's over your entire house. What could I spend that several thousand dollars on? 
um, fixing, fixing, uh, where you screwed up repairing the roof. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think, uh, I fancy myself pretty funny. <laughs> Me? Woo. Uh... Um, let's see. What are we? Oh, right. Sorry, I was paused. <laughs> Call yourself a thousand things and raise you a general fear of heights. Okay, here. We're not paused. Wait, why does it look like everything's... Oh, it's just slow. Inner ear issue. My house is on a hill. 60 foot drop off the back. Oh, yeah. 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 No, that doesn't sound great. Yeah. I wouldn't do it because I know I wouldn't... I know I would cut corners. There's a reason it's so expensive. It's because it's r not easy. Because <laughs> it's a lot. And there's a lot of like, um, a lot of liability in it too. Okay, so we're making potions. We got some more silver sage, that's nice. I can sell silver sage here too. Um, for more. I'm gonna, I'll sell one, there sell this I don't know I don't know if I did that correctly I guess we'll see <laughs> okay we've got a lot of crystals I guess I can make more mana I'm kind of just keeping it <laughs> oh it doesn't work anymore I guess my bad <laughs> um thanks for the roses Wally I don't even know when you sent those tbh um so yeah, for anyone joining up. Oh, hydrate. Can I hydrate with Coke? Um, thank you. <laughs> so anyone joining up, this is Witch Hand. Uh, there is a free demo on Steam. Um, it's a, like a, like a colony colony sim deck builder um the developer emailed me to like ask me to try it um and they they said it was similar like the same energy of stack lands and absolutely but this is cuter hydrating with lipton iced tea is that dehydrating due to caffeine no 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 don't worry don't worry don't listen to dot is sensible words. <laughs> don't listen to any of that silliness. Oh, we don't have any money. Probably okay. Uh, let's make some more mana. Sure. Um, okay, we're gonna have another potion so we can learn a... Okay, we can... Oh, oh, oh. I thought I locked that. Okay, anyway. We can learn a spell. Familiar home spell. Yes. Bam. Now we can have more familiars. Whew, thank goodness. I, I think I locked this. Using logic? Logic doesn't belong here. Yeah, exactly. Thank you. Um, So we're going to make a familiar home. We need three crystals. Oh, perfect. Perfect. And a witch. So we're going to have another familiar home. Um, I guess we'll also need to probably make another like population growth. We need another moon drop. Someone give me a moon drop. <laughs> hmm. Guess I'll switch out the training camp. What is this? Turn it off, I guess. Okay, we've got another mana. Familiar home. Familiar cat by two, slotted into a village. Okay, so we're gonna take the training camp out and put familiar home in. I'm surprised there's no like, there's no issues with unslotting buildings. Your logic has no power here. Exactly. It's true. Okay, so let's get rid of this off of our board. We have a bunch of locations. Um, I wonder if I can like, I wonder if there's anything I can do here. No, I don't think so. Um, sell a meadow, I guess. 
Give me a star drop. All right. I don't have a moon drop. I do have Prince Rupert's drop. Will that work? I don't even know what that is. Okay, so now we can get another familiar because we have another familiar home. Um, I... Let's... Um, we're gonna sell a mountain. Um... Okay, we have two star drops right now and a... Am I selling the Silver Sage? Is that what, what's occurring? Strange as the night like you. Okay, let's just sell another one of these rock limbs. Now we have enough star drop coins to explore again. We're exploring, seeing what is out there, seeing what can happen. Okay, we've got some Silver Sage. Okay. Um, I wonder, do I like do this and then move this here? So this is a stack of star drops under their pillow. Oh, merchant. Okay, so we have crystal. I just need a, I just need a moon drop, really. I'm not sure how to, so it says silver sage cards may be sold here. I don't know. I guess like this. I guess like this, right? That makes sense. Okay, we're exploring. We got a crystal and another crystal. Not really. Oh, okay. We got another faded familiar. I'm not really sure what to do with them. Well, we got two of them. Okay, we got some ruins. The witching hour is upon us. What are they fated for? I don't know. It says some, It says they're fated for something bigger. Bring reagents. Contains forgotten treasures. Double click on a village card to collapse its slots. Okay. Double click to collapse its slots. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, we've got a lot of silver sage here. This is for healing. Um... I think this still... Okay, cool. Oh, that's nice. Okay. So... All right, I can move this. It says they're uh, a familiar with a glorious purpose, but I'm not sure what they... Okay, this contains forgotten treasures. Do y'all want to go figure that out? Yeah, go look at the treasures. Molly's just over here vibing. I think I'm selling Silver Sage right now. I have not played Pal World. No, um, a lot of friends have played it. I watched like, I watched Juice play it the other day. So I'm not really, I'm really not, I'm not so sold on it. You know what I mean? Um. So I don't like that Game Pass and Steam can't, uh, I don't like the gets. Okay, Coke does not count as hydration. What the heck? <laughs> I dug. Sorry, I just saw that. Um. Yeah, that's true. I'd rather Pokemon Snap. Yeah, uh, mm. Uh, okay, I did sell my Silver Sage. Okay, what is this? I wonder what this bar up top means. Maybe it's lit. I don't know. Okay, we found some mana. <sighs> Oof. Okay, we found a potion. I guess we can get another spell. First waypoint. Oh, this is new. Combine with the following cards to create first waypoint. Upgrades purchased explore cards to level one, granting access to new cards. Yeah. A face on the bar, maybe reputation? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. That could, that could be, that could be it. Um... I just think, I just think personally that, uh, the Coke should count as hydration because it, because I like it. 
because I like it. Uh, we have some crystals. We still have these faded quests. I don't have reagents, so I guess um, guess we need more another explore card because I need reagents. And that's that. That's that. Is there anything here that gets me some reagents? Do you already have an herbalist? Alchemist? No, I don't think so. Since Molly is there, they will immediately love you because everyone loves Molly. Yeah, absolutely. She's pretty. Okay, so all we need is mana and a moon drop and a witch. Easy. Um, let's explore, shall we? <laughs> we need some more reagents. This is my quest. They, this usually gives you moon drops, which is nice. So... Oh, here's a potion. Oh, God. No. Oh, God. A Voidling. Um, here, Faded Familiar. You go fight the Voidling, please. Okay, we got Void Salts. Okay, pause. Because time just keeps on ticking. Uh, I wonder if Rosie can, like, heal here? Can you heal at Familiar Home? I genuinely don't know how to heal your fam heal familiars. That might just not be it might not be possible. Okay, crystal deposit. I okay, we're going to have to explore some more. Time keeps on ticking, ticking, ticking into the future. Oh boy. Um, okay, I'm trying to get this reagent, so I guess we'll sell some crystals. Well, no, we'll sell the rock glim. We got some coins. We'll explore. We'll try to get some more reagents. Hmm. So I keep exploring here. If Faded Familiar, you look at these. Okay, we got some rock glims. Okay, we got another location. Uh, oh, we got one reagent. Okay. Okay, this is good. One more reagent is all we need. Oh, perfect. Uh, we might actually get our moon drop here. E moon drop and some money, which is good. Mo money's fine too. Hi, True. Happy Wednesday. Okay, we've got our moon drop, we've got our mana, and we've got our witch, and we are on our first waypoint. Molly's doing so good too. What a good little merchant. I put little Rosie away in the mountain village. How are you doing, True? Okay, we're, we're doing a first waypoint. I guess we could uh, um, make another mana. Okay, there we go. Okay, the witching hour is upon us. The darkness is silent this night. A letter arrives from my home realm. Okay, that's good. Okay. Uh, oh gosh, oh god, pause. The realms are quiet. The Bastion Witches of the Eighth Realm have not reported a single void attack since their expedition began. News would also suggest the fairies have turned their attention fully to the ninth. I feel this may simply be the calm before the coming storm with you in the center. Ooh, am I the main character? Oh, and a moon drop. A. Okay. Um, cool. Selling another letter. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for that. Okay, we got another moon drop. We got a waypoint. Upgrades purchased explore cards to level one. Okay, must be slotted into a village. So we need to expand a village. We need to expand a village. Licitin um, Returno? Oh no. How do I? Molly Molly Oxen Free. Okay, we need a population growth. Moon drop, reagents, and a witch. Okay, we have moon drop. We don't have reagents. 
Okay, so we'll just buy an explore card. We'll buy an explore card and then we'll upgrade it. Wait, hold on. Oh, this needs to be right. It needs to be slotted. Okay, so let's take an alchemist out and we'll slot this into here and we'll put an explore card here. Wait, hold on. How do we... Hmm. Upgrades purchased. Okay, so this explore card is just going to sit here, I think. Right? Right? Molly, Molly, oxen free. Oxen free is a game I have. Okay, what was I going to do? Population growth, moon drop. I don't have reagents. Right. Somehow I need to. Like, make an explore car. I don't know. Hmm. How do I do this? Does that mean they're... Why is this turned off? I'm a little... I think I'm a little confused. How do I know this is level one? Oh, so now they cost five. So this is just gonna be a basic one because it's it wasn't slotted. So now I need, okay. Well, now I need more money. Okay, here's more mana. I'm just gonna sell one of these manas to give me an explore card. Okay, there we go. So this is a one star. Oh, we got a Voidling. Okay, Faded Familiar, you fight the Voidling. Hi, human, how are you? Okay, we fought the Voidling. Uh-oh, we got another Voidling. Faded Familiar, you do your thing. Okay, we got, oh gosh. Um, okay, Void Salts. Okay, we're getting a bit, we're getting a bit overloaded here. Hold on. Rock Lamb goes here. Faded Familiar. We have another Familiar. How are you doing, human? How's your Wednesday? Okay, so that's slotted in. We have a Crystal Deposit. Um, I think... Why is this turned off? I'm a little confused why the Alchemist just turned off. Busy Busy? I hope it's good Busy. All good. All good. Doing fine. You know, you know, things, things and stuff, but everything's going all right. Uh, let's see. So we have, um, we need, what do we need? Uh, we played Dot Age, which is a really good, it's a really cool newly released game. Um, I think by a single developer and this is, uh, this is Witch Hand. So this is also, I believe by a single developer. So we're... Small dev, a small dev Wednesday. I love it. I love it. Both of the games have been really good and like really well, like polished, which I love. I love. Um, so I guess we're exploring this. Okay. How about, how about the familiar? You explore this. You explore this. You played my age. Yes, it was, it was painful. Yeah. My knees hurt now. <laughs> Okay, there's a bog. Another one. Yeah, so it's been good. It's been good. Very, very chill. Okay, we got a we got a Baron's card. I was really hoping to get something uh something cool from this new explore card. Oh, Fairy City! Hostile fairy cities will summon enemy fighters every day. Warrior familiars are capable of attacking fairy cities directly. Oh no. Right. Oh, you're right. It, this is, uh, this is neutral. So, this city is hostile. 
Um, these are just my, these aren't fancy. So they're just, um, they're my Bluetooth headset. Uh, sometimes when I have a headache, I, oh no, I need to make a new familiar. My poor Rosie baby is going to die. Cause she, um, <laughs> she has one health. Can we all say, can we all say a rip for <laughs> Rosie, please? Um, yeah, so sometimes when I get a headache, I like, I can't put the headphones on, like the big headphones. Rip Rosie. All right, poor baby. Yeah, she's got one. We'll just have to get another familiar. <laughs> oh, they will be missed, poor baby. Better to have more than you need than not have enough. At least we got bones. <sighs> oh no. Uh, well. <laughs> okay. Well, here we are. Poor sweet baby. Okay, so Fairy City makes a bad guy every day. We need another familiar, and then we need to train them as a warrior. Uh, where is... Mana reagents in a witch. I don't have reagents. Um... Maybe I should learn a new spell. Capri pen? Capri pen? What is that? A cozy home for a capri? Celestial link. Connects villages. Empowering production. Storage chest. Store 60 of a single kind of resource. Oh, okay. Uh, a capri pen? Rosie 2. A cyborg Rosie. Yeah, ideally. Um, I have enough for both of these things. Celestial link. Let's do a celestial link. Yeah. Crystal, celestial dew. Okay, three crystal, three celestial dew, and a witch. This is my witch. This is my baby. Bring around the rosy. Okay, we have we have Rosie's bones, so that's like a thing. Um, we are, I guess we're increasing our, okay. Um, warriors can attack fairy city directly. So I don't know if I can, I don't think I can, no, I can't attack with a faded familiar. I don't feel like falling down. <laughs> I don't feel like it. Uh, star drop, rock glims. I guess we're... We have this moon drop. I'm looking at like what? I guess I can sell this. Sell these. Okay, there we are. Like London Bridge. I was just reading about London Bridge today. Um, how it used to be like the old London Bridge used to have like, used to look like that. Um, that bridge in is it Florence that has like all the shops on it. The 1600s tax collectors would often quit claiming exhaustion when asked they, why they'd say, I got tarred. <laughs> oh no. Um, okay, so we got, what are we doing? We're doing a celestial link. I think I probably need, I probably need more slots in these. Um, I'm interested to see what happens here. Connects to celestial links and other villages. Increasing village resource production must be slotted into a village. Okay. Um, let's see what. Oh my god, I have my herbalist hasn't been doing work. That's fine. Okay, we'll put the herbalist over here. The ace of spades in early times was not included in the deck and uses tax on playing cards. Wait, really? Celestial link. That means I need to make another one. Do I have any other celestial? No. Um <clears throat> I need a familiar. Summon familiar. Mana. Oh right. I need reagents. 
means I need an explore. Okay, we're gonna sell this. And we're gonna buy an explore card. And we're gonna do this and sell this. It's wild. Okay, still have this training camp. Um, the witching hour is upon us. It's nighttime. The darkness is silent this night. All right, so that means a quest arrives from the Council of Fates. This is defeat an enemy, so I can fight the fairy fighter. Capri. I have a Capri now, so I need a. I guess I need a Capri camp. Is this thing gonna run away? What am I gonna do with it? 50% goat, 50% fish? <laughs> what? Oh, guess because I saw. Okay, Celestial Link. Um, Basically... Okay, I'm going to send this familiar with full health after this fairy fighter. Ace of spades. Okay. All right. Spell page, useful for spell research. Okay, we have more bones. Um, I guess we can't attack this. We'll create enemies until befriended with an envoy or destroyed by a warrior. Some of the Ace of Spades designs are beautiful. Oh, I bet they are. Okay, we have a spell page. We have this, a moon drop, and some money. I guess the moon drops are good. Uh, we need to create more... <sighs> I don't even know. Um, I've been keeping these resources just to like, you know, <laughs> Capri, not pants. Collect. I collected Ace of Spades. All right, we're exploring. This is going fine, I think. We have a half goat, half fish. Yeah, that is cool. Okay, we have a crystal deposit. We didn't get what I wanted. I wanted a reagent. Um, is the potion thing still working? I think so. I think it's running. Yeah, it is. Um, okay, we got another crystal. Familiar home crystal quarry. Maybe I can take the... Uh, oh, shoot. It reset it. Oh, well, that's fine. Um, let's, let's put an alchemist here <laughs> for now. Uh, we have another rock glam. We have some moon drops, which are good. What we need is population growth. Oh, right. Reagents. That's why we need a reagents. Facts about decks of cards. That is cool. Um, I guess I could make another mana. Here. Oh, I got a potion. Okay, we got a potion. It's two more. <laughs> two more for another, uh... Okay, we got crystals. I guess we need another explore. Um, let's sell one of these. And now we can explore again. Overwhelmed by this game rather quickly. You think so? I'm not sure how far the demo goes. TBH. Okay, we've got some planes. Oh, we got reagents. Oh gosh. Uh, we got reagents. This is what I needed. Um, moon drop, reagents, and a witch. So we'll just wait for the witch to explore more. Wasn't this the full game? Yeah, yeah. This is the full game. Yeah. Okay, we have a crystal deposit, but you're going to do population growth. So this consumes the slot. I'm going to put it on Mollyville again. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm just saying, like, if you try the... um, Here, use this on the crystal deposit. Say, if you... um. Wait, where's the fairy? Oh, here you are. I also need to make a familiar to attack this fairy city. Okay, we got population growth. 
Here, we're gonna make this smaller. Make this bigger. We're gonna remove the extractor. We're gonna put population growth here and you're gonna have more slots. There we go. This will give this will give Mollyville another slot. I would like more reagents, but I don't think I have any thing creating them. I need another familiar too. What makes a familiar? Reagents. Same thing. Same thing. We're we're low on reagents. Um sell sell these random. Ring around the rosy pack full of posies. Ashes, ashes, we all fall down. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So we're still waiting for potions for more spells. We have lots of crystals. Yeah, it's set. Uh, I mean, from what I what I've heard about that in particular is that it's about um, that it's about the <clears throat> it was about the the plague. I don't know if that's true or if that's just something people say. Okay, let's get another explorer card. All right, faded familiar, you go figure that out. Okay, we're getting another slot for Mollyville. I'm gonna put this uh, alchemist there. Hey, witching hours upon us. Bam. The void moves against you. Oh boy. Uh oh, we got a void rift. Heard it was about the plague as well. Yeah. Okay, so we're about to get a few voidlings, I think. Um, I think we have... I haven't figured out... Oh, gosh. Oh, oh, God. We found another voidling. All right. You take care of this voidling. Okay, good job, faded familiar. You have so much health. John Solo on YouTube has done Star Trek Remnants Origins. John Solo? Never heard of them. Although I don't watch YouTube. I did update my YouTube like VODs channel on Monday. That's what I spent almost all day doing on Monday was updating my <laughs> VOD channel. Glad we don't get plagues anymore. Oh yeah, we're, we're so over that. We're so past that. Oh boy, huh? This is um. Okay, well you go fight this fairy fighter. You um. Okay, we're gonna fight this void spike, and then she'll have to heal up. Also the plague thing, but I think that's disputed now. Whew. Oh man, we're in a bit of a we're in a bit of a pickle here. Clicking the enemy counter in the HUD focuses the camera on existing enemies. Right here. Okay. Oh boy. That's looking that's looking rough. Eh, we're looking a bit rough here. We might lose some more familiars. Ooh, potion. Okay. So now we're going to take this alchemist and we're gonna put it in Mollyville. And we need to get another celestial link. Um, and we're gonna take this waypoint and we're gonna put it in the mountain. Oh wait, no, we're gonna put it in the meadowville. Okay, mm. take this familiar home and put it in Mollyville, and then uh, put the waypoint in Mollyville as well. Wait, hold on. No. Uh, waypoint in Mollyville. There we go. Okay. Put this away. Okay, we've got the two, those two there. Okay, now Celestial Link and Crystal Quarry in the Mound Village. And the market and maybe the training camp because we need a warrior. Being a pickle can dilute your senses. Okay, used to turn Silver Sage into more Silver Sage. Now we need more population growth. We need another one of these. Uh, moon drop and a reagent. Oh my gosh, this is. Oof. 
That hurt. Okay, now we need a healing touch. Oh no, we need more reagents. Crying out loud. Um... Guess we'll do another... Okay, terrain recycler. Reliable source of reagents. Okay, yes. Beautiful terrain recycler. So we just need three crystals, which we have plenty of, and a... Okay, this is where we can get reagents. Once an agent, always an agent. So that's a terrain recycler, so we can put these there. I've been selling them. Ugh. Heck, I think we'll be able to put the terrain. Oh my gosh, oof. Okay, we do have a crystal deposit. Um, I need to take care of these guys. Ugh. Heck. Okay, Molly's doing so good over here. Peat and repeat. <laughs> Okay, Terrain Recycler. Two land cards to produce a reagent. Oh, no. Um, I feel like I might be... Okay. Uh, Celestial Link. I don't have enough for a Celestial Link here. We're putting a Terrain Recycler here. Um, Plains and... Barrens. That's what we're going to do. Wait, no. Uh... Bog. Sure. Sure. Okay. Now we're going to get a reagent from that. Now we're going to get two Silver Sage here. And then we can heal her. And then she can go back and... I don't know. So these guys hit us if we... Oh, gosh. Um, I'm a little... Con a little concerned. A little concerned. Sell these and buy another explore card and explore um so i guess i should send my familiar after these i hate for i hate to kill one of my familiars okay we have another bog Oh, okay. So the familiar is frozen. So that's... That's a, that's a thing. Okay. Um... Okay, let's... Uh, okay. Well, we're going to freeze them. Too bad. Too bad. The void icicle is almost dead. Um... So they're just going to die. Hopefully. Talk to me the dupe, though, I guess. Whoever comes out second. Yeah. Luck of the draw, really. Okay, I have Celestial Dew. That's good, because I was out of those. I got another Capri. I don't know what to do with that. I guess we'll find out. Oh, God. A Frost Crystal. Combined with a Familiar to create a Frost Weaver. Okay, sure. That means... I guess that means a particular kind of magic wielder. Large and unfriendly. Is there anyone else... No. I just needed a reagent, man. Oh. Okay. Finish this exploration. Then we can heal, maybe. Okay. There we go. Heal. I just need to heal before the end of the day because she might get attacked by this void beast, which I don't like at all. <laughs> Secret reagent, man. Okay. So we're going to heal... I didn't want her to die. She only, oh, it only heals two. Uh-oh. Okay, some crystal deposits, population growth spell, steel link. This feels like, maybe I wasted that. Um, I should have done population growth or maybe summon a familiar mana reagents. Well, at least I'm popping out reagents. That's good. <laughs> popping out reagents. That sounds funny. Okay. Um, I don't think this counts as a terrain. Whatever. We're going to do this. Moved out. Philippines. Asian. 
I don't think that's how that works. What do I do with these crystals? I guess I'm... <sighs> Molly's making friends at Fairy City. We are not making friends here at Fairy City. <laughs> this, is, this is not... We do need more Silver Sage. Gosh. I think you're right. I think you're right, Rain. I'm a bit... I'm overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed. Um, okay, well, at least I have three hearts. They're going to unfreeze overnight. I have space for more familiars, but I don't have the reagents to make it happen. I guess I need another... I can sell some void salts and a rock thing. You know what? Sell some mana. There we go. Sell a mana. And let's buy an explore card. And okay. Sell this. Okay. All right. Perfect. <clears throat> okay. Um,. I don't want to freeze. I don't want to freeze again. Oh gosh. Large and unfriendly. Okay, well, terrain. Terrain, that's good because that means I can get more reagents. Okay, crystal deposit. It's not what I want. I don't want a crystal either. Okay, well, I got a reagent, so that's good. I guess I could use these for another... Oh, no. I'm just going to keep these crystals. It's fine. Um, a familiar is what I want. Summon familiar. Mana, reagents, and a witch. Mana, reagents, and a witch. There we go. All right, we're summoning a familiar. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Oh, God, this is going to attack. I don't want it to attack me. I'm set upon my one enemy. Mm. Okay, there's a fairy fighter here. Um Okay. Uh <clears throat> cast a spell that creates building. I can do that. Maybe. I can do that. Fairy fighter. So I guess we'll fight this with this faded familiar. It's this guy's gonna, this guy's gonna die. Okay, so we'll use them there. Okay, this fate of familiar is gonna die anyway. So sorry, so sorry. Um. Okay, we are summoning a new familiar, so that's nice. And I guess I'll use the frost crystal to make them a frostling or whatever that is. Rest in peace, faded familiar. Hey, where's the... Okay, there we go. Sorry. Oh god, the cards multiplied. They keep going. Um. Okay, this familiar... I don't know if there's a possible way to... Okay, so we've got void salts and we've got a bone. Nice. Um. Do I need... Mm, a frost weaver. A blizzard rage is within... I guess I'll need, maybe I need another familiar. Let's see. Um, why is this alchemist keep turning off? Stop that. I would have, I would have so many more potions if I, if that stopped freezing. Diplomacy, befriend a fairy city. Oh, we're friends. Oh my god. Uh I guess I need to I need more moon drops. I need more I need more moon drops. I guess I need to do this quest. So what's the easiest way to make a Okay, Alchemist. I can make an where's the Alchemist spell? Here it is. Um two crystals and a witch. Okay, this is just to do, this is just to finish this quest for the, these guys. Okay, I have a familiar. 
Do I need to... I'm gonna send you to the training camp so you can attack Fairy City. Whatever happened to some games like Tor Fortress and Evil Line and Factorio? Oh, who knows, man. Oh, those were the good simple times. Uh, I really should be creating more mana. Wait, what do I do? Training camp and mana. Okay, to create a familiar. There we go. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're creating a familiar, uh, creating a warrior so we can attack Fairy City because this thing is annoying the heck out of me. Um, <clears throat> can you become a frostweed? No, you can't. Okay, we did it. Moon drop, coin, coin. Okay, we can sell the alchemist. Um,. We can explore some more. We can sell this. <laughs> um, so, right, this is Witch Hand. So, D Dwarf Fortress is easy to set up a base and watch your dwarfs go insane. This is like QuickBooks had a baby with Solitaire. What? Except it's cute. <laughs> Uh, so an art, an artist, um, once you get a good base going, you sit back and relax until they're attacked by Cyclops. So yeah, this is called Witch Hand. Uh, this was, set, a code was sent to me by the developer. I believe it's, a uh, one developer. Um, and they, they said it has the same energy of Stacklands, which if you played that before, that's a, that's another, a deck, it's a, like a colony civilization, a colony sim deck builder. So it's, um, yeah, but here you basically, you choose your witch, like you can choose uh, different witches. Um, so we chose the, the easiest difficulty because, you know, this is the first time we're playing this game. Uh, the game does have a demo, a free demo out right now. And the game is coming out on February 7th. I have no idea how much it is, uh, but I was sent a code by the developer and it's very, it's very polished like so far. I've like it's been um it's also been like introducing concepts in a nice way i might have to check out this demo and if you yeah and uh if it looks good you know if it looks like something you'd like to wishlist it which helps the game like uh go up in the rankings as well so like if you can't if you can't buy it or you know if you're not interested in buying it but you you know it's the kind of game you might you might look at or whatever wishlist it I, we stand, we stand indie developers here. I'm on day 22 as well. Um, I'm not sure what day the demo goes to. I have a feeling probably to the first waypoint. That seems like, seems like one of those places. We have gotten past the first waypoint. I have a warrior. Okay, now the warrior is gonna attack Fairy City. Okay, this is bad Fairy City. This is good Fairy City, as you can see. Um. Rosie too. Yeah. Oh yeah. Good. Good shout. Uh, shift click. Rosie. Rosie too. There we go. Rest in peace, Rosie. <laughs> Poor baby. Last Rosie was also a warrior. Yeah, she did such a good job. She did her best. Oh, we got reagents. Um. Wait. What was it? What else did I need reagents for? Another familiar, I think. Population growth. Oh, you know, we really should. Three moon drops for a beacon. I think we have two. Um, we probably, you know what? We're gonna save up our moon drops. Oopsies, my bad. Uh. Yeah, so I've I've really been enjoying this game, as you can tell, because I'm still like hyper focused playing it. So we're friends with Fairy City, which is nice. Um, we're attacking this Fairy City. We have a lot of crystals. Um, yes, we could go after these crystal deposits. We've got two reagents now, which is good. That's good. Uh, we can recycle this terrain there we go um 
Okay, there we go. More so many crystals. Uh, hopefully, why does this? Okay, this alchemist keeps turning off, and that makes me sad. Alchemist, you're making, you're making me sad. This alchemist is as lazy as I am. Put something ne sunny next to the Capri of Capri Sun. <laughs> I had a moldy Capri Sun once on accident. Um, do not recommend. I do not recommend that. Do not have that. Even on accident. Is that a bug? It might be a bug. Yeah, I think it might be. Um, yeah, it might. Because uh, I don't think that's supposed to happen. I don't think that's supposed to occur. I'm going to take this training camp. Oh, warriors can attack foreign cities, but it has to be slotted, I think. Okay. There we go. Ooh, nice. We're attacking Fairy City. Moldy Capri Sun. Yeah, it had like um, floating like white. Not like that. But floating like, you know, floating mold. Finding out food was dodgy after you've had it is so sad. Yeah, so like I drank it and I felt like you could, you know, it was textured, which is not, Capri Sun's not supposed to be textured. And then I opened it like I opened up <laughs> floating balls. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Um, I opened it up and it was moldy and I was like, okay, I'm never drinking these again. I mean, I was a full on like adult. Uh, <laughs> and I probably shouldn't have been having Capri Sun anyway, but they, I was like buying them at Costco and they're cheap, you know? Okay, got a moon drop and some money. So now I can put these together and make a beacon textured yes 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 indeed okay Oof. okay you fight the fairy fighter chewy capri sun not good not good mm -mm. that was not <laughs> not good um i guess i need more terrain here i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna explore some more Exploring is fun. I think I have... Okay, I do have the... Oh, I do have the way... Okay, I do have the waypoint. I have to keep checking this alchemist. Wow, this Capri Sun has boba. Oof, it wasn't textured like that. It was... It was not good. It was not good. I guess we can make a home in the plains. Oh, we got three potions. Okay. Spells. Embassy spell. Storage chest. Capri pen. We're going to make a Capri pen. Yeah. Because it only takes four crystals and a witch. I don't know what a Capri pen does, but we're going to find out. The floating balls. <laughs> Capri sun has more balls than you throw it away. <laughs> okay. Faded familiar. You did so good. We have bones. I don't know what we're going to do with those, but... <laughs> it was a floating ball to confuse Paula. Oh. No, I wasn't. I wish. <laughs> it would have been better. It was just like floating. I don't know. You know what I mean? Like floating. Uh, floating texture. Oh, more reagents. He has to be in his element. Yeah, we do have to make more population growth. But I think we're going to make a beacon first. Beacon just keeps making me think of bacon. Mongry. It's airing of grossness. <laughs> I'm glad that I, uh... Oh, no. No, not a voidling. Oh, you fight this. You fight the city. Okay. These poor familiars. Um, do I have a... Do I have a quest? No, I finished my quest, so I got another moon drop, I think. Okay, we got void salts. Um, this familiar is... <laughs> Doing its best. Doing its level best here. Work on the crystal deposits. Rosie's attacking the city. Uh, they do not like us. I'm making a... Oh, wait. Hold on. I'm making a Capri pen. Which is not where we're going to drink Capri Sun. Because of reasons. Void salts. Anything like bath salts. Um... This is a good question. It's likely. It seems likely at this point. Okay, we're still attacking this town. 
They're, they really don't like us. Capri Sun trauma. Yeah. Yeah. It, it wasn't good. It wasn't good. I've had that. I mean, I've had that for like 15 years. I think it was like 20 or 21 when I had a bad. Capri to give them a loving home. Oh. Um. Okay. Poke the straw through in the cafeteria. It's not working. <sighs> yeah, it's true. Stab it all the way through. Oh no. Yeah, we've all done it. Okay, I need population. I need a... Okay. <sighs> it's fine. This is fine. Um, this is fine. I'm going to sell some void salts <laughs> and a, and some rock glims and we're going to get an explore card okay, get rid of this Capri pen or crystal deposits. It's always sunny with Capri sun. No, it's not. It's not anyone. <laughs> Man, that's pretty gross. Uh, I already have a mountain. Oh, oh, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're taking care of Fairy City. I hope we take care of Fairy City before the day is over. Okay. So, uh, we have terrain. Ro okay, we're gonna, we're gonna terrain recycle again. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, what does the bog do? Bog is reagents. Mana or reagents? Hmm. Okay, we're gonna go with reagents. That's what we're gonna go with. Okay, I had to make sure it was on. Is this still on? Yeah, we're all on now. Okay, we got another crystal deposit. Fate of familiar, you deal with that. Got more crystals. Um. Okay, now we need to make a beacon. Three moon drops and a witch. And we're gonna make a home in the bog. Just trust me. Rosie, oh, Rosie's doing so good. She's gonna take this out. Screw you, fairy city. Bam. Nice. <gasps> Exterminate, destroy the fairy city. We got moon drops. Oh my gosh, guys, this is huge. This is big if true. Okay, moon drop and reagent. And then after we're finished with this beacon, uh, there we go. Beacon spell, get rid of that. You talk to yourself like when you play, yes. Uh, I didn't used to, but now I do. I noticed like uh, even, so I don't play games uh, off stream. Like I used to, I used to do that a lot when I lived on my own. Uh, we have a potion. How's this going? They're both still on, good. Um. Yeah, what was I saying? <laughs> I don't remember. It was probably important though. It's probably important. Okay, we're doing population growth spell. We're gonna do this for the meadow village. We're doing a summoning beacon. Right, I used to play games with people a lot off stream too. Um, the darkness is silent this night. So I did find myself like even when I'd play with people off stream, I need to bring two reagents and I'll get more moon drops. So what a good day. Well, I get one more moon drop. Bam. And some money. Okay. Okay. Population growth. We're going to take the training camp out of here. Put the population growth here. This will give us another slot in the meadow village. Um, and then we can start getting silver sage again. We can sell it for dough. Okay, we have another potion. We can learn a spell. Sorcerer's School? Maybe a storage chest. Yeah, sure. Let's learn storage chest spell. Count slotching. <laughs> okay, we need four crystals to store or something. Okay, you do this. Okay. Um, 
We're making a summoning beacon. Oh, whoops, we're paused. Okay, we have another bone. Got a bone to pick. We have two capris. Okay, we've got a beacon combined with a land card and a witch. We're com a bog and once you're done making a storage chest. Okay, we have the meadow village. We're gonna put a herbalist, an herbalist and the capri pen here. There we go. I can actually sell some of these rock limbs too. There we go. All right. Um, yeah, so I do, I do, I do talk to myself like this. No, I, it's not, I'm not something I'm proud of, <laughs> but I do. Wait, what is this? Um, once I'm done making a storage chest, I'm going to move her. Okay, I have a storage chest, which is not where I'm going to put my crystals. Bam. So many crystals. <laughs> Kind of a habit while playing games. Yeah, I did a lot. I did a lot when like, here, sell this. This is like, how cute is this? Look. Okay, we do have moon drops. We have mana. I need, um, I need another mana, like, maker. <laughs> Where do I put it? I could probably put it... Okay, we'll we'll figure it out. I'll put the man. Maybe I'll put the mana maker here. Um, because we're about to have a another town. Okay, we got a bog village. That does not sound appetizing. Let's pause. Terrain recycler goes here for reagents. Um, I don't know what the. Oh wait, hold on. I have a capri pen. Can I put like two capris in here? Capri, I guess we get Capri horns. That's nice. So crystal quarry in the mountain village, uh, reagents and a mana extractor here. Um, okay. Mana extractor. Oh, so you just click on, you just click once and it'll spit them out. Okay, cool. And then I uh, wonder what else. This game is so cool for one person to have made. Yeah, it's great. It's it's been really fun. As you can tell, I'm like hyper focus. Um Okay, so I want to make another familiar. Uh um summon familiar. Mana reagents. Mana, reagent, and the witch. There we go. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Everything's working now. Okay. Everything's working. We're summoning another familiar. Okay. Let's get rid of that. Uh, population growth spell. We can do another one of these. Reagents and a witch. And this increases the slots on these, um, on these. Okay, whoops, my bad. Okay, we have a potion. That Molly, Molly is, uh, snoring. <laughs> Molly's snoring. It's fine, it's fine. It's adorable. Okay, so now I can combine these and it'll make a frost weaver. Which, I don't know what that means, but seems good. Seems like a good thing to have. Molly's over here making money moves. The witching hour is upon us. The darkness is silent, but I think it's a full moon. The council offers a boon for a price. That's good, because I think a wonder quest. Okay, let's do population growth. We'll add another slot here in the mountain village. Uh, we have a frost weaver. Freezes enemies, frozen units, unfreeze at the beginning of the next day. Look at this. Look at this little familiar. Look at the baby. So now we need 20. Where's our herbalist? Our herbalist? Oh my god, I forgot. I need to put silver sage here to make more. I was hoping I was making silver sage this whole time, and I was not. This game is so cool for having 
one person having made it yeah it is really cool uh we have two potions um okay all right these are all of our familiars right now bam and we are uh hold on i guess we'll get another mana there we go population growth spell we do have one more moon drop but i kind of want to save it just in case of emergency um we're getting a this is fine this is fine we're good i think we're good everything's fine i do feel like i should uh okay buy an explore card do this explore some stuff Okay, only have two hearts. I feel like I should heal. That's probably a good idea, because when I'm exploring, if I get a traveler, explore 100 times. Ooh, nice. Okay, okay, this will give us, okay. Ooh, we've got some mana. Uh, Let's see. So we'll need to do a healing touch spell so that our witch can heal to Silver Sage and one reagent and our witch. So once she's done exploring, hopefully she won't run into any. Be rewarded with a wonder? Oh, I wonder what that means. So healing touch heals two hearts. And only on the witch. What is this? An uncommon resource. I think... I think that was... Uh, okay. So we're healed here. Get rid of this. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, I guess we could put a training camp here. Is there anything else? The celestial link here just to put it somewhere. Um, how many coins? We have 11 coins. We can make some more and then 15. Could sell a mana. Okay, now we have 20. Okay, there we go. We finished the wonder quest. You need barbecue sauce? How could you forget that? Okay, choose one. Mystic workflow, lunatorium, trade connections, or recursive armor? Recursive armor increases the armor cap to double the witcher familiar's max health. Trade connections, the trader arrives more frequently and sells a 25% discount. Automate stacks unoccupied familiars onto available explore and deposit cards. Uh, plus one choice options when learning a new spell. Okay, we're gonna go with recursive armor. Yeah, that's what I want. We learned a wonder. Okay, recursive armor. Oh, oh my gosh, my foot is asleep. My foot is asleep. What have I done? Okay, um... Time is it? Oh, it's 6.30. Gal's been at work today. Um, let's see. Uh... Sorry, I'm looking at a thing. Gmail is 50% full. Sorry. I got um Okay. I need to use the restroom again. Um I'll be right back. One second. Watch these clips. I'll be right back. I know, I saw that. I 
my friends. Look. No, my teeth are white. They really are. I promise. Oh, my God. Let's see, it's 7 a.m. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> go. Go. <laughs> Get out of here. Get out. Hi, baby. Hi. She's so cute. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in you. Really? She's gotten really, she's gotten really prissy. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. There you go. There you go. I held R. I'm holding E. Just so you all know. I died. I died. Turn around Every now and then I'll get a ghost in my face And then it explodes and I'm like Have fun the in the bathroom Turn around <laughs> 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 That was so stupid <laughs> I loved it, it was hilarious <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's a clip Guys, I need to get better at telling people to clip stuff Oh, but I just think such dumb stuff. Then I'm <laughs> oh no. What is that face? Okay. Um. Okay. So. I'm really sorry. My hands are cold. Um. Let's see. What are we? I was thinking something. Oh, I realized. Um, that I have not really seen any movies this year. Like, I haven't seen much this year. I've watched movies that came out this year, besides, like, crappy Netflix movies. I watched Barbie and Saltburn. But, like, for Best Picture... So, Best Picture nominations are American... I actually don't know what most of these are about. American Fiction, Anatomy of a Fall, Barbie, The Holdovers, Killers of the Flower Moon, Maestro, Past Lives, Poor Things, Oppenheimer, and The Zone of Interest. I don't know anything about any of those. I mean, except Barbie, right? Um, and I guess I know what Oppenheimer is about. Um, and I sort of know what Killers of uh, the Killers of a Flower Moon, Killers of the Flower Moon, sort of know what that's about. But, um, yeah, I realize I've not really seen, not really seen anything, not really seen anything. Let's, um, oh, spells are now four potions, uh-oh, okay. Recursive armor, wonders are built in stages, combined with five crystals, three, four, five, and the witch, okay. All right, we're building recursive armor. Love that for us. It's doubling. Oh, wait, I'm paused. Just kidding. You can also, like, run it faster. Ooh, a third potion. We got some more silver sage. <clears throat> we can sell it for four, four gold here, which is a lot. But I also need it for healing. Hi, Gilly. How are you? Okay, we've got another crystal. We've got another potion. Oh, <laughs> Oof. okay. All right, embassy, sorcerer school. Trains familiars into apprentices who are able to cast spells. Envoys who are able to improve relations with fairy cities. Okay, um, let's just, let's make a sorcerer school. Yeah, sure. You're booked in for your first tattoo? Ooh, congratulations. That's cool. The witching hour is upon us. I love that for us. That's awesome. Congrats, Gilly. What are you gonna... Ooh, the trader arrives. I wonder if they're selling anything I need. I genuinely don't know what to do with spell pages. Um, I don't know how to use bones yet. I guess I could use reagents. 
That's what I could use. Some more reagents. Um. Okay. How many coins do I have? Okay, let's sell a bone. And now we can get a reagent. There we go. Bam. Feel like that was a good purchase. Yeah, that's awesome. Congrats, Gilly. I'm jealous. I have never been able to like settle on something. You know what I mean? Okay, I guess I could go for another reagent here. And one, two, three, uh, mana. We are still looking, I'm still trying to get another Capri horn. Almost there. Little cat paw with Rosie in it. Yeah, I thought about getting the Rosie emote. Okay, we got another Capri horn. So we just need three crystals. One, two, three. Oh, whoops. Um, not what I meant to do. Okay, they just kind of. Okay, there we go. And once I'm done with recursive armor. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's okay. It's all good. Okay, we have recursive armor. Incomplete wonder. Okay, so... Okay, now we need five mana. Oh boy. Okay. Oof. How's this not working anymore? Oh man. Uh, I wonder if that wasn't working because it had too many silver sage on top of it. Okay, we have some mana. We're working on more mana. Um, we're working on a sorcerer's school. Our our relationship with Fairy City is good. That's good. We make some money off of them. I need five mana. Making one more. Okay, this is fine. This is good. Everything's going well. Yeah, I'm doing all right. Um, I mean, I'm doing oh, I'm doing okay. You know. Uh, oops, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, we're gonna have one more mana. Okay, I had a lot of crystals. Combine with a familiar and mana to create an apprentice. Okay. So we have a sorcerer's school just bopping around over here. That means we need to slot another. Oh, there goes the crystal. Um okay, there we go. Okay. We have two potions. We have another reade. Gent, which can go over here. Um, we probably need population population growth. Moon drop. Um Okay. Here, give us this. Population growth. Moon drop and a reagent. And this. And get rid of this. This will give us another slot in one of these villages. Honestly, we probably need, um, I don't know what we need. I don't know what we need. I don't know what we need. Okay, <laughs> mm. now we have all the mana and we can do this. After the witch is done here, have all these familiars. I wonder what else I can do. Okay, we have potion. Okay, let's take these silver sage. These are for healing. Okay, now we have population growth. We can... Um, we're not using the terrain recycler. So we'll add a... We'll add something in Bog Village. Look at Molly. I know Molly's such a sweetheart. I can hear her snoring behind me sometimes. It's so cute. My, my sweet girl. Are we paused? No, we're not. Okay, this is good. This is good. Okay, wait. Do I have another moon drop? I don't. Uh, I feel like maybe I should explore. Oh, here. Making recursive armor. Don't worry about it. 
think it's I think it's just for one character. The witching hour is upon us. Okay, we have a quest from the Council of Fates. Fated quest. What is this? Use a merchant to trade with a fairy city. Okay. Oh, 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 nice. Perfect timing. All right. We've got a moon drop. We've got a moon drop, folks. I think maybe we should make a new village. So we have a bog village, mountain village, meadow village, and ma a forest village. But we need more. We need one in um, the barrens, I think. So I think we can... Okay, so Bog Village, Terrain Recycler here, and a Sorcerer School. So Familiar and a Mana to make a magic, make a magic cat. It's fine. Just trust me. Just trust me. <laughs> so we have a Capri Horn as well. We're working on, I guess we're still trading with Fairy City. We're very good with fairy city i don't know what what do you do with spell pages i haven't figured that out yet um i guess i could sell okay, i'm gonna sell some rock glems i'm gonna buy an explorer and i'll have the frost weaver go explore go ahead sweet baby you're doing such a good job. I killed off one of my faded familiars, which feels bad now. I have Rosie too, because Rosie is dead. Okay, we have another reagent. Not really what I want right now. <laughs> now that I have plenty, they're like, oh, have more. Okay, bog. What I really want is barons. <sighs> You're doing such a good job, little baby. If anyone wants me to name a... Okay. Everyone wants me to name a familiar after their cat. I can do that. Okay. We do have a bog. I guess we'll need another. Okay. Crystals in the storage chest. Um, I guess we can. Uh, make a mana. There we go. Hey, we got some crystal. We do have some more crystals. How many? What can I sell? Shadow. Oh, I forgot to name one of them Shadow. Okay. Yeah. Uh. Hold on. Shadow. There we go. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Um. So we have Shadow. Yeah, definitely. So this has a this has a demo. I think I need more explore. Let's sell some rock glims. There we go. We'll explore again. Okay. A recursive armor armor cap increased to double the witch or familiar's max health. Okay. Okay. Armor cap increased. Double the witch or familiar's max health. Does that mean... How do I... How do I use it? How do I use a recursive armor? Hmm. Bring me the horizon design. Nothing too crazy for my first one. That's really cool. That'll be cool, Gilly. How long do you have until you get to okay, Frost Weaver Explore? Project Media is a tattoo designed by a famous band, but I don't know which one. Um. Okay, we have another mana. That's good. Next Friday. Oh, that's so cool. Hey. Okay, we've got potions. Soul trainer? Healing weight. Oh, 
Restores one health to all familiars. Oh, heck yeah. Okay. And then, okay. What is Soul Train? Soul Train returns any trained familiar to their base familiar form. Oh, okay. Right. Um, Healing Wave. Yeah. Yeah. Haunter. That's further down the line. Um, okay, so that'll heal. I guess I can wait. I can wait healing wave. But now I know how to heal these nerds. I don't know how to use recursive armor. Okay, we have another fairy city. What is this? Uh, oh. Okay. Flora gems. I've never seen those. Uh, do I have an embassy? Have I learned embassy yet? No, I haven't. Okay, so this will be our last trade there. We'll put some silver sage and sell them over there. Okay. Okay, Molly, go to Fairy City. You're doing so good. Okay, Fairy City. Okay, I need another merchant, I guess. <laughs> A phoenix tattooed. That's cool. Um, a market. I need to. I need a familiar at a market. Hold on. I need to make a familiar. Something familiar. Mana reagents. I have it. Mana reagents and a witch. Right? Yeah. Okay. We're gonna make a familiar and we're gonna train them at the market. Oh wait. I need more mana. Hold on. Heck. Man extractor, there we go. It's fine. This is fine. Uh, summoning a familiar. Okay, get rid of that. We have a frost weaver, little nerd. I don't know what to do with recursive armor. Molly is a first class class trader. She's so good. She's so good. I'm so proud of her. Okay, that'll give us a way to like make money. I don't know what these flora gems are. I guess they'll just make us money. So, uh, work on this crystal deposit. The witching hour. The darkness is silent this night. Okay, we have a quest. Can we do it? We're gonna try. Cast a spell that creates a building. Okay, we can do that. I think. Meow, jo <laughs> Meow Jones. <laughs> uh, we got a crystal. Okay. Um, <laughs> look at this little familiar, the sweet baby. One, two, three. We're gonna make more mana. <laughs> Too good. <laughs> okay, cast a spell that creates a building. Okay. Um, I think probably the alchemist. Okay, the alchemists are still working. That's good. Crystal. Put the design on my Discord. Oh, awesome. Thank you. Molly is working with this fairy city to make it like us more. That's good. Okay, we have a Flora gem. A popular trade good in the ninth, valued by certain cities. Okay. So, she's working on this. Um... We're, let's see. Oh, right. I wanted to put some silver sage here to sell it. Cause we're, we're in good with these guys. So yeah, let me check. Let me look at it. I wonder how to use recursive armor. That's something I'm a bit confused about. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's awesome. That's gonna look great. Oh, wait, familiar. I wanted to train my familiar to do something. Oh, to be a merchant. Be a merchant. I believe in you. Um, let's see, I can make a building. So I'm going to make an alchemist to 
this is just for a quest, basically. So I can get another moon, another moon drop. Okay, we've got a potion. I think we. Oh no, we don't. Okay. Um, I'm selling my silver sage here at Fairy City. Going on my inner forearm. So cool. I'm so jealous. I want to get a tattoo, but I've never been able to like side on one under the elbow bend to halfway around oh, that's cool that will be awesome all right we made an alchemist now we're gonna sell it because we don't need it well it's not that we don't need it it's just you know okay we got a moon drop and more money ban the belgian comedian had a tattoo was by him oh that's cool that's awesome bring me the horizon oh wait h-i-m ah uh, there you go just under the elbow bend like whatever the like the technical term for the bend in your elbow like i know I'm, there's a medical term for everything so i imagine okay we're tattoo a few times a year for a few years now i feel like i've been saying that too someday someday Okay, I'm... Oh, wait. I was supposed to... I'm supposed to give mana to train them as a... How do I use recursive armor? Armor cap increased. To double... The witch or familiar's max health. I don't know how to use that. Okay. Uh, merchant. I'm selling the Silver Sage right now. Um. Oh no, see this froze. I didn't want that to happen. I was supposed to be growing Silver Sage this whole time. Okay, I was making sure now that the other one's froze too. Boo. That makes me sad. The elbow bendy bit. Yeah, yeah. The witching hour. Uh-oh. I think there's, um... No moon. We probably get some void. The void is moving against me. Ooh, my... Ooh, my hand is cold. Uh-oh. Um... Okay. So... I got some coins over here. Got some money. We have another void rift. I wonder what... I guess I'll keep this silver sage. Okay, so maybe... Oh boy, okay. Uh, maybe... I don't know what to do here. Clip of the tattoo being designed by H.I.M., one of the comedian's favorite bands, on a Belgian metal festival. It's cool if you have Kevin and I will do something like that and have it on you forever. Yeah, that is really cool. Um, shoot. Armor work on Rosie. Let's see. No. No, I'm not really sure how to use it. And I tried to put it on like these bad guys too. Like. Hmm. Okay, well. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. No shift click. Yeah, no. Hmm. I'm not sure. Okay, well... Okay. Splits in half when defeated? Oh no. I hate that for us. Uh. Okay. There. Okay, now you fight them. Okay, now, now we've got these little jerks. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not sure what to do with these. 
Hmm. Okay, now you fight this little... Oh no. Uh, we're gonna need a... Healing... Touch. This is Silver Sage. And a reagent. Yeah. So we'll heal her after because this is, I mean, it's kind of a. Okay, we got void salts. Just kind of hang out over here. Um, I guess. I'm a little worried about their health. So I guess the Frost Weaver can go after this jerk. And you're going to go heal. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to use recursive armor. Okay, let's get the Silver Sage out of here. Okay, Frost Weaver. Now I want um, Healing Wave. That's going to take five Silver Sage. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, Maybe we shouldn't sell this one. <laughs> okay. One, two, three. We need two more... Silver Sage. Rick. Uh, I might explore. Here, go explore. <laughs> go explore. Um, so she's healing up. Okay, she's healed. I was trying. I don't know. I'm not sure how to use recursive armor. That's um. Okay, I'm trying to take out these void slimes. Uh. Here we can. Let's fight this one. I'm trying to use. I'm trying to. Oh no! There's a void lane. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, no. Um, you fight the... Wait, hold on, no. Because when the Void Slimes attack, I think they're going to attack my witch. So... We need... Okay, you're going to attack... Oh, gosh. Yeah, I'm a bit concerned with the... Okay, Frost Weaver is in a pickle. Meadow Village. Um, kind of feel like maybe, maybe I could. You know what? We're gonna use Molly. We're gonna use Molly. Um. Okay, Molly did so good. Gosh. Okay, we're gonna use Molly against this small void slime. We also need to kill this voidling. Okay, we're gonna use this random merchant. Molly needs a heal. We're trying to work on Silver Sage. We're making more Silver Sage for healing. We have reagents. Um, Molly's struggling. Everyone's struggling a bit with their health. Uh, heck. Okay, no, I don't want to do that. Um, Shadow, you fight them. Okay, and then I'm trying to not let the day finish and me die. You know what I mean? Okay, we have... We need to wait for one more silver... Okay, all right. Okay. Okay. We're gonna put Molly back in Fairy City. Merchant, you go in Fairy City. Um... So right now we have three, which is a 
problem. Because if they're if they're still here by the end of the day, they cause me great pain. I'm trying to get enough silver sage to heal all my familiars. Um. Okay, let's. Uh, okay, I think we'll be okay. I think we've got this. Okay. This is gonna bring her to two, and if he attacks overnight, it'll bring me to one. That's fine though, because I'll be alive. I still don't know what to do with her curse of armor. I was hoping it would double my armor somewhere, but. Uh, maybe like, I, I don't know. I haven't been able to figure out where it goes or like how to use it. Uh, we still have one bad guy, but I think it's just gonna attack me, which is okay. Okay. All right. Um, <clears throat> merchants are merchanting. If I split this void slime, it's bad. Yeah. Okay. Um, we're just, just growing some silver sage over here. Okay. Yeah. Let's speed to the end of the day. The witching hour is upon us. I am set upon by one enemy. That's fine. Okay, two Capri horns for this quest. Um, uh, there we go. Okay, single speed. We got a moon drop and some money. That's fine. We just need one more silver sage. We're so close. We got a moon drop. That's good. All right. Now we'll take these two silver sage and a reagent and a witch and we'll heal all of our familiars by one and then maybe we can take out a void slime maybe <laughs> maybe um we might need to sacrifice the king <laughs> okay all the familiars healed one that's good so uh sh shadow mm. rosie two <laughs> rosie two go for it rosie two is gonna go for it it'll be fine trust me oh we do have another spell soul trainer temple of rights is used to perform rights okay that's fine cool moon drop bone and witch okay yeah sure let's do that um, Temple of Right spell can only be cast once. Okay. Let's find out what it is. Temple of Rights. We also need a Silver Sage. Healing Wave. Okay. Uh, we need, like, a healing... I don't know. We need to take care of the Void Slime. Anyway. <laughs> Whatever happens. Um... Okay, so now we just need someone. Okay, Frostweaver, you hit once. Hit one time. Okay, now we're left with these small void slimes. We're gonna need to make some more. Oh, come on. Why are you fro? Why are you freezing? I don't know why it, why it froze while it was making Silver Sage. That's like a problem. Okay, uh. <laughs> That's a problem that I'm gonna need to resolve within myself. Um, uh, bog. I was looking for barons. Why can I not recurse farmer? A temple of wrongs you use to commit wrongs. Exactly. Yeah, you get it. Okay, temple of rights. I don't know what the temper of light spell is, but we're gonna do it. Um, we're gonna make it. We've got this. Oh, wait, I need to fight these slimes. These slimes need to go. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay, now these familiars are gonna be... Okay. We have no bad guys now, but we need to heal again. 
Okay, everyone get in a stack. Just stay safe, y'all. I would absolutely purchase some... I wish I hadn't sold my Silver Sage. That, that seems poorly... That seems like poor choices now that, now that it's done, you know? Recursive armor. I don't know how to do that. Oh, hey, thank you, Scottle. Slotted right cards are sacrificed to perform rites. Temple of rites must cool down before another rite can be performed. Uh. Okay. Faded familiar. Maybe. What does this mean? Uh, Temple of Rites. Like a bone? Hmm. Glorious purpose. Like, that sounds right, right? No. Okay. No. No. Um. Hmm. Oh, well. I think I'll figure it out eventually. What do we have there? We have bone and shadow. Okay. So, they're just going to vibe here for a second. <laughs> it's fine. I kind of want to explore, but I also kind of don't because I'm worried that we'll get another... I'm worried we'll have another, um... Maybe I should make another familiar. Fam summon familiar. Mana, reagents, and... Um... Me. Okay. Let's make another familiar. <laughs> Oh wait, uh, we've got five out of five. I guess I could let one die, but we'll have one just in case. We'll have an extra familiar in case. In case something happens to one of ours. Uh, the witch can't die though, I think. That would, uh, the witch dying would be very bad. Um, I do need another silver sage to heal. I really don't want to go. To, to bed without. I've got these Flora gems. The thing is I have plenty of money. Okay, all of these things are still working. These are still working. These are still working. Okay, everything is working. One, two, three. We're gonna make some mana. Uh, I guess we'll recycle these bogs and we'll make some reagent out of that. Uh, I guess I'll figure out what the Temple of Rites is for. Okay. I hate going, uh, like, finishing the day with only one health. It's freaking me out. Freaking me out, man. But we need another Silver Sage to heal her. I don't want to use my last two or I won't be able to make more. It's fine. Don't worry. Everything's fine. It's fine. Okay, we got some mana. Switching hours upon us. <laughs> One health. I don't know how to use, I don't know how to use my armor. Bring crystals. Oh, I love that. Love that. Do it. Do it to it. Okay. We have two silver sage and we're going to heal her with it. A uh, healing touch. Silver sage and a reagent and the witch. Okay, that'll heal her too. A... Moon drop and some money. Love that. Perfect. Okay, we have this familiar. 
And we've got another potion. She's healed. We're better there. I have a feeling we're supposed to... Hmm. I wonder if maybe... No. I'm trying to think and see what goes in the Temple of Rites. Familiar with familiars. Yeah. Um, let's pause. So now we need enough Silver Sage to... Oh, okay. We should probably explore. Yeah, let's explore. Okay. If anyone has any ideas about how to make... Okay. Right of Iron. All familiars plus one armor. Hi! Please just write a bone and a familiar into the temple of rites to sacrifice them and perform the rite. Okay. Ooh, second waypoint. Okay. Uh, I guess we're going to sacrifice a familiar. <laughs> mm hmm. Yeah, it's fine. Rest in peace. Okay. Poor Shadow. <laughs> Sorry. You did so good. Um, okay. I probably should have sacrificed like a random. <laughs> Poor, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Hi, babe. How are you? The squeezy little baby behind me. Oh, hi. Uh, I'm playing a game. It's called Witch Hand. Like Witch Hand is the image? You just. You're a, I think I should have taken a, I should have taken a um, note of how many people made that joke. Or that was Pretty sure on five. Yeah. Did you end up playing Dotage? Oh, I did. I did. I really like Dotage. Dot age. Jow on that shirt. I know. He looks handsome. Um. Yeah. I played dot Dotage. Dot age. Very good. If I hadn't already spent money on the game or on so many games, I would buy it. Do you think people are complimenting this shirt to encourage me to recommend the size sleeveless black t-shirt? I don't know, but he, like... My... A wild jow appeared. Yeah. Red dress shirt. Oh, yeah, he no. used to. He, I mean, when he went into work every day, you know. But, um, it's a lot more comfortable. I mean, and... Can confirm it's a lot more comfortable to wear, you know, a t shirt. Uh, working. Yeah, I have the cat cam on. Which, like, on her little box. She's very thoughtfully rubbing along my black jeans. <laughs> oh no! He's putting cat hair all over his jeans. I get not wearing dress shirts. I don't like it myself. Yeah. Oh, I don't mind. It's just, uh. Mm -hmm. I know. Yeah, Jail's been claimed. Yep. That's right. <gasps> Taking it off me. Yeah. How about that? Okay. Yeah, she likes the she likes the little hoop. Girl, don't. I was in sleep the whole time. Oh, yeah, as soon as he comes in, she wants attention. Yep. That's how it works. She loves him. Girl. Big gray blur. That's that right there. Yep, there she is. There she is. Miss America. Well, there she is. Molly's jazz cat now. Oh, genuinely. Yeah. Paused right here. Aw, sweet baby. Oh, look at her cute little face. Hi, girly. Aw. Oh my gosh, she makes the cutest little sound. She goes when she's happy. She has like happy grunts. So funny. She's the happiest little cat I've ever seen. Look at her. Hi, girl. Hi, girly. Happy girl. She's like, nope. Yeah, she's good. All right. We got a happy. We got a happy. We got a happy girl face. 
I like the beard. The beard is Alyssa. Just treat her in witch hand. Yeah, Molly's doing so good. You're making some good economical moves. If only you do that in real life, Molly. I'm certainly not going to. <laughs> Molly's uh, scratching her face on the desk. That's good girl. She's gonna, she, yeah, she's gonna chase after you. <laughs> your, your pants don't have enough cat hair on them. <laughs> I'm gonna go get a... Hold on, I'll be right back. At least a second. Uh, Molly can't pause the second. Here, one sec. Zam, it just sounds like you hate women. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll see if I can set it up. Much has a little place where streamers can get together. My chat baby. My chat baby. My chat. That's where it's at. My chat. That's where it's at. Woo! I need healing. I should step in magma right now. I told him, thanks, Frosty Paws. You're trash. GG, easy. <laughs> um. Starts her chainsaw and revs it a few times to emphasize this. So you have 23 food left, and Zamy will tell her to cool it. <gasps> oh, oh my god, no. I need to play Death Road to Canada Zamy again. Y'all remember when I used to stream for 12 hours at a time? Cool it, cool it. Losers cool it. The group realizes this is a pretty bad idea. Trader revs up my hair looks so cute here. <gasps> I miss my hair. Maybe I should start wearing wigs. You know what the problem is though? Is wigs make my head itchy. Sorry, just random, just random tidbits of information. Uh, anyway. Talk to the pigeon. Okay. Oh, I was sick there. Okay. Um, hi, hello. Hi, hi, hello. Um, okay, which hand? Okay, so I'm gonna finish up in about 20 minutes or so. Gosh, I've really been enjoying this game. There we go. Um, really enjoyed the two games we played today. Dot age and which hand. Really appreciate the developer sending this key. It's been really lovely. This is like a more magical whimsical stack lands if if you liked that game the universe and yes oh yeah yeah good shout good shout uh we have all these flora gems i feel like maybe i should sell some i'm not sure if i'll ever okay let's buy another explore thing too um <clears throat> planes mana flows you know i want barons Oh, planes? Maybe planes? I don't know. Crystal deposit. I guess that's okay. Frostweaver, you go there. OK. 
Okay. Um. Oh no, this is paused again. These get paused sometimes. I think that might be that might be a not on purpose. Okay, we have another familiar. I think that might be a bug, like an accidental thing. Um, what did we lose? Maybe we can keep like a nor regular familiar. Um, we have all these crystals. Recursive armor isn't something you can use in the Temple of Rights. I tried that before. I tried that before. Oh, right. Well, it's on cooldown right now. Um, I tried it before and I don't think it. Oh, maybe this, I don't know. I'm not sure. I'll try. I'm going to try it. I'll try it again. I'm um, trying to get in good graces with this fairy city. Um, I wonder if they can do anything at these old, like at these, uh, no? Okay. Uh, we have planes. Oh, here's another explore. That's what I wanted. The witching hour's upon us. Okay, we have another faded quest. Defeat an enemy. I wonder if we can find an enemy. Oh, we have more planes. Okay. That's fine. Um, I guess we can take one plane and one bog. There we go. Um, if I want another moonstone. Oh my gosh. There's so many rock glems. Uh, reagents. All right, let's get another explore card. We've got some potions. Meadow. So funny. Just how it works. Hey, when you're like. Focusing on, oof, I need this kind of thing. Just doesn't show up. It's just how it is. It's RNG. Okay. Uh, I don't even need to put myself on that crystal deposit. I could have put like a random familiar on that. Uh, our temple of rights is still cooling down. Okay. Oh, whoops. Uh, there. There we go. Um, I guess we can. Save the meadow here. Okay, we're still working on Silver Sage. That's going well. Okay, doing the thing. Crystals. Um, we need to heal all the familiars, I think. They all need, yeah, they all need a heal. We're working on getting another spell, probably the second waypoint. That seems like a good place to, seems like a good place to. And we're still working. Oh, <laughs> Jow is um, boiling some water. <laughs> it's uh, made like a very weird sound in the. Okay, I feel like we should explore some more. I can sell a Capri horn, sure. Explore more. I wanted to do this quest. Oh, our day's over. Okay. The darkness is silent this night. It's a full moon though. It's gonna give us a boon. Love that. A golden quest. Okay. I think we can do that. We've got a lot of stuff we can sell. Ooh, ruins. Okay, nice. 
Um, contains forgotten treasure. Okay, you, random familiar. Oh, we got a void lane. Uh, that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. Okay, go after the void lane. Uh, this will give us something for faded quest. Perfect. Void salts. And we've got some star drop coins and another moon drop, which is lovely. I'm gonna let this hang out with the. Still can't these root. Ooh, we found a mana. I guess we could. Rosie can go to the crystal deposit. We just need 20 star drop coins, which is not bad. We could sell them here at Fairy City, but I'm kind of, kind of, oh, whoops, uh, kind of vibing with, um, like getting the, here, let's sell all these. We'll make some more money. How much money do we have? We have 13. Um, Let's put these crystals in the mana extractor. Uh, crystal. Um, 13, 13. Okay, let's sell some of these flora gems. Now we have 21. We can give the star drop coins over. Almost done. Perfect. Nice. Oh, hey, we have enough potions too. Okay, so we have a star, one star drop coin and summoning familiar. I guess we can sacrifice another familiar. Uh... Okay, we're gonna go for a spell. Right of courage. All familiars. Receive a temporary attack bonus. I don't like that. Um, embassy. Oh, wait. Oh, no. This is none of this is what I wanted. Um, hmm. Man. Uh, whatever. Embassy spell. Sure. Create an embassy. It's fine. We'll do that later. We can't summon a familiar. I guess we can make a familiar house. Familiar home. Three crystals and a witch. Okay, we can do that. Um, ooh, the witching hour. The darkness is silent this night. We have a quest. Use a merchant to trade. We are doing that. We're doing that. Regularly, that's going well. Familiar home, one, two, three. I wonder if I can stack familiar homes or if they take like an entire slot. I think it probably takes an entire slot. Um, let's see if we can make another population growth. That takes a moon drop and a reagent. Moon drop and a reagent and which so when we're done with this so we'll make another spot for a familiar because i don't want i don't want i don't know uh familiar home i assume i can't stack these no i cannot okay um we are making a population growth okay there we go We'll be able to house another familiar. I'll leave this one like this. Dutiful, reliable, and cute. Ooh, we're doing good on Silver Sage, too. So... Uh, I need another healing wave. This is Silver Sage times five. Reagents times one. So we need two more Silver Sage. There we go. And then the Witch. And then that'll heal all of our familiars because we they all need healing. 
And we're making a population growth spell, which is good. Um, we'll put it like um, here, population growth. Okay. I haven't made another celestial link. It's supposed to like speed resource production. Um, okay. Speed this up. There we go. Okay. Now, another familiar home. And... What was the other one that I had there? I don't remember. Celestial Link. Oh, wait. Oh, hold on. Oh, forgot about this. Okay, another moon drop. Um, there we go. 736. Okay, and now... Summoning a familiar, but we can heal all these. Okay, we're gonna heal one here, one here, one here, and one here. And then they also have armor too, which is good. Thumbs up. All right, everyone, all the familiars healed. Now, I could really use a heal for her too. I have four potions, which means I almost get to learn a new spell. We've got a faded familiar. Oh, oh, shoot. Gosh, that happens fast. The doctor is silent. We're at a half moon right now. The recursive armor gives all the extra armor. No, I had to do, um, I had to do right of iron. I had to do right of iron, but I think what it, what it does is the armor cap is increased to double the witch's max health. So I can have armor. I can have armor of, so my max health is four, so I can have eight armor. It's just like a skill. I think that's what that is. I think, I think my brain figured it out somehow, <laughs> somehow. Okay, so we healed again. We have a lot of silver sage. Okay, hopefully it's not I'm making sure I haven't paused any other thing on accident. Okay, no, we're going good. We're doing good. Bring reagents times two. Oh, I hate that. Why are you still in my reagents? <laughs> it's gonna give me moon drops, so that's like okay, but um all right, we got moon drops, we got star drops. Uh oh. Okay, let's let's buy an explore card. We'll have this random familiar explore. Okay, we're almost almost there on the potion for another spell. I really wanted the waypoint spell. Oh, we have two planes now. Not terrible. Uh, actually, that's not bad, because we can get another reagent this way. We got a bog. We don't want... No, we don't want that, because we already have a bog village. Not really what we're looking for. And a crystal deposit. Okay, well, we'll get more crystals. Um... We are... Merchanting out here like crazy. Crystals. We've got a reagent now. I almost got another potion. Silver sage and a crystal. I guess we could go for some more mana. One, two, three. There we go. All right. There we go. Hopefully that'll just keep making mana. <laughs> Ideally. Um, spell. Hi, Zai. 
Fireball spell. Right of Courage Soul Trainer. Mana Reagent Spell Pay. Oh, there we go. Fireball. I like that. Okay. Two mana. Um, one reagent. One spell page. Oh, now we need spell page. Oh, there are reagents down here. Okay, let's bring these up here. And then a witch. We're making a fireball spell. It's a preventative fireball spell. Hello, Moto. How are you, Zai? How are you doing? Okay, we're making rock glems. Okay. I wanted, I was hoping for a second waypoint unlock. Um, okay, the Temple of Rights is. Uh, Temple of Rights is back, baby. Um, I think we're gonna sacrifice. I'm so sorry. We're gonna sacrifice this cute baby. We should make one more familiar. Uh, summon familiar. Mana and a reagent and a witch. Okay, I made a fireball spell. This is for hands off approach to setting your enemies on fire. Struggles to not call out lurkers. It happens. It happens. Listen. If, if, uh,. If we didn't, you know, welcome lurkers here, we'd oof, oof, they'd struggle. I mean, I struggle, but you know. My time zone is not exactly friendly to almost anyone. Okay, so hmm. Do I need any of these things? Like, probably. Okay, so we're summoning another familiar, and then we're going to sacrifice one. <laughs> Poor thing. I was lurking until just now. Well, thank you for lurking. Yeah, I've actually, you know, what's funny, like... Uh... Some... I, I've been talking to some other content creator friends. Like, some people do really struggle with... I'm so sorry I sacrificed you for more... Uh, armor. <laughs> uh, yeah. Some people really struggle with, like, lurkers. Like, the idea of it and that people, like, aren't saying hello. You know what I mean? Um, I have definitely heard that from, like, friends, acquaintances, that sort of thing. So, you're not completely, you're not completely... Off the mark. Okay, so we have a familiar. Um, hmm. She's been doing pretty good with this fairy city. Uh, these potions are slow, man. Oof. Um, I guess I can put like a. Oh. Okay, so somehow I... Ooh, nice. Look at all that. 7.43. I did say I was going to finish stream by 8. So, uh... Uh, clearly I have really enjoyed this game. <laughs> this is... There is a demo. There is a demo on Steam uh, for Witch Hand. And you, uh, it's released on February 7th. Uh, Zai, Zai, did I, did I say, did I say, did I say you could gamble? <laughs> what have you done? Hi, Venom. Uh, <laughs> okay, I feel like I should, uh, hold on. Um, healing touch. I do need to heal myself um two silver sage for healing touch and reagent okay so that'll heal me fully oops sorry <laughs> genuinely worried i did something wrong <laughs> zai you gambled 
Gambled I oh uh oh. The void moves against me. Okay, I'm glad I'm healing right now. Uh oh. Oh go oh gosh. I don't think I can like attack this, right? I can't sacrifice it either, right? No, I think I just all my stream names in while I can. That's it's good. Good shout. Okay, we're healed. We're healed. All's well. Um Okay, let's make some more mana. Okay, I didn't I didn't freeze it. We are whew. Oh, darn. <laughs> Here's a link to demo. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Rain. Yeah, that's a link to this demo. Um, and if you if you have any interest in games like this, wishlist it. I can't remember the other ones. Genuinely same. They're so... Why did I say that? This is a family hole. When, the, when next the sun emerges, so too will the one dwelling within. <sighs> Okay, so I think we're going to use a fireball on this void icicle. Um, and then we're going to... I wonder if I can, like, stack these guys. No, I don't think it stacks. I don't think this stack... Oh, shoot. My bad. Kill it with fire. Throw a fireball. We got a frost crystal. <laughs> yeah, bless these dice with luck. You got one. Let's go. Nice. Cold as ice, freeze an enemy. Maybe that does... Are they stacked? I can't really tell. 14. No, these... I'm not sure. Okay, we're trying to... We need to kill these before the end of the day. Also, this void spike needs to die, but um, it attacks for three, so I'm a little concerned. So, you know what? Here, we're going to attack this void spike, and then we're going to heal. can't remember any more of mine, so I'm going to hit the main ones. Yeah. Those good old... Oof, two void salts. Okay, we're down on health. <laughs> we have a lot of void salts. Let's heal. Let's heal. Healing touch. Seems like time for another heal. Uh, two silver sage. Oh, and we need a reagent, don't we? Oh, heck. Okay, well, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to do this. We're gonna have to recycle some terrain. You look nice and firm. I like this game. We're trying to take out these cocoons. Uh, we're making a reagent. Hello, you look nice and firm. I like this game. Lord. We're not hitting very hard <laughs> over here. I think it, I think it is a cooldown. Uh, I really don't want the cocoon to... Okay, we're almost done. Um, let's fight this void beast. Uh, we're gonna give this to Rosie. Two. Too old school for these say commands? I think there is a say firm. Did it work? So I don't have it in my- for some reason that's not in my ear. Wait, where's my reagent? I need one reagent. Just one. Uh, oh, that took out my- oh no, that took out my armor, like- Permanently. That's sad. Um. Uh. Heal me. Okay, I just need. Uh. Whoops. Okay. Um, let's take this familiar. Has one. Okay. This void cocoon needs to die. 
Okay. It's happening. It worked. Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, this familiar is going to lose its armor, but that's okay. We got boned. We got some void salts. We got more void salts. We got some money. Um... Hopefully we finished off this void cocoon before the end of the day. Okay, we've got a potion too. Second waypoint spell. Yes, done. Second waypoint. Bam. I'm he healed. Partially. First waypoint times two. Capriorn times two. And a witch. Okay, so we need first waypoint times two. I wonder if I need the first waypoint as well. How do I make the first waypoint? Moondrop, mana, and a witch. So this is moondrop, mana. This is uh, making a second waypoint is a good place to stop, I think. Um, hopefully we'll take, uh, hopefully we're taking this out. Okay. Okay. Nice. Okay. This is done. Cocoon's dead. Void salts. We're safe. We're done with done with murder for now. <laughs> done with murder for now. Um so that's nice. Love that. We got a lot of rock glems. Guess we could. Actually, let's take Mo just move her over here. Let's sell some rock lems for some cash. It's gonna take a while. Actually, you know what? Oh, I take that back. I'm sorry. Sorry, I take it back. We're so close to good graces with them. It's gonna double this and we're gonna make... Okay, so we have another first waypoint. So let's take both of these first waypoints and the capri horns and the witch and hopefully all we need is the second waypoint for this location sorry trust me it makes sense i swear <laughs> does definitely um i played this game for four hours Oof. four hours this is, this is great. I, I really like how polished this is. Uh, it is out February 7th. You can play with different... Um, ooh, a letter revive, arrives from my home realm. What a good time. Day 38. Okay. This is my letter. Dear sibling, there are rumors that your continued survival in the ninth has become a problem for the council. I believe you're making them nervous. You were not meant to survive an expedition into the home of our oldest enemy. And how would the council justify their army without the constant threat of the void? Continue to search deeper into the ninth, the source of the void, and the end of days draws near. <gasps> the end of days. Well, thanks for the moon drop, y'all. Uh, cool. Let's sell it. <laughs> thanks. Thanks for that. Uh, the end of days draws near. Okay, that's fine. Uh, I think probably it's all right. So what's the worst they're gonna happen? Okay, second in the ninth. Build the second waypoint. Upgrades purchased. Explore cards to level two. Okay, so now they're 10 coins, but that's fine. Nice. All right, let's buy one waypoint card. <laughs> um buy one waypoint card. We're almost in a good place with them. Uh, we'll sell some flora glems. We have so many of them. Okay, there we go. All right, let's buy an explore card. We'll explore the second waypoint. All right, and this will be the last thing we do. Thank you again for the de to the developer for uh. Oh, sorry, there's a minute and a half ad break right now. All right, we got a gem shard, not usable in this shattered state. Okay. 
are with so many rock limbs. Once we're in good with Fairy City, this one, we'll uh, we'll be able to sell them all over there. Oh, we got a Void Beast. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So I wish I had another... Wait, another Fireball. Wait, hold on. Fireball. Mana, Reagent, Spell Page. Oh, I don't have any Reagents. Or Spell Pages. Okay. Nope. You have to play some video games. Have a great last stream. Thank you. Yeah, I'm heading off, um, too. I swear. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, we've got this Void Beast. I wonder, can you, can you stack? So can you stack? Okay, I'm just gonna let this familiar take him out. All right, and then I'm gonna let this familiar do the last damage. I'm not sure. Okay. All right. Void Beast is done. We got Bone and Void Salts. Perfect. That's the perfect... I think that's the perfect time to... It's the perfect place to save and quit. A game by John Nielsen. That was lovely. What a lovely game. Um... Let's see. So there is a demo. Uh, you can... Here, let me see. Copy page URL. So if you want to play the demo, it's here. Also, uh, wishlist it. Because that helps... That definitely helps developers get higher on the... Uh, higher on the, the rankings for, for, you know, Steam page stuff. I know that's all very... <laughs> I, I explained it very technically. Um... Yeah, that's that was that was a that was a good game. That was a good game. Don't forget the Twitter universe sim. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I usually um I try not to bother too much with Twitter uh, while I stream and stuff. Um, so I'll do that afterwards. I'll take a look at it too. I'll see. I'll see if it looks like something I would um enjoy. I think just like no, no, it's fine. I'm, I'm just uh just thinking out loud. Um. Uh, let's see what else. Okay, I'm gonna end my TikTok live and streaming. I don't even know what this all means. Uh, this live is longer than live videos made by 99% of creators with similar following and content. <laughs> okay. All right. Industry. Perfect timing. Um... Yeah, so I, I streamed, um, I streamed dot age. And then I, um... And then I stopped alive and started again for Witch Hand. I figure okay, so I know there's not much there's not much like audience for indie gaming on TikTok. I mean I'm sure there is somewhere, but what I imagine is that they have like you know, their their content creators. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think there's much I don't think there's much space for indie gaming on TikTok, really. But I figured if there was, then I may as well um record your okay so record your highlights i wonder how i do that i don't really understand i just i don't really understand tiktok live i got six new what does that mean what does that mean hold on sorry i'm looking at a thing <clears throat> there are dozens of them dozens yeah exactly exactly so yeah not not necessarily a huge um not necessarily huge 
audience i mean even on even on twitch as y'all know it's it's still it's like um even on twitch it's still like a whole thing you know uh it's easier it's easier to gain an audience when you're streaming like a bigger game you know like with a bigger with an already like built-in audience but y'all know me i like my indie games um yeah we play dot age today in which hand tomorrow is hopefully um tomorrow is hopefully let me see uh hopefully like a dragon infinite wealth i haven't gotten a key yet um i'm supposed to i was i was offered one so um Uh, but I can't play it until like midstream tomorrow and then I work at five. So it would be like an hour and a half of like a dragon. It'd be like an hour and a half of it. Um, and then I would just play it all on, I would play it on uh, Friday as well. So we'll see. I've heard really good things about it. Um, so I'm hoping that all like works. Out. I'm hoping that all works out. Um, if it doesn't, that's fine. Um, we'll, we'll read, we'll redirect, you know. <coughs> um, yeah. So let's, let's see who's streaming at the moment. I also haven't gotten a, I also haven't gotten a, my Palico yet. I like, I haven't, I haven't purchased a Palico yet. Um, True donated money for me to, to buy one. Watched a LED stream, so good. I'm surprised. I'm surprised. I'm surprised. I thought that the embargo was tomorrow, but maybe they maybe they have a different embargo, and maybe they were. Uh, uh, yeah. So we'll see. Well, we'll see. We'll see if we get. We'll see if we get a hold of it. Um, I do hope so because it does look really cool. It does look really cool. So. Let's see. Uh, sorry, I gotta find a stream. What time is it? It's eight oh two. Oh my gosh, I'm actually rating out when I'm supposed to. My lips are sorry. My lips are so dry. <laughs> um. <clears throat> Let's see. What is everyone doing? What's everyone doing? Pal World. I just, I just don't have NG plus playthrough of an existing game. Oh, new game. Got it. Got it. Oh, like a dragon. Right. Okay, okay. Oh, Juice is playing in Shrouded, which is a new survival crafty game. Let's go. Let's go read Juice. Love the Yakuza series. I've never played a Yakuza game. Um What? Uh but I've watched Lambo play them. A sass lambo and he loves them and <clears throat> someone's gifted me yakuza zero i think i just haven't ever played it i haven't played it yet so let's go let's read juice because he's playing a new survival game called enshrouded i think he did like a steam video for them too um i you know i'm just not into pal world i feel i don't know i don't know it feels weird it's, uh, I don't think it's necessarily a, it's not like an AI game, you know, but like the developers are like big into AI I'm just not, I don't know. I like to, I like to be a fan of the developers, you know, I, <laughs> at least, at least a little bit. I like to be at least a little bit a fan of, um, of like developers for the games I play, you know, sometimes they're, sometimes they're not great, but like, I don't know. I like to, uh, I like to support games that, I don't know. Are we not building Alyssa AI? You know, it's funny. I had someone reach out about that. 
Um, I did actually. Hey, yeah, thanks for thanks for the chats too, Lily. I hope you have a good day. Was it me? Did I reach out? Are you? Oh God, I forget the name. Um, so it sounded interesting. I need to email them back and see what what they like want. Like, as long as they're not going to, like, own my image or, you know, like, retain it for their uses or whatever. You know what I mean? So, we'll see. We'll see. I'm not sure if it would be, like, way, like, too weird or, I don't know. Anyway, let's go say hi to Juice. Prolysin. You know, it's funny. I was going through my boxes. Very, I'm going through very slowly. Why? Tell me Why? I brought this to London. Why? Why did I do this? I don't know. I don't know. Why? Why? How did this end up? How did this end up here? Someone. I'm <coughs> sorry. <coughs> Someone sent, sent me. This must have been like. This must have been like one of the last things I was putting in a box. And I was like, screw it. Put it in the. Put it in the box. I think Den Denikai? Was it Denikai that sent me a pro Promycin mug? So I have one. Here it is. <laughs> Sounds like something he would do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we have it. Um, There are two in existence. Here it is. Does he have the other one? <laughs> there you go. Captain underscore mug instead of donating to the PS5 fund now. <laughs> I deserve that. I deserve that. He does. It was a very limited run. Wow. Gosh. It's like, this is going to be like as valuable as Beanie Babies. Someday. Or, oh, shit. What have you done? What have you done? I don't even have a... I don't even have a fun command for that one. Hold on. Oh, we're gonna find one. We're gonna find one. Oh. You're going to regret this. Where's our song? Is it? Oh, it is playing. Thank you. Oh, it's playing. Oh, it's playing. You love Christmas? I'm so glad. Do you like, do you like uh, watermarks? Watermarks are my favorite. That always gets me ready to celebrate Christmas. Molly, imagine they hated Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> watermarks. Uh, if we send 6,000 bits, it's Listmas again. Honestly, I still have it on 300 bits. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, here we are. Thank you, Prolysin. For the 6,101 bits. That's a lot of bits. That is a lot of them. Only if Den... <laughs> Tenakai sends you my mug. Ah, <gasps> uh, twelve games of Lismas. I still need to do my video. I haven't done it yet. I'm working on it though. I have a few videos. I'm like in the middle of editing. You're gone for entire. Happy Christmas, choosing. Welcome back. 
Well, there's the song. Merry, Merry fucking Christmas. <laughs> okay, we're ready over to Juice. It's, <laughs> yep, we're back. God, I wonder where, I wonder where I'll be 24th December 2024. Who knows? Probably sitting in this chair. Anyway, now it's just, now it's weird without. I almost know how to join a right when you're leaving. It's my favorite skill. <laughs> it's, it's, it's pretty impressive. Uh, industry, industry is pretty good at it too. In Hawaii, sipping a cocktail. I don't know if I want to go. That's far. That's far. Um, okay, we're going to raid Juice because he's playing a survival game. Oh my god. My... <laughs> Jow is cooking... <coughs> cooking like chilies because I'm coughing. Um... We're a juicist. Oh god. Thanks for hanging out. We played uh we played Dot Age, which is a fun new survival game. We played the demo. I don't have the I don't have the game yet. I will. I will. I'll buy it eventually. But I've just I've bought too many games lately. Um and then we played Witch Hand. So I think both of them are by a single dev each. Um and their new games. Dot Age was just released, I think, like a week ago, maybe. And then um, Witch Hand is being released February 7th. So, yeah. Yeah. Thanks for being here. Thank you, Pro, Pro Mycin. Pro Lysen. Of, of Pro Mycin mug fame. Um, thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you for celebrating Christmas with me. Um, we're gonna raid Juice. He's playing <clears throat> Enshrouded, which is a new survival. Speaking of new games, another new game, a uh, new survival crafting game that I think he was. He I think he recorded a. He recorded a video for it too, um, like a video for them for their Steam page. So let's go see Juice. Wait, did we get a Frosty shout out? I think we did. In a world of survival, Juice's TV reigns from Lego landscapes to zombie face-offs. They're crafting hilarity and community vibes. Minnesota's mustachioed maestro of mayhem, Juice juggles rim worlds and raids with a side of birthday bash. Oh, shoot. It was his birthday. Shoot. I forgot. <laughs> I, I failed. Uh, join the A-plus squad for C-plus shenanigans. Will they survive? Stay tuned. All right, thank you all for being here again. If you want to follow my socials, they're there. If, I mean, and my Discord. Follow my shit if you want. You don't have to. Um, go give Justice some love. Here's the raid call. Uh, pick your favorite. <laughs> pick your favorite one, and we'll go say hi to Juice. Thank you everyone for being here today. Um, thank you. <laughs> Thank you, industry, and choosing good timing, coming to say hello. I love that. I love that emote. I'm glad we can have it now. Uh, by Mac, by choosing by industry. Thank you again, ProLyson. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. Um, those bits will go towards uh, more Christmas scenes. <laughs> good luck. Don't be late. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. But everyone go hang out with Juice. Uh, remember to wish list Witch Hand and C the Caribbean sales on sale right now, too. Bye, John Yu. Oh, my gosh. Oh, there's a new thing. All monetized streamers will be able to achieve 60, 40 for 100 plus points for three months. Oh, my gosh. I, I actually do that. Okay. All right. I get it. Sale, sale. Yeah, Caribbean sale is on sale, so you should buy it. Um, all right. I'll see you all. I'll see you all soon. See you tomorrow. Bye.